the owner will pass and see two leaves dropped on the ground after he just cleaned. Not seeing what he just do and know what he'll go back and he ain't cleaning the place, man. Think, think, think. Right, and depending on what is said to someone, it can affect them, you know. And um, it reminds me of this week, this holy week. This holy week, Thursday is the washing of the feet where Christ the Master. What's your take? Bow down and wash the feet of his disciples, showing that a master is supposed to exercise extreme humility when it comes to what? his servants. Especially if you want the best out of the servants. 6524901, we have any conversation this morning. Today, the, uh, the 25th of March. The United Nations observes International Day of Remembrance of Victims of Slavery and Transatlantic Slave, uh, the Transatlantic Slave Trade. Right, it is said that slavery is still alive. What's your take? But in hidden forms. The United Nations advises in order to continue unmasking and identifying and making out these hidden traits of slavery. Whenever we see them and see the perpetrators of them, we must raise the conversations and have the talk, have the chat. In a constructive way, according to Cricks, or um, as my friend from Minnesota, Angela, just says, in an educated way, the conversations need to be had. What do you think? Hi, good morning. Pleasant morning. Pleasant morning. What's up? I'm alive and grateful and happy. Okay. To be able to contribute mm-hmm. to uh, your program and the fact that I am an individual who on my way out. So uh, I have my perspective mm-hmm. and it might be controversial too. So, yeah, but but it's, it's probably how you say it, so I listen in. Good, 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 good. One of the greatest being to the African man is religion. Religion have not, we worship in a God that does not represent us. Check the, the yellow skin man. He has a God that has a history too. That he could go. We have no roots. Let me ask you something now. We don't love the land. Let me ask you something. We, I, I don't mean to interrupt you. I don't mean to be rude and interrupt you. But and I want no, to, you're I, free too. I want, you're free too. I want you to carry on. You could tell me what it is you're telling me here in a calm are we? No, um... I think that is be the problem. I wish why, I could. Why I, wish I, wish I, could. I and, wish I could. And I think that and is be the... Since you point out that... I think that is the... Since you point out that... Uh, hold on, hold on, please. Uh-huh. I think I want to... Um, Step back and see if I could calm myself. Because that is what this gets some people scared now. I had a conversation. The way it is no, being well, said. You see, it's something bubbling inside of you when you when you're conscious, when you reach a level of consciousness. I know, I know. And you want to explode, brother. I know how it is. I know how and, it is. And you Trust see, me. When it touch you, when it touch you personally too. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. When you live it. But, you some, understand? but sometimes, so, sometimes we have to convey calm and cooler. No, because, and listen, listen. All right, all right. Otherwise, a hundred years go pass again, I'm going to be the same thing. Yeah, yeah, it's true, it's true, it's true. So, get, you have to get it okay, I thank you for the calm. opportunity. Yeah, yeah. Um, I, I want to hear what you have to say, you know, bring it to me, calm. No, 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 no. Well, since you pointed out to me, uh-huh. quickly I realize that. So, <laughs> I hear the fire in you too, huh? <laughs> Yes, yes, thank you, thank you. Thank you. That, is, that is the so, important uh, thing. Let me, let me call myself and uh, listen to me. Uh-huh. It is a pleasure. Um, I know found a, um, a wireless that picking up um, mm. what radio. All right. So, uh, you know what I'm saying? So, well, there is a kind of. Well, let me get somebody else a chance. You can call back. Thank you very much. All right, brother. I well, appreciate it. Good. One good, love. Good. Yeah. yeah, so that is what I'm saying too. Sometimes, a lot of the times, there's a fire. What? And if we want to be educated and constructive about these conversations, sometimes calmness might, you know. Hi, good morning. Short and sweet. Good morning, Mr. Fox. Happy birthday. <laughs> thank you, Mr. Fox. Thank you. Thank you. I, I, me- I reach a milestone. One more year to be eight. All right. <laughs> I hear you. This 
topic you have is a very tough, dangerous topic. <coughs> well, today, today, you know, very, to, you know, today is International Remembrance. Right. Right. Okay. It's, you see, most people, like in Trinidad, black people will look at slavery only of the Middle Passage. And right. they would think very deeply of it. True. But slavery is a thing that still exists today. It's all over the world, slavery. But you see, what many people think about is just the equation, the equation of the African um, slave. Mm -hmm. It is something we can think about. It's in the history. It's a good subject, but it's very touchy. Like the guy I just heard, you can hear the, the passion, passion yeah. in his voice. Mm -hmm. Because he felt something more, you see, because... We don't know what these people went through. They went through a lot. Like I can say that's part of my ancestry too. Right. But at the same time, at the same time, we got to look at it. It's in the history now and think positive. True Remembrance is good. It's like your parents die. You lose them. You remember them. It's a beautiful thing to do. Remember the good times. These people had a bad time. Mm -hmm. Sorry about it. But it's something we have to think about. I mean, it's hard to explain. It's very difficult to explain. Right. Okay, it's a touchy subject, and the time is too short that you have to discuss it. Mm -hmm. Mr. Fox, to all the folks down there who wish me happy birthday, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. Have a wonderful day, Mr. Fox. All right. The sun is shining here today. It's mm -hmm. beautiful. No. Okay. And enjoy the rest of your birthday. Now, Mr. Leroy saying it's a touchy topic, and the time that I have is too short to discuss it. But I wasn't really looking to discuss anything about slavery itself you know the question i'm asking is how do you feel when slavery conversations are raised plenty of people are scared to have them a lot of people you know run away from them some people when they raise them they are very fiery and passionate and that is understandable but if you really have to educate people and impart knowledge about slavery so that we could continue unmasking the evil, the hidden traits of slavery that still exist. What is the method to use, to, to, to communicate, to convey the messages? How do you feel when these talks are raised? That is the pertinent question that I am asking. Hi, good morning, short and sweet. Hi, good morning, Foxy. Foxy. Okay, good morning. Yeah, you was asking about slavery, you wasn't asking about religion, right? Exactly. Religion does cause a division in black race, in the black race. Mm -hmm. But there's no yellow God, there's no white God, and there's only one God. Whatever color you want him to appear before you, you can choose whatever color you want him to appear before you. Mm -hmm. What we are talking about is slavery. Slavery is a mental slavery too that's still going on. And a lot of people are hindering themselves because they haven't freed their mind from the mental slavery. Hmm. It's not only the physical slavery. We can deal with the physical slavery. Like when I go to my manager and they tell me to do I said, no, I am not doing it. It's too much work. But because it's another way to will do it, they look at you as rude. Right? Mm -hmm. So I let them know uh -uh, I have rights. And I exercise my life, and they don't play those things with me. So it's all about how you see yourself in your mind. If you see a yellow God, a blue God, then you deal with your yellow and your blue God. There is one God, and there is one King of Kings and Lord of Lords. However color you want to see him to make you feel good in your spirit, mm -hmm. you see him as that. Once you can lead into the right path and do the right things and be honest to yourself and to society, choose whatever color. So if you want to see your God black, then he's black. Because my God is black. Okay? Right. So it's not about religion. It's about how I feel about And I don't have no problem dealing with slavery. I deal with it head on. We don't have to argue about it. But we can be fair about it. Listen to other people's point of view. Mm -hmm. Have a blessed day. All right. Take care. Stay up to date with our hourly news broadcasts right here on WAC 90.1 FM. WACK 90.1 FM. This is News 901 to 8 AM. In the headlines. Businessman charged with $10 million attempted fraud. PSA to legally challenge WASA restructuring again. Regionally, France charters evacuation flights from Haiti. And internationally, 
Russian court charges four men with act of terrorism. With the news in detail, to ATM, I'm Cohen Borney. Good morning. The construction company director is expected to face a high court master on Monday morning, charged with seven counts of uttering a forged document and a separate account of attempting to obtain over $10 million fraudulently. 48-year-old Daniel Wilson is accused of attempting to obtain $10,125,000 by false pretense after presenting a fraudulent check to a commercial bank in Tunapuna. He was arrested by Tunapuna police on March 20th and charged three days later by PC Goom of the Fraud Squad, who led an investigation into a report made by the bank. A police report said Wilson allegedly presented a central bank check and contract documents claiming to be from the Ministry of Works and Transport to open an account. The documents were accepted as genuine but were later found to be fraudulent. An immigration officer is expected to appear before a San Fernando Master's Court on Monday after she was arrested and charged with misbehavior in public office. Lisa Jairam was charged with the offense on March 22, 2024, following the advice from the Director of Public Prosecutions, Roger Gaspar S.C. According to police reports, while conducting inquiries into a report of forged documents, fraud squad officers seized the passport allegedly issued to a foreign national. This passport bore Immigration Division, Ministry of National Security Permanent Residence Status Stamp endorsements. However, upon thorough examination, it was discovered that the permanent residency status had not been legitimately granted by the Minister of National Security. The investigation continued as officers successfully collaborated with a team from the Immigration Division. The Public Services Association, PSA, is planning to file another legal challenge of the Water and Sewage Authority's transformation process. PSA President Leroy Petit said the action has been considered after Public Utilities Minister Marvin Gonzalez said on Saturday that the WASA's top heavy management structure is being tackled in the latest phase of the restructuring program. Cabinet's Human Resource Advisory Committee is reviewing recommendations for compensation packages for 226 new executive leadership positions and Minister Gonzalez said once approved, an announcement will be made almost immediately. The PSA leader made it clear that the aim is not to stop the restructuring process but to challenge government's approach, which he described as anti-trade union and anti-worker. He also expressed concern that many people have been working in WASA for more than 21 years and do not have a first appointment. He said the PSA has been trying to meet with WASA's management to fill the vacancies and regularize people's status. The mother of the 15-year-old Venezuelan boy who was awarded $2.4 million in damages after being detained at the heliport as an illegal immigrant for 450 days is now in the process of filing a judicial review of the heliport, calling for it to be shut down as a detention center for immigrants. Gerald Ramdi, an attorney representing the mother and child, made the revelation. He said the mother has called for the closure of the heliport, coming out of the evidence that came out of the boy's case. On Friday, Justice Margaret Mohammed ordered that the defendants in the case, the Chief Immigration Officer and the Attorney General of Trinidad and Tobago, pay the boy the sum of $900,000 in general damages, $500,000 as aggravated damages and a million dollars in exemplary damages. Rambin said the heliport continued to operate as a detention center, meaning that several children continue to be taken to the center under terrible conditions. Rambin said in the judicial review of the heliport, the judge may have to review thousands of documents. The mayoral constituency executive of the United National Congress is supporting political leader Kamala Posad Bisesa and has distanced itself from the statements and actions of MP Rushton Parry. In a statement after Parry challenged the party's leadership to hold national executive elections by June, the mayoral executive said they stand firmly and resolutely in support and endorsement of its political leader Kamala Posad Bisesa and the national executive. It can also attest to the fact that the party has been founded upon strong and resilient democratic principles and traditions which has never been compromised. Responding in a statement to the mayor executive's move, Paris said they were exercising their democratic right to have a position on any party matter. However, he said the rights of the thousands of ordinary members to have the constitutionally due national executive elections they called must be respected. The Senate will debate the Property Tax Amendment Bill 2024 when it sits at the Red House this afternoon from 1.30 p.m. The bill was passed in the House of Representatives on March 18th by a vote of 20 to 15. Regionally, 
France is organizing government charter flights from Haiti to help its nationals seeking to leave the Caribbean country, which has been gripped by gang violence. About 1,500 French nationals are registered with a French embassy in Haiti, which has seen waves of attacks by rival gangs, including raids on police stations and the international airport. France's foreign ministry said in a statement that the evacuation flights were being organized with the defense ministry to enable the most vulnerable nationals to leave the country. Internationally, Russia's charged four men, it says, attacked a Moscow concert hall and killed at least 137 people. Three were marched, bent double into a Moscow court, while the fourth was in a wheelchair. All were charged with committing an act of terrorism. The Islamic State group or ISIS said it carried out Friday's outrage at Crocus City Hall and posted video. Russian officials have claimed without evidence Ukrainian involvement. In sport, the West Indies women team will play three ODIs and five T20s against Pakistan women at the National Bank Stadium in Karachi from April 18th to May 3rd. The three ODIs will be played on the 18th, 21st and 23rd April with a T20 series scheduled between April 26th and May 3rd. The ODIs are part of the ongoing ICC Women's Championship 2022-2025 to which determines qualifiers for the ICC Women's Cricket World Cup in 2025. West Indies are currently ninth on the table on eight points with the top six qualifying automatically. The T20 series will take place just ahead of the ICC Women's T20 World Cup in Bangladesh in September. And Pakistan fast bowler Mohammad Amir made himself available for the upcoming 2020 World Cup on Sunday, more than three years after retiring from international cricket. The left arm bowler announced his international retirement at the age of 28 in December 2020 saying he could no longer play under the management and that he was being tortured mentally. That's a look at news to ATM. Recap in the headlines, businessman charged with $10 million attempted fraud, PSA to legally challenge Wasser restructuring again, regionally France charters evacuation flights from Haiti, and internationally Russian court charges four men with act of terrorism. That's a look at news, the ATM on WAC 90.1 FM. You can get more news online at wwwwacradio 901fmcom Join us at 12 noon for another major newscast. I'm Kerwin Borneo. Good morning. Since God made Adam in the heart of Eden. This post carnival season. WAC Radio 90.1 FM and WAC.TV are diving deep into the heart of our culture. With the most powerful message calypsos of this season. And all you're hearing from those in authority Boasting how they're going to boost the economy Yet so many of us live in poverty Join us as we celebrate the stories, the laughter, the critiques, and the soul of our nation to the voices of our calypso. For all who want to see me retire, I'm kicking butt and still spitting fire. I'm like a truck with the engine of Nowhere else but on WAC 90.1 FM. Just like Rose Nelson Kitch. Move and singing in pitch. Look, friend, don't get me in a rage. Broadcasting from the south side of Trinidad and Tobago, we are Black Radio 90.1 FM, the true nation station.
wow, 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 wow. And that drama. That drama. If I think who it is. Any of big up Fusion Steel? Fusion Steel Steel Orchestra. I uh, gotta say good morning to Opal, good morning to DK, uh, Darren Shepard, the whole gang. Big up Enwa as well. I wanna say good morning to Mammy Melville. 14 minutes now after the hour of 8 o'clock. And um, I just want to piggyback a little bit to the topic this morning. All right, I'm not going to open, reopen the lines for it, but I just want to say something. Um, all right, so if you're just joining me, a pleasant good morning to you. The topic this morning, in the last hour, was... Um, all right, so today the United Nations and the world observes International Day of Remembrance of Slavery and the Transatlantic Slave Trade. Right, on that note, the United Nations uh, Secretary General gave an address a few days ago, and one component of that address he advised in order to continue unmasking and revealing the hidden traits of slavery that exist today, although slavery has been abolished approximately 200 years now. But in order to continue revealing the, 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 the forms of slavery that exist today, we must raise the conversation of slavery for the purpose of educating people about slavery so that they can become more aware or that they don't forget or they are reminded so that the respect that that we, we, we demand, we need could be given. The conversations need to be consistent. So I asked the question, how do you feel having slavery conversations because plenty of people run away from them especially here in Trinidad and Tobago plenty of people doesn't want to have them they feel awkward you know you feel like weird some people would have them boldly and, and a lot of the people who have them boldly the slavery conversations their passion their zeal eat them up that is quite understandable it is understandable because when you think about what happened in slavery it will piss off anybody, you know. Get you angry. But if we if we have if we have to have some some meaningful results in terms of keeping people away and putting our foot down on the evil forms of slavery that still exist today, then the conversations have to have meaning, meaning that whatever we are trying to communicate in those conversations should be conveyed successfully from 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 the the person who's carrying on the conversation to the audience and um, i think we need to cultivate we need to find ways to be calm about it saying the same thing you know contain the passion and get the message across so that 50 years from now 100 years from now 10 years from now Five years from now, we could start to see some change in terms of respect, people respecting each other in this cosmopolitan space that we live in. You know what I mean? You understand what I mean, right? Yeah. Think about it. Think about it. Think about it. Because if we don't do that, if we don't come up with ways to execute and get the message across properly, we could be in the same position five years from now, ten years from now. Just bickering and arguing and, you know, set a anger built up inside and anger is just poison your soul, you know. Anger is only poison your soul. Call to Crazy Radio 90.1 FM, 20 minutes after 8 o'clock. Good morning, my beautiful people. I'm going to take a short break and come back with more. I want to say good morning to my brethren, taxi driver around the city, Rowley. Yeah, it's about taxi driver who just drive Koki to Sandu named Rowley around the city. I don't know if you related to the Prime Minister. <laughs> that is my boy from a long time. 
Good morning to KLS and Rory on the uh, St. Madeline to San Fernando Road. Going to take that break and come back to you. Keep it locked. Broadcasting from the south side of Trinidad and Tobago, we are WAC Radio 90.1 FM, the true nation station. This Easter Sunday, March 31st, at the Cipriani Labor College, Valsane, I Am Jazz Festival presents Jazz is Blue, featuring saxophone sensation Mike Phillips, Elan Parley, Len Booksy Sharp, Nisa, Irvin Alves, Marcus Hippolyte, and more. Come and see our unique artisans and interact with your favorite artist. Tickets are available at Simon's Musical Supplies, Crosby's, King's Lounge, Barber Spa, Arima, and Movie Town. Port of Spain, Sasu in Mid Centre Mall, Sion's Bar, I Live for Glam Val Park Shopping Plaza. Gates open at 4 30 pm. Showtime is 5 pm. Wear something blue. Bring a friend or two. Sponsored by King's Lounge Barber Spa, Clinical Media Group, Mount Irvin Bay Resort, Blue Water, Carrot Brewery, Duft Hair Products, Prodal Sound, Music TT, and Professional, The Lullaby Group, and Blind Effects. Thoughts proceed go to the Diabetes Association of Trinidad and Tobago. For more information, call 386-4748 or 380-1222. I am Jazz Festival. Jazz is me. The United States is consistently ranked among the best internationally for its competitiveness. Are you planning to start a new business or branch of your business in New York? Attend our Chamber Coalition's five-week webinar series, Small Business Sense Bootcamp. We provide education and business preparation for small business owners and startups. Learn the basics of business planning, how to finance your business, business credit, marketing, and social media strategies, small business solutions, legal, tax, accounting, banking, and insurance, and how to do business within New York City, New York State, and corporations. Register at startupsbootcamp.eventbrite.com. Spiritual Baptist Faith presents on Friday, 22nd March 2024, our first open air service at Isaac Junction, Coover at 7 p.m. Our dress code is National Colors. Come and hear some dynamic men and women of God expound the gospel of Jesus Christ. On Monday, the 25th of March 2024, the following activities will take place. Opening of the second entrepreneurial village at 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Men of Balov service, 7.45 p.m. to 9 p.m. Dress code blue. Tuesday, the 26th of March 2024, exhibition which commences from Tuesday to Thursday, 28th March 2024, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Entrepreneurial Village, Tuesday to Saturday, from 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. DOC Presentation, Tuesday to Thursday, 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Youth for Christ, Dress Code White, starts at 6 p.m. Wednesday, the 27th of March, 2024, Woman of Substance Service, the time is 6 p.m., Dress Code Pink. Thursday, the 28th of March, 2024, Myla Spiritual Baptist Experience. Starts 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The Spiritual Baptist Diaspora Service. Time is 6 p.m. Dress colored. Saturday, the 30th of March, 2024. Spiritual Baptist Liberation Day Service. Which commence at 9 a.m. Dress code colored. All events will take place at the Administrative Building, Balmain, Kuva. See you there. Trinidad and Tobago. You see, Gloria, Saturday, Saturday, the 30th of March, San Fernando would never be the same again. Because everybody heading to Asselis by the park. Because Carib Street Boys and Wilkies presents the annual Back in Times party with the best DJs in the land. Featuring Peter, Alpha B, Mr. Desmond, and of course, yours truly, Mr. Q. Starting time is 9 p.m. and we dancing all the way till dawn. Admission is $80, two-on-one tickets for $140. And at the door, you pay more. For more information, you can call Atelier's by the Park, Sion's Bar, that's on Royal Road. And of course, you can get your tickets from Wilkie's, 620-3169. That number again is 620-3169. Remember, we're dancing down at Atelier's by the Park. It's another Carib Street Boys and Wilkie's. 
Promotion. San Fernando, we coming. Start the week right. Join us every Monday for Wellness Mondays. We'll help you be the best you can be, body, soul, and spirit. Wellness Mondays, only on WAC 90.1 FM. Okay, so we're back. It is uh, 26, yeah, 26 minutes after the hour of... 8 o'clock right here atop your dial 90.1 fm wellness monday and i got some foods for you that you can try out maybe you 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 already use these as a part of your diet all right these foods cleanse your kidney apple cider vinegar apple cider vinegar is effective in preventing oxidative stress of the kidneys because of um, the antioxidants uh, kidney beans or red beans lemon juice watermelon pomegranate basil basil minty and strong but good for cleaning out the, uh, the kidneys dates and dandelion if you didn't know well you know something this morning for your kidneys right so to clean them out 27 after 8 o'clock the time is rolling and I want to say uh, happy birthday once again going out to Mr. Leroy in upstate New York coming from Gale from Boston uh, also happy birthday going out to Michael Beckles that is Gracie from Union Hall's grandson celebrating his 10th birthday today he now starts to live <laughs> happy birthday Michael and also uh, sending birthday greetings going out to Isaac Graham who is 71 years today and his mom also celebrates her birthday today uh, Elmina Graham who is celebrating her 94th birthday she's 94 today her son Isaac is 71 today they're from Maruga and today is their birthdays all right it's coming from the family uh, from your family and from us here at 90.1 FM Culture Crazy Radio happy birthday Isaac and Elmina God bless you guys I want to say good morning to Miss Esther B. and Charles and Miss Teresa B. and good morning to Lynnett Alexis in Virginia. Uh, good morning to Island Vic, all the way in New Jersey. Karen Digeness, good morning to you. Good morning to Karen and Mark in Maryland. Uh, good morning to Miss Anne St. Hilaire in Faisabad. Good morning to Joycelyn Peters in Shogonas. Good morning to Jade in Shogonas. Good morning to Sydney in Penal. Good morning to Kenneth Stewart. Good morning to Charmaine Henry. Dennis Dean, good morning. Good morning to Ave Maria. Good morning to Joe Van Dong, Maiden Street. Good morning to the guys. And uh, checks other supplies on Cipero Street. Here comes a little something from Aibo right now.
And if this one didn't make you dance, I'll show you dance mentally. Dance in your mind. It's Big Brand from Ibo. Ah, sweet music. 8.32. And guess what? Right now I have uh, a Foxy's treasure for you. My Foxy's treasure for you this morning. And it's coming from... Cecil Humes, the maestro. This one is called Black Identity. Right here atop your dial, 90.1 FM. Culture Crazy Radio. Presently, almost everybody talking about black identity. But if you check out the majority, they're only using these words falsely. Because the first thing that is a shame African people with European name That is the first step we had to take To correct a prehistoric mistake If you hear Sichar and Ramkela and Lalch and Balchan Well bet you like that is a East Indian man Jose Juan Gonzalez Manuel Sancho Pablo you show them fellas from Mexico So why my name couldn't be the Gaka Lumumba, Makiba, Kenyatta If we use these names Then we sure to be On this stairway to true black identity your steps from the start you find them play an important part for if you did some great thing in history they might want to record your activity but if you name Hodgkinson or Graham no one could tell that you were a black man so this is why it's an important factor to use the names of your African ancestors Ran, be ran, oh, love, eh, ha, Baba, oh, Mustafa. Well, you sure them fellas come from Arabia? Rommel, Kalten, Bruna, Dolph, Fitch, Hovum, Von Eichmann. Well, bet you hand them voices, Joe, man. So why your name could be Mokutu? Kasa, Fubu, go on, oh, Chuku. Change your name from George Weeks to Wakamba. So we could know that you see you as for black power. Now no African should be reluctant. In the slave trade many years ago And these present names you must understand You contributing to slave time tradition Nam Fong Shou Chan in Tang Si Tong Wang You look long pingly Well then you show them fellas is Chinese Vladimir Kosygin Khrushchev Mikoyan Kowalski Well them is Russian men naturally so why my name couldn't be that Juma? Tafawa, Lumumba, and Puma. Change your name from chalk dust to pygmy bus. So we could know that you really are pro conscious. Broadcasting to the world. We are Culture Crazy. W-A-C-K. My pick hit for today is... Johnny 
Soon as trouble, but he poor man to survive. But just when you're moving forward, things could take a no time. Still we keep persevering, aiming for the top. Seeking to be the best we can, and we never stop. Don't rest on your laurels, cause the tax man coming at you. Just mind your belongings, despite all that you went through. Target in your property as a way to raise money. You better wake up, open your eyes and sing the chorus with me. Axe the tax, axe the tax. Too much pressure on people's backs, we can't pay no property tax. Face the tax, and axe the tax. Yeah, we under attack, so we demand your roll back the tax, yeah. Boy, boy. The wealth of the nation, in the hands of a few. But when the cash run down, guess who they coming to? It's like squeezing an orange. And still coming back tomorrow. That is the parasitic arrangement for the poor. When there's greed without boundaries, nothing can satisfy the thirst. Barely a case of civilization in reverse. And while the poor just suffer, and some can't see the way, others living in obscene luxury. And that's why I'm here to say. Axe the tax, axe the tax, what an insensitive act, just draconian property tax. Face the tax, and axe the tax, yeah, we under attack, so we demand your roll back the tax, yeah. Roll it back, roll it back, the people survive. Still in recovery Victims of genocide Set free from slavery No hint of an apology For this atrocity Neither for we For we in the Afro community Dispossessed of our birthright This place we belong to And you who talking about justice We can't hear from you Without reparation or compensation, the people can't see we wait, and that's why I'm here to say, ask the tax, ask the tax, what a disrespectful act, this violent business attack. This the tax, you better ask the tax, yeah. And this one brings us to... 841, that's the voice of Naruki. Yeah. It's called the Axe. Roll it back. Roll it back. And it's time. Name that song. Yeah, it's time. I want to say good morning to Auntie Patsy and the Kali's family. It's time, all it's time. Good morning to Miss June Chinapu. Uh, good morning to. Love Like Dove in Takarigua. Good morning to David Watley in North Carolina. All right, so here the song I want to let to try and guess for me this one. Let's see if you could figure out this song for me. What's the name of this song? Name that song. That is more than enough, right? I think I give you like more than five seconds there, so. <laughs> what do you want to again? Name that song. You get plenty there. 
Where's your name, Adaso? Hey, Karen. Where's your name, Adaso? Let me, let, me, let me run it one second. Good morning to Veronica Lewis. What's the name of this song? Name that song. Good morning to Miss Harvey and Monry Poe. Good morning to Dr. Simone. Good morning to Miss Rose. Where's the name of that song? All right, here, read one more time. Name that song. Hi, good morning. Name that song. Good morning, Foxy. Stephen, what's this scene, bro? Everything cool. Talk to I me. I called the wish. Mm -hmm. I called the wish, Mr. Leroy of Peace, New York. A happy birthday today. I hear that. All right, and I'm sure he's here and you're right now too, so Alright, All right, have a blessed day, bro. Now Stephen is the man who just figure out most of these songs. And look what he called me for to wish Mr. Leroy a happy birthday. He didn't even make an attempt to try to figure out the name of this. That means this real hard this morning. I come good. Good morning to Lystra in Egypt. Name that song. Where's the name of that song, Ole? Hi, good morning. Name that song. Good morning, Mr. Pop. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know if you write some name, but I know it's going to be singing Trinidad and Tobago. You don't know what? Where you don't know? The slow. Where you say you don't know? <laughs> wait, wait, did you say you didn't know? <laughs> Trinidad. <laughs> you, you don't know Trinidad? Yeah, I didn't know I live in Trinidad. Trinidad oh, oh you, you didn't know that? <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, Mr. Fox, have a good day. Have a blessed I day. I don't know what kind of thing is that. Anyhow, let's try to see if they could figure out the name of this summer, please. Six five two four nine zero one. Look my pad now, Wendell boy. Good morning to Wendell from Connecticut. No Wendell, Wendell. That, that song is not Runaway. Hi, good morning. Name yeah, that good song. Morning, Foxy. Calling with the answer for your riddle. Mm -hmm. The atmosphere became very tense. Hmm. <laughs> Later. All right. Have a blessed one. Time now eight forty five. 15 minutes to go before 9 o'clock. All right, last, again, uh, this is the last time I've given it to you guys to listen to. Name that song. All right, let me see if I get two more callers. Just to get the right name of this song. Up to now, nobody didn't say the right name of this song, eh? 6524901. What is the correct name of that song? I want to say good morning to Maria Santana and her colleagues at the Ministry of Works in Chaguanas. Uh, if you're calling from outside of TNT, you can try 1786-292-2789. Good morning to Scala in Ontario. Good morning to Terrace 007 in Florida. Good morning to uh, Diane Cox in Stone Mountain, Georgia. Good morning to Sherry and G. Haynes in Georgia as well. All right, I've taken win this morning. I've taken win this morning. About oh, Trinidad, Trinidad, what? The name of the song is Trin Bego. I win fair and square. Good morning to Sharon Hewitt. Voice of Tony Prescott. Cool Burn out the flies and all them bees them. I don't really care what the people want to see. Under the trees with the cool breeze, they burn out the flies and all them bees, them. Trinidad and Tobago is a twin island where people we live as one, yeah. Well, in case you never know, it's a small island with down in the Caribbean, yeah. If you want a party with plenty women, welcome to Trinidad. Welcome to Trinidad. 
welcome to Trinidad. If you want wine and plenty, woman, welcome to Trinidad. Welcome to Trinidad. Welcome to Trinidad. For the big, big, big relaunch of A Taste of Madness at Twilight Restaurant and Bar in Scarborough on April 13th, 2024. Don't miss an electrifying night with the Calypso King of Toronto, Connector, Nikita, Curtis B, Daryl the Steel Pan Man, and the sensational Jew. Accompanied by Toronto's finest Tassa drummers with DJs, the enforcers, and selector Ombi. And hosted by the big band Taste of Madness. Remember, it's the relaunch of Taste of Madness. Win a door prize of a microwave. Started at 9 p.m. Tickets are $40. Book now on eventbrite.ca Taste of Madness and tasteofmadness.com Come and join the unforgettable madness. It was nice, so we're doing it twice. Join us for the WAC Meet and Greet in Ocala. We're celebrating the 20th anniversary of WAC 90.1 FM at Myron Oaks Community Center in Ocala on Saturday, June 15th, the Father's Day weekend from 6 p.m. Dress code is white with a touch of red. Come and meet Mr. Feely, the CEO of WAC Radio, your favorite radio station. You make the wrong choice. That's for singers with them. Music for Dancing by DJ Richard C. of WAC Radio. All-inclusive tickets, singles $40, couples $75. Book your ticket for the WAC Meet and Greet now. Call Shortman at 813-263-2127 or Dance Boy at 917-753-3123. Get discount and hotel accommodation. Call 352-261-0024. Mention WAC 90.1 F. It was nice, so we're doing it twice. Hello, Miss Tafili. Broadcasting from the south side of Trinidad and Tobago, we are Black Radio 90.1 FM, the true nation station. Because no race has the last word on culture and civilization. They do not know what we are capable of. They do not know what we are thinking. 
Because my work has only just begun. Up you mighty people, up you mighty people, up you mighty, up you mighty, up you mighty. Feel it down in your soul. Till you can't control it. Put your hand up to the sky. Mama, don't ask why. In these dark and lonely times, we go turn it tight. If you're looking for a sign, turn and look inside of you. Your body is a temple. Your sweat is holy water. Every move you're making is praise unto the master. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Out of the archipelago, we have soul and colorful for soul. But them mashing up, we good living, we don't live so. Call your neighbor, them. Why's me name again? State your claim again. Tell them we go rain again. Because you're powerful, powerful inside, outside, wonderful, magical. That is the name of the song right there. Mighty People. Free Tongue Collective and Sheriff. In collaboration. And we reach, boy. We reach, we reach, we reach. Final. The final the last stretch here. Of the road this morning. The road. With me and you on it. Until tomorrow, please go on. Alright, so let's deal with the riddle quickly. What happened when past, present, and future walked into the restaurant and end up bouncing up each other? Somebody said it. The place got tense. It was tense. You understand? Uh, past, uh, present, and future. Yeah, the place was tense. <laughs> right. So that's the answer to the riddle this morning. Good morning to Lennox and I, Paul. Good morning to KG. Good morning to Mary Andrews. Good morning to Anthony Manwaring. Lorna Lewis, good morning. The place became tense. All right, so, um, just leaving you with some food for thought this morning before I get on out of here. Always remember the most essential factor in life is persistence. Uh, persistence is the determination never to allow your energy or your enthusiasm to be dampened by discouragement. All right. Food for thought. Remember it. Run with it for today, okay? Lost in the rhythm. Lift up the spirit. Leaving you with Jimmy October. Like this one is called Healing. 90.1 FM Culture Crazy Radio. This is how we roll. Each and every day. Peace, I'm out.
lift up my spirit High up like the ceiling Calling out the village Let me hear you sing it Hile, 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 hile I am not hile Give me the power, let it rain Point one FM focused beyond Trinidad and Tobago. We are culture crazy. W A C K. Stay up to date with our hourly news broadcasts right here on WAC ninety point one FM. Dominating the coverage of news in the Southland and nationwide. WAC ninety point one FM. Good morning, I'm Kerwin Borney and welcome to Community News 901 and WAC. Six people are in custody after an estimated 3.8 kilograms of marijuana was found in St. Augustine. The six were arrested in an operation held by officers of the North Central Division which took place between 10 p.m. on Saturday and 3 a.m. on Sunday morning. The officers made their way to a home along Benny Lane off Dukasing Street where they went to execute a search warrant for drugs in the name of a 45-year-old man who is known to investigators. At the time, police found six persons at the home between the ages of 20 and 45, including a 36-year-old woman. The warrant was executed and during a search of the premises, the drugs were found. As a result of the find, all six people who were at the home at the time were detained. A 74-year-old man was assaulted during a robbery in Barataria. The victim told police that around 6.30 a.m. on Friday, he was walking along 7th Avenue Malik Barataria when he was confronted by a man not known to him. The suspect began beating the victim, hitting him repeatedly about the body. He then pushed the victim to the ground and relieved him of his cash and wallet. The suspect then fled the scene. The police were notified and officers from the Sawa police station responded. The victim was observed to be bleeding from injuries to his body and was taken to medical treatment. PC was is continuing inquiries. St. Augustine MP Khadija Amin said something must be done to address safety issues after another murder was recorded in the St. Augustine area on Friday. In a statement, Amin expressed concerns over the lack of safety in the constituency. She said something must be done as this is the 129th murder for the year and the increase of weapons and presence of high-powered guns have residents living in fear for themselves and their children. The MP expressed her frustration after numerous appeals for meetings with the Minister of National Security as well as the Commissioner of Police have been unsuccessful. She added that the recent murder at Freeman Road Extension St. Augustine occurred in close proximity from the location of the police town meeting at the Tunapuna Hindu School at the earlier. According to police reports, on Friday night, 39-year-old Ryan Dogman of Tunapuna was shot and killed and another injured when a suspect got out from a vehicle and opened fire. An activity at the Paparo Mud Volcano has slowed down for now, the Office of Disaster Preparedness and Management has said after monitoring the site over the weekend. The ODPM issued a statement on Sunday noting a marked reduction in the noise and the release of mud and gas from the volcano. Access to the area is restricted while the volcano remains active. It said other agencies, including the Kuva Tabaki Talpara Regional Corporation's Disaster Management Unit, the Princess Town Regional Corporation, and the Environment and Management Authority, as well as petroleum geologist Xavier Munan of Touchstone Exploration, are also monitoring activity at the site. The site remains called North, and security patrols have been conducted by municipal police and the Trinidad and Tobago Police Service. The public is therefore advised once again to avoid venturing in close proximity to the volcano. And that's a look at Community News 901 on WAC. Join us tomorrow for another edition. You raise me up. As we embrace the season of renewal and reflection, WAC Radio 90.1 FM and WAC.TV invite you to a musical journey that transcends the ordinary. Bring it splashy and dashy like water. God tell me bring fire. Somebody's this Lent and Easter, let's embark on a soulful exploration of hope, rejuvenation, and the sheer joy of gospel, jazz, and uplifting music. Whether you're at home or on the move, make us your cultural soundtrack to your life. Jesus in your life, you will be dismayed. I know that I never ever do it that again. I let them all. Can I help a little more? 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 
in the line with Damian Melville. This is my prayer for my brothers who are out there in the world receiving the glory of men with God that's unheard. This is my prayer for my sisters who are out there in the world receiving the glory of men with God that's unheard. Father, you're in the line with Damian Melville. Help your children, don't let them fall. To love one another, heaven might find a fate in their hearts. Cause Jesus is love forever. Always remember that you saw. Always remember that you felt you're wonderfully made by God. You're a child of Jesus Christ the Lord. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Always remember that you saw. Always remember that you saw. Beautiful. Always remember that you saw. Always remember that you saw. Wonderfully made by God. You're in the line with Damian Melville. Wack 90.1. FM, FM, FM. Good morning, my name is Evan. Lord, thank you for your abundant, abounding grace. Thank you that we don't have to earn a drop of the mighty river of grace that flows freely for us today. Thank you for the unexpected, unmerited favor you've showered on my life. Help me put myself in the path of your love and grace. Help me not neglect the disciplines I need to meet with you regularly and to drink from the water of life. Thank you for your rich love. Amen. You will make a way. You have always made a way, God.
Good morning, good morning. 11 minutes after 9 o'clock. Wanna say much now? Going out to Cohen Fox Travel safely, brother. Yeah. As we say, good morning, blessings yeah. of beautiful Twin Island Republic of Trinidad and uh, Tobago. Blessings to all our Caribbean brothers and sisters, our UK family, US, Canada, as far as Australia. Yeah. Blessings to the Wack Fan Club family, Shortbox family, WhatsApp, YouTube, Facebook, whichever platform you're logged on to. Wack.tv. Good morning to you. Oh, oh, oh. Good morning to the original back in Alco. What's up, Joni? Auntie Patricia. The miserable could be golden girls. And of course, much blessings going out to my mother, Miss Joyce Lynn Melville. And to my entire family, blessings after blessings in your special name. Hey, what's up, Melo? Good morning, Mr. What's up, Destiny? Good morning, Pirate. Miss Linda across the road, boy. Good morning. Good morning, EJ Village Point 40. Good morning, Point 40. Good morning, Lakeview. Good morning, Miss Gemma and Lakeview. Spicy morning. Oh, oh. It's a beautiful morning, yeah. And from my window to the world, 129C Coffee Street in San Fernando. It's awesome. It's an awesome Monday. Trust that you're having a beautiful day. And if you have lost a loved one, we are sending all comfort, blessings, and condolences to you and your family at this time. You're not feeling 100%. We trust that that turns around. Speedy recovery and blessings. What a send out special, special blessings to to mommy, dongs, and the family. Man. Yeah, blessings after blessings and covering plenty of love all the time. To you guys. Yeah. If you're celebrating your anniversary, say happy anniversary to you. And if you're celebrating your birthday, well, happy, happy birthday blessings to you. Long life and many, many, many more to come. Mm-hmm. Whoever, whatever you're going through at this time, man, God's blessing. Yeah, God's blessing. Put him first and everything falls into place. Yeah, and he always makes a way for you. Some days high. Some days high. Some days high. And you better believe it. But I will not give up. No, I won't let go. I know. God will make a way for me. Yeah. Oh, I did troubles on the left. Troubles on the right. Trust in you, oh God. I know I'll be alright. I know. God will make You know why, right? You will always make a way. Hey, good morning, Mom's Janet. Good morning, Daddy Rennie. Let's your morning. It's your Culture Crazy Radio. 15 after 9 o'clock. Hey, good morning, Julia. Bajan Connection. Good morning, Mom, uh, Mom's Miriam. Daddy Elon. Got your back. Hi, good morning, you live. Good morning, Danny. Yes, ma'am. How is you? Eyes up very good, you know. You sure? Yeah, ma'am. Oh, because like, I know, you know, I just asked you a question. Just for yeah, Somebody yeah, tell you yeah, something yeah. or somebody tell you something yeah. different? Yeah, 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 but I tell you just now. To all my right. family, my friends, all over the world, blessed, blessed, blessed month coming down, ending of the month to enter a brand new month. 
Blessings, blessings, blessings. Mommy Melvin, love and blessings to you, my lady. From the moon and back, and to everybody. Vivian? Yes, ma'am. All right. You have a good one, eh? You do, eh? Yeah, yeah what do you mean? <laughs> I have it real good. Real good. Love you. April, yeah. All right. Uh -huh. <laughs> what? 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 No, no, no. How about this? How about this? <laughs> Hey, what's up, ST? Good morning. Good morning, Jen, Jen, the JCP, and more family. Blessings after blessings. Hey. Mommy, Mama, see you. How are you doing, Daddy? See you. Mommy, Mama, Sandy, good morning. Hi. Mommy, Dad, and Mommy, and Daddy Preto. Understand that Daddy, Daddy Preto celebrated. Blessings after blessings, you know. Hi, good morning, you're live. Hey, good morning, good morning. Love and blessing to my wife, family. I'm wishing each and everyone a blessed and a holy week, Damien. Peace, love, and blessing to you, Moy and wifey. Washy, washy. Blessings to you. Hey, good morning, big brother Russell. You can party, but Moses, you can do this. Hi, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I heard my name now, so you know how to call and say good morning Just to right. you and good morning to the world. But I want to remind you of something. Mm. I know April is a very Special month, right? Right? Yeah, no, and yeah, she is, I didn't reply because you just say very is a very, very, very special month. So, oh, that oh, was, oh, oh, oh yeah. okay, a very, 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 very special month. But right next to April is me. Serious? Me as of now. A very special, 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 special month. Also. I didn't self realize. At I just want to tell, I just want to remind I you. I didn't that. Even realize I, that it happened. I, I, you didn't realize it happened. Come month. on, come on. I was it there. April. <laughs> April and May, right next door, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning to everyone. Auntie Patsy, morning, darling. Gail, morning. Jenjen, morning. And to everybody else under the listening who's hearing my voice. Good morning. Have a wonderful Monday. Bless Bye you. Bye, Dave. All righty. Bye, April <laughs> and me. <laughs> you, provide you provide all my needs. Through the storm, I will. Hi. Hmm. Hi. Good morning. You're live. Hi. Good morning, April. Oh, sorry. April. <laughs> Hi, Damien. Good morning to you, Mel. We birthday's coming up in April. So we start on the food. Just right. Right. And we have to spend the whole April month wishing ourselves. A That's what we day. do. That's what we roll. That's what we roll. You know, you realize all of them now catching on. Everybody know. I celebrated for the month. Uh, they didn't have a clue. Yeah. They didn't have a clue about that. That's an April yeah. thing. That's an yes, April, April thing. We know that. You right? understand? Yes. So I want to say <laughs> hi to Sabi and Russell from Cuba. And may they, have a, may they have a blessed day today. All the Waconians who have birthdays and anniversary, may they have a blessed week. And may you reach home safe and be blessed for the whole month of April. Just right. Okay, Blessings to I you. listen to you until you over. All Bye. right. Say good morning to Mr. Mendoza for me. I will. Just right. Hey, good morning, Carly and Green. You come there, family. What's up, Vivi? Good morning, God. Good morning, Jamie. What's up, in? Good morning, Denise. Hey, good morning to the Junction crew, man. The Mon Diablo family, good morning. Yeah. Mom Sally, what's up? When is the next Polori making? Uh, yeah, the best Polori maker ever, though. Anyway, you... Mon Diablo, though. Hi, good morning. Good morning. I'm glad I take the empty work away from you. <laughs> so, I'm glad to everybody coming in. Bless her to all who have been with this and thank you for having me as the MC very well. of the show. Yes, yes, and I did well, eh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very well, very well, very well. Blessings to everybody Blessings. who celebrated. <laughs> me, God of the Valley. God of the Valley. The mountain. And, and the sea. Yeah, that's where we go to. This morning, somebody discussing the color of water. <laughs> We just miss the bus or the we're missing the bus. Forget the color boy. Forget the message and remember the message. Stay focused on the message. Just miss the bus boy. Full energy on color. Hi, good morning. Good morning, Damien. How are you today? I am good. 
Okay, I'm calling on behalf of uh, this is this is a Leroy Puerto. He's not doing too well at Mount Hospital, so I'm calling on behalf of his sister mm-hmm. to send best wishes and love to him today, please. All right, see bless him. This holy week, all right, play uh, something nice for him. Well, we all be playing yeah? nice. All yes, right, I know. <laughs> Thank you so okay, much. Okay, blessings. Yes. Daddy, uh, Daddy Preto is sending blessings, man. Healing power and blessings to you, my friend. God is good. He's in charge. And once you know that no weapon form against you shall prosper, you're good to go. I can do all things. To God who strengthen me, I will fear no evil. Because God is with me. To squeeze this. I want to say good morning to, to the Stout family down there in Point Four Ten. Oxy had again, so again, on so far. Mami Julia, I'm to hear you. Mami Julia, you know his love, right? God is with me. Ox, I'm to you, boy. God is with me. <laughs> Hi, good morning. Good morning, so like when I'm old. Good morning, boy. Is that it? I hear the real noise, though. I don't like a wake up call, boy. But that's time to wake up. Morning time to wake up. We do sleeping. It's a cock call in there. Wherever you take it, us, just wake up. All right, brother. All right, brother. <laughs> okay, you go I, here, I am good, my brother. How are you? I go. Very well. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> <laughs> I go. I go, brother. I go. All right, bless. Good Everything good. is good, man. God is good. All right, let's right, you and everybody. Listeners and everybody. All right, that's original people, right? You, know, you go, boy. Hey, good morning, Monica Phillips. Good morning, Leonard. How you doing? God is with me. Mommy Carol Allen, good morning. Blessings to you. Good morning to King Babash. Gwyneth Charmin, Dr. Cheese, Gail Head. Charmin, um, I forget, isn't somebody inside of me? God is with me. Ingrid, yeah, Ingrid up in the mix. Cool, right? Good morning to you, Miss Andrews. Good morning, Mommy Elizabeth Superville. Blessings to you and the family. Come on, shake up all your whole self. Good morning, Miss Joan. How are you doing, Daddy Chinapu? Queen Mother Castle, good morning. Hi, good morning, you're live. Good morning, Donna Faye. Good morning, Damien. This is Christina Samson from Princess Town. I am the 25th of April. I am sending blessed wishes to Mr. Chinapu Savi, Mr. Abu Wender, uh, Mr. Leacock, Mr. Daniel, and blessings to Hi, Carly. <laughs> Love it. Ooh. Good morning, Carly. Good morning, Mr. Kettle. What's up, Ratty? Good morning. Boy B, good morning. And if nobody's complaining, raise your volume. Let the niceness come into your whole space. Just so that you pray for yourself, pray for your family. Good morning to all the children and the holidays. All the like all yourself today. Huh? Blessings after blessings. Though. Let's take in this one.
patience, you shall prosper. Because you are more. Hey, good morning, Coretta. How are you doing? Good morning, Loretta. Good morning, Karen and Mark. Mommy Anson, tell her good morning. Good morning, Scala. Mommy Linda, good morning. Good morning, Indra. Good morning, Gail. Marie and the crew, good morning. What's up, Wendell? Good morning, Paula. This is Wendell. How you do? Morning, a conqueror. them know that you are more than a conqueror you walk by his grace and by faith mm-hmm. hi good morning you're live yes Damien. morning i'm so sorry to hear about um the roy preto you know yeah yes, uh, interesting from the cali family now we of go course. way back way mm-hmm. back you know? yeah we grew up more repo as little children tell big people so we are you hanging there boy yep, you know what it is yeah to God be the glory for the things we have done and we still do. So blessings, blessings again to you, the right photo, and you hang in there. Have a good one. Just right. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. God is good. He's in charge. As he takes the lead and you follow. No! More than a conqueror. Somebody need to tell somebody that God is good because you see the walls are Jericho. We had to throw them down. The walls are Jericho. God the walls are Jericho. Yes, square. The walls are Jericho. Listen to the argument. The walls are Jericho falling. Biblical singing. It falling not down to the ground. Jericho falling, falling. The walls them coming down. See them coming. start running, hey. running, running when they come down. Yes, see them what? start running, running. 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 There's a saying I got this morning awesome. Those who leave everything in God's hands will eventually see God's hand in everything. Love it. Those who leave everything in God's hand will eventually see God's hand in everything. That's a blessing, right? That's a blessing, right? I am not afraid, make no mistake. When the walls fall down, I'll storm the gate. Cause they fall in the dung, the dung, dung, dung. Yeah, they fall in the dung, the dung, the dung. The walls are there, we go falling. See, the walls are there, we go falling. The dung, the dung, it falling. The walls are there, we go falling. The dung, the dung, it falling. The walls are there, we go falling. The dung, the dung, it falling. The walls are there, we go. See me call for the drama, all musician. Everybody better get in position. See me looking for the singer and the dancer. Just to let them know that Jesus is the answer. They march wrong with the ark of the covenant. So we praying for the leaders in the government. Don't be quiet, make some noise. Check them got to hear with voice. They was gonna fall cause it has no choice. It's falling, it's falling. It's falling, it's falling. It's falling. It's falling. It's falling. It's falling. It's falling. Falling, falling, running when they come down. You yes, see them start falling, falling, running when they come down. Come the door, don't, 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 don
Good morning, my mother, Joyce Lynn Melville. Boy. Good morning, Auntie Slim, Auntie Jean, and Auntie Merle. Good morning, Auntie Janet. How we do this morning? Mommy Janet, good morning. Mommy B, Granny B, morning. It's your culture crazy radio. All the drivers on the road where you've been there traveling, mercy. Good morning to your passengers as well. All the business places locked on. We say good morning to you. Hey, you gotta squeeze, give you some information and come right back. We are Culture Crazy Radio. When the time comes to honor and celebrate the life of your loved one, you can trust in the dedicated and compassionate staff at Clark & Batch Limited. With over 100 years of experience, we can tailor every detail that reflects your loved one's unique story. Whether you're considering traditional funeral services, cremation, or pre-planning for the future, we offer a range of options to meet your needs and preferences. We're here to provide the support and guidance you deserve. Contact Clark & Batch Limited. 652-3488 or 665-5266 or find us on Facebook and Instagram. Just lose my nerve as I've done from the Spiritual Baptist Faith presents on Friday, 22nd March 2024, our first open air service at Isaac Junction, Coover at 7 p.m. Our dress code is National Colors. Come and hear some dynamic men and women of God expound the gospel of Jesus Christ. On Monday, the 25th of March, 2024, the following activities will take place. Opening of the second entrepreneurial village at 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Men of Balov service, 7.45 p.m. to 9 p.m. Dress code blue. Tuesday, the 26th of March, 2024, Exhibition which commences from Tuesday to Thursday, 28th March 2024, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Entrepreneurial Village, Tuesday to Saturday, from 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. DOC Presentation, Tuesday to Thursday, 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Youth for Christ, dress code white, starts at 6 p.m. Wednesday, the 27th of March, 2024, Woman of Substance Service. The time is 6 p.m., dress code pink. Thursday, the 28th of March, 2024, Myla Spiritual Baptist Experience. Starts 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The Spiritual Baptist Diaspora Service. Time is 6 p.m., dress colored. Saturday, the 30th of March, 2024, Spiritual Baptist Liberation Day Service, which commences at 9 a.m., dress code colored. All events will take place at the Administrative Building, Balmain, Kuva. See you there. This product has not been evaluated by the Food and Drug Administration. This product is not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease. Experience the power of five. Experience five of the world's top antioxidants in one powerful nutritional product. Introducing to you Lviv from Ardis, the power of a drink in a bottle. Experience the power of mangosteen, noni, acai, berry, goji, and pomegranate. Experience the power of five. Experience Leviv. With the regular use of Leviv, you would experience a decrease in the level of harmful free radicals, which cause aging. It helps maintain a normal cholesterol level, helps maintain a healthy blood pressure, helps fight virus and bacteria. It also keeps your skin and hair healthy, improves your vision, enhance your sex drive, improves digestion, increase your level of energy, control your blood sugar level, improves your memory, protects your children's health, and allows you to have a better night's sleep. Experience the power of five. Experience Lviv. 
This Easter Sunday, March 31st, at the Cipriani Labor College, Valsane, I Am Jazz Festival presents Jazz Is Blue, featuring saxophone sensation Mike Phillips, Elon Pale, Len Booksy Sharp, Nisa, Irvin Alts, Marcus Hippolyte, and more. Come and see our unique artisans and interact with your favorite artist. Tickets are available at Simon's Musical Supplies, Crosby's, King's Lounge, Barber Spa, Arima, and Movie Town Port of Spain. Sasu in Mid Center Mall, Sion's Bar, I Live for Glam Val Park Shopping Plaza. Gates open at 4 30 p.m. Showtime is 5 p.m. Wear something blue, bring a friend or two. Sponsored by King's Lounge Barber Spa, Clinical Media Group, Mount Irvin Bay Resort, Blue Water, Carrot Brewery, Duft Hair Products, Prodal Sound, Music TT, Amps Professional, The Lullaby Group, and Blind Effects. Parts proceed go to the Diabetes Association of Trinidad and Tobago. For more information, Call 386 4748 or 380-1222. I am Jazz Festival. Jazz is blue. Toronto, Toronto, get ready for the big, big, big relaunch of A Taste of Madness at Twilight Restaurant and Bar in Scarborough on April 13th, 2024. Don't miss an electrifying night with the Calypso King of Toronto, Connector, Nikita. Could this be Daryl the Steel Pan Man and the sensational Jew? Accompanied by Toronto's finest Tassa drummers with DJs, the enforcers, and selector Ombi. And hosted by the big band Taste of Madness. Remember, it's the relaunch of Taste of Madness. Win a door prize of a microwave starting at 9 p.m. Tickets are $40. Book now on eventbrite.ca Taste of Madness and tasteofmadness.com. Come and join the unforgettable madness. Hey, Trinidad and Tobago. You see, Gloria, Saturday, Saturday, the 30th of March, San Fernando would never be the same again. Because everybody heading to Asselis by the Park. Because Karen Street Boys and Wilkie's presents the annual Back in Times party with the best DJs in the world. Featuring Peter, Alpha B, Mr. Desmond, and of course, yours truly, Mr. Q. Starting time is 9 p.m. and we dancing all the way till dawn. Admission is $80, two-on-one tickets for $140. And at the door, you pay more. For more information, you can call Atelier's by the Park, Sion's Bar, that's on Royal Road. And of course, you can get your tickets from Wilkie's, 620-3169. That number again is 620-3169. Remember, we dancing down at Atelier's by the Park. It's another Carib Street Boys and Wilkie's promotion. San Fernando, we coming?
your freedom when they do go waga. Freedom at home. Hey, good morning, Mom's Mary. Mm-hmm. All your good. Hey, hey. Hey, good morning to you, Cleo. Hey, good morning, Nicole. Good morning, Bishop Zanfield. Blessing to the family. What's up, Hazel, Maxine, and Jillian? Mom's morning. Hey, what's up, Trevor? Me, Patricia. Come on, man. Good morning. Uncle Rachel, Lee, Roxanne, morning. We don't fret them. Inside with Damien Malfoy. Good morning. I'm gonna call my partner on this one. I'll let me call my version on this one. Short time, I'll help me with this one. Gonna be right up in this one. I'll go, oh, oh. I'll go, oh, oh. I'll go, oh, oh. Don't let me go. I'll go, oh, oh. Don't let me go. I'll go, oh, oh. Don't let me go. Send me in the middle of each other. Send me in the bottom feeling. Send me where the love is lacking. So much they cannot feel them. How then can they call on him? In whom they have not believed her. If we do not go out there, I'll show them she's a superior. I'll go, oh, oh. I'll go, oh, oh. I'll go, oh, oh. I'll go, oh, oh. Oh, let me go. Show them their purpose. Send me to declare your truth. And when they focus on Jesus, that's when they won't be able to I'll go, oh, oh. I'll go, oh, oh. I'll go, oh, oh. Oh, let me go. I'll go, oh, oh. Oh, let me go. Oh, I'll go, oh, oh. Oh, let me go. Oh, let me go. My generation on the moon. Ready, 
up it's fat to the place Where the alcohol is flowing You go in cause smoke in the face Not waiting for them to come I take any chips to them It's the same thing price will do But right now it's me Yo Jenny, in this world with so much darkness They promote in plenty badness Send me down to every ghetto Give them our own model to follow When we say it in the music Then the message bound to stick That's when the Holy Spirit Well make sure they don't forget it So my brother has Joseph. Man. Come, let me go. Oh, Ashos, how you doing? Oh, I'll go. Rowena, Sabina, oh. Auntie Eileen, Uncle Fibers, oh. Wendy, Angie, oh. Norma, Marilyn, all your good morning. I'll go. Oh, I'll go. I'll go. Hey, good morning, Francis. I'm gonna call my partner on this one. I'm gonna call my brethren on this one. I'm gonna Daniel help me with this one. Hey. I'm gonna ride us on this one. I'm gonna call my partner on this one. Hey, good morning, Baba. What's up, Jay? Alan and Jennifer Morning. Well, we ride it on this one. Hey, what's up, big brother Trevor B? We ride it on this one. Yeah, this one, this one. Somebody need to tell somebody you're locked on to Culture Crazy Radio, WCK 90.1 FM. Weeping may enjoy it in the night, but joy comments in the morning. Weeping may enjoy it in the night, but joy comments in the morning. In the morning. Ah, yeah. Ah, yeah. Ah, yeah. When the morning comes. And you see the rising sun Give thanks and praise For you see a better day When you're working And it get frustrating One day you'll dry your pay And you see a better day And it have a lesson day Just have a little faith Don't you know your God is great Whole day he blessing me Whole day he blessing me Whole day he blessing me When the devil's stressing me No matter the situation It have a lesson day Just have a little faith Don't you know your God is great Whole day he blessing me Whole day he blessing me Some standing on house and land Some standing on moto Some standing on old their man Wonder how them go so Some standing on business plan But I want them to know oh, I'm standing on the promises of God Lion of Judah Jehovah Rapha Jehovah Nisi Jehovah Jireh Holy blessing, holy, holy yeah. blessing me, holy blessing me. When the devil's stressing me, no matter the situation, it have a lesson day. Just have a lesson faith. Don't you know your God is great? Holy blessing. Hey, good morning, San Fernando environment. Good morning, Kuv. I am on clear. Good morning, Mom's Yvonne. Kiss higher than I. Good morning, Shogun. As for us in environment, for us Spain and environment. Good morning. Good morning, Karen. As what's up, Diego Martin? In front of my enemy. I know they're in Freeport. Good morning. How are you? Of God, Lion of Judah. Good morning, Kira. Good morning, Sawa. Oh. Good morning, Monk Lambert. Good morning, Monk Hope. Jehovah Rasi. Good morning, Barataria. What's up, Tuna Puna? Good morning, Brenda. Jaira. Twin City, good morning, Arima, you look nice. Good morning, La Hawketa. When the devil's stressing. Mom's in Grandy, good morning. What's up, Valencia? Good morning, Mayor. Just have a little Grandy. Don't you know your God? Rio, good morning. Hey, Fat man, the president of table, I know you do. Hey. Holy blessing me. When the devil's stressing. Angela Newton, Angela Clifton, boy, good morning. Hey, good morning to the Dumont, hey. the Montiques, good morning. Don't you know your God is great? Holy. Don't you know your God is great? You don't know? Check yourself. Good morning, Mommy Gloria Christopher, Mommy Gloria Shepherd. Good morning. Search me, oh Lord, say if there be any wicked way in me. Sometimes I blind and I can't see it. Cause I don't think I arrive, can act like I reach. It's your grace that carries me. I wouldn't be here without it. That's why I'm singing, giving, 
never hurt my mind, my soul. And from the biggest crowd in the world, don't be myself alone. If the musicians stay home, and if I cannot make the notes, cause it's more than just the songs, and just my voice, and just the words. You leave the 99 for one, but this one can give you no 99. Plus one, Ayana Gordon Wallace. 99 plus one, I'm giving you all. Yeah, we running it all. Hey, that's how we do it on your culture crazy radio. WCK 90.1 FM. Just giving you all the praises, all the blessings, man. As we put them first, and everything falls into place so right after. Somebody need to tell somebody that God is good and enjoy your goodness. This one taking us to the top. My mother, I know you're gonna like up your whole self, Miss Joycelyn Melville. Hi. My mother, I love you. I love you, Lord. Your mercy never fails me. All my days, I've been held in your hands.
a tune from Tuneville. My mother show your eyes closed, you're just there rocking, eh? eh? And looking for Melo. Hey, 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 get, get work now, man. It's <laughs> Justin Melville. We love you, you're here. Tune! I love you, Lord. Blessings after blessings and strength to uh, Uncle's family. I get a message from his son. And it's two years since Uncle has passed away. And may his soul rest in peace. And his son, Mr. Blackburn. Good morning, blessings to you and the family from all of us here at Work 90.1 FM, my friend. Unforgettable jazz moment. This Lenten and Easter season, look out for more details on our programming. It's only a tune away. It's time for International News 901. Good morning, I'm Kerwin Borney and welcome to International News 901. Four people got killed and at least eight were injured when a race car drifted off the road and hit spectators at a rally in northern Hungary on Sunday. 
Multiple ambulances and rescue operators arrived at the scene and organizers halted the race. Reports say one child was taken to hospital with life-threatening injuries, another person was seriously injured, while six more people suffered lighter injuries. The French government is raising its terror alert warning to its highest level following the shootings on Moscow. Prime Minister Gabriel Attal said on Sunday after a meeting with senior security and defense officials with President Emmanuel Macron. The decision, which comes months before Paris hosts the Olympic Games, was taken in light of the Islamic State's claiming responsibility for the attack. France's terror alert system has three levels, and the highest level is activated in the wake of an attack in France or abroad, or when a threat of one is considered to be imminent. It allows for exceptional security measures, such as stepped-up patrols by armed forces in public places like train stations, airports, and villager sites. Prime Minister Richie Sunak will set out plans to boost Britain's nuclear workforce on Monday as increased submarine building and the growing needs of the nuclear energy industry are forecast to create 40,000 new jobs by 2020. The government will partner with defense companies to invest more than $961 million by the end of the decade in skills, jobs and education. The government needs to ensure there are sufficient nuclear workers to help build and maintain its fleet of submarines vital for defense and security as they are the basis of the UK's continuous at-sea nuclear deterrent. The Nigerian army on Sunday rescued students and staff who were abducted by gunmen from a school in the country's north earlier this month, days before the deadline for a ransom payment. School officials and residents had said 287 students were taken on March 7th in the town of Kuruga in the northwestern state of Kaduna. A military spokesperson said 137 hostages, 76 of them female and 61 male, were rescued in the early hours on Sunday in the neighboring state of Zamfara. A security source said the students had been freed in a forest and were being escorted to Kaduna's capital for medical tests before being reunited with their families. China has introduced guidelines to phase out U.S. microprocessors from government personal computers and servers. The procurement guidance also seeks to sideline Microsoft's Windows operating system and foreign-made database software in favor of domestic options. Government agencies above the township level have been told to include criteria requiring safe and reliable processors and operating systems when making purchases. Australia's government will support a minimum wage increase in line with inflation this year as low-income families continue to grapple with cost of living, although the rise would be smaller as inflation eased. In a submission to the Fair Work Commission's 2023-2024 annual wage review to be unveiled on Thursday, the Labour government will recommend the increase to ensure the real wages of the low-paid workers do not go backwards, a position the government has held in the last two years. Last July, the FWC hiked the minimum wage by 5.75% as costs to living surged, a decision some had feared would further stoke inflation. The Labour government has also pledged more cost of living relief in the upcoming budget in May. It will deliver tax cuts for every taxpayer from July this year. And millions of Indians are celebrating Holi, known as the Festival of Colors at home and abroad. The festival celebrates the beginning of spring and the victory of good over evil. Held on the last full moon day of the lunar month, the festival sees people smearing bright colors on friends and family and offering prayers. And that's a look at International News 901. Join us tomorrow for another edition on 90.1 FM WAC Radio. Since God made Adam in the heart of Eden. This post carnival season, WAC Radio 90.1 FM and WAC.TV are diving deep into the heart of our culture. With the most powerful message calypsos of this season. And all you're hearing from those in authority Boasting how they're going to boost the economy Yet so many of us live in poverty Join us as we celebrate the stories, the laughter, the critiques and the soul of our nation to the voices of our Calypso. For all who want to see me retire Point one FM. Just like Rose Nelson or Kitch, still could move and singing in pitch. Look, friend, don't get me in a rage. 
You see all this that's a crime, yeah. People losing their mind, yeah. We do have a solution. Crime thing, boy, it getting out of hand. Government after government try, but the crime rate keep getting so high. Even with the technologies, philosophies and analogies, we can't get crime to go down. I said to you, sweet guns roam in the town. It wasn't so long ago. Brothers would sit on the block and listen some good calypso. Fellas had a beef, but they wouldn't hold no gun. A sparrow, a kitch, would have cooled them down. Because Kaisa was conscious before reggae became conscious. That's the power we music, but then is we who refuse it. So taking back the streets with music, Mr. Gunman, I taking back the streets with music, Mr. Gunman, I'm standing up for a cause. So I put in you on pause. You see, my music would lift any spirit. It sure to drop any quality. So taking back the streets with music. Mr. Gunman, I'm taking back the streets with music. My words more powerful than your thought. You urge your killer rendering it to no. I try in your in the musical court, and when I done, his only love coming forth. So I'm taking back the streets with music. Mr. Gunman, I'm taking back the streets with music. inspiration yeah it inspired us to be great to see love overhead no sun shot so mama didn't cry music was the youth's them natural high we can see them by the radio listening to brother valentino who sniper's portrait of trinidad while making a cook in the backyard that wasn't so long If you were lost, Calypso would point you where to go. No vibes cartel with no violent lyrics. God bless our nation, you to do the trick. Calypso used to teach us, but now life we lose focus. We have the power, we music, so tell me why we refuse it, oh. Taking back the streets with music, Mr. Gunman, I'm taking back the streets with music. Mr. Gunman, I'm standing up for a cause, so I put in you on pause. You see, my music would lift any spirit, it sure to drop any bullet, so Taking back the streets with music, Mr. Gunman, I'm taking back the streets with music. My words more powerful than your thoughts, you should kill her rendering it to know. I try and you in the musical court, and when I done, his only love coming forth. So I'm taking back the streets with music, Mr. Gunman, I'm taking back.
Before we lost family life, yeah We had music that was nice, yeah Music that would heal we soul And keep the youths them in control Teacher Percy said, oh lie Else you're going to hell soon as you die Today all the parents' prayers Seem to be falling on deaf air Children go to school and learn well Instead of have their parents catching hell Sparrow's words seem so long So who what got the cards? I really want to know And even if someone did you the worst We sing pro who God bless no man curse Kaiser so it spoke to us Way down in the subconscious Crime was never stronger than music So tell me why we don't use it Oh, Taking back my streets with music Mr. Gunman I'm taking back my streets with music Mr. Gunman I'm standing up for a call So I'm putting you on pause You see my music could lift any spirit It's sure to drop any bullet So taking back the streets with music Mr. Gunman I'm taking back the streets with music My words more powerful than your thoughts You should kill a render in it to know I try in your in the musical court And when I done his only love coming on WAC 90.1 FM that's what we do that's how we roll move your foot a person and a person with speed 15 minutes after 10 o'clock good morning to you no, no, no. so that was Anika and this is no. Mr. Aaron Duncan a tired seeing cracks of deep division the petty push and pull the tug of war and talk of race every corner every space blockading our hearts tearing us apart but then on the 13th day of august on that mondo track in london town four young men in red put that all to bed the four by four relay and i saw that they Stream past the patrol. One nation. From our lips there came one sound louder than a sigh. It was a plaintive cry, not of pain or shock, like when beat a run amok. But one nation. Cause the truth was hard to hide. One nation. Of the pride we felt inside, how I wish to see my sweet TNT show to all the world what we saw on the day that we captured gold. Strike Squad for November 19th of 89. Stadium was jam pack, red on every back, chanting sweet for soul. Go TNT, go about when a bowling jet called Crawford won the gold medal in March. 
Montreal. Same feeling, same vibe, uniting every tribe. But now every morn, tell me where that spirit gone. One nation. Since then it disappeared Solomon and Quo Yes, we want it now See, then you hit the track Bring that feeling back One nation Like the Dekishan Walcott One nation Hold this pay and nail the spot How oh, I wish to see My sweet TNT such unity display, not when we win, but every day. In 86 Giselle, then Wendy as well, cause when come to beauty, they want nothing with we, but somehow all these heights of triumph, from our heart and mind they seem to fade, all the hair is gone, with every setting sun, ringing in our air. To wear one nation, like when Lalon crossed the finish line. One nation, beautiful, almost divine. Pride on every face, regardless of race. Syrian and Chinese, proud to be a genie. One nation, nobody was shot. They put away how oh, I wish to see my sweet TNT. Such harmony uphold, like what we saw on that day that we conquered gold. Seems it's mostly sports and culture that makes our country stop and pause. Forget all the hate, knocking on our gate, the bitterness and crime, spoiling every lime. Whether at a bold or no Brian Lara, we have so many reasons to be proud. Small dot on the map, but here we chant and clap for mighty TNT, like when we went to Germany. One nation. So on your knees, yes, kneel and pray. One nation. Hurricanes don't pass this way. Dominica sank, their PM said thanks. Caribbean unity, that is how it should be. One nation, beacon of the Caribbean. One nation, stretching out a helping hand. How oh, I wish to see mm. my sweet TNT. My sweet TNT. Unity display, not just once, but, but every day. Dance, you run down, huh? One Nation, right here on your Culture Crazy Radio. Spiritual Baptist Faith presents on Friday, 22nd March 2024, our first open air service at Isaac Junction, Coover at 7 p.m. Our dress code is National Colors. Come and hear some dynamic men and women of God expound the gospel of Jesus Christ. 
on Monday, the 25th of March, 2024, the following activities will take place. Opening of the second entrepreneurial village at 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Men of Balov service, 7.45 p.m. to 9 p.m. Dress code blue. Tuesday, the 26th of March, 2024, exhibition which commences from Tuesday to Thursday, 28th March, 2024. 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Entrepreneurial Village, Tuesday to Saturday, from 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. DOC Presentation, Tuesday to Thursday, 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Youth for Christ, dress code white, starts at 6 p.m. Wednesday, the 27th of March, 2024, Woman of Substance Service, the time is 6 p.m., dress code pink. Thursday, the 28th of March, 2024, Myla Spiritual Baptist Experience. Starts 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The Spiritual Baptist Diaspora Service. Time is 6 p.m. Dress colored. Saturday, the 30th of March, 2024, Spiritual Baptist Liberation Day Service, which commences at 9 a.m. Dress code colored. All events will take place at the Administrative Building, Balmain, Kuva. See you there. This Easter Sunday, March 31st, at the Cipriani Labor College, Valsane, I Am Jazz Festival presents Jazz is Blue, featuring saxophone sensation Mike Phillips, Elon Parley, Len Booksy Sharp, Nisa, Irvin Alves, Marcus Hippolyte, and more. Come and see our unique artisans and interact with your favorite artist. Tickets are available at Simon's Musical Supplies, Crosby's, King's Lounge, Barber Spa, Arima, and Movie Town, Port of Spain. Sasu in Mid Center Mall, Sion's Bar, I Live for Glam, Val Park Shopping Plaza. Gates open at 4 30 p.m. Showtime is 5 p.m. Wear something blue, bring a friend or two. Sponsored by King's Lounge Barber Spa, Clinical Media Group, Mount Irvin Bay Resort, Blue Water, Carrot Brewery, Duft Hair Products, Prodel Sound, Music TT, and Professional, The Lullaby Group, and Blind Effects. Parts proceed go to the Diabetes Association of Trinidad and Tobago. For more information, Information call 386-4748 or 380-1222. I am Jazz Festival. Jazz is blue. It was nice, so we're doing it twice. Join us for the WAC Meet and Greet in Ocala. We're celebrating the 20th anniversary of WAC 90.1 FM at Myron Oaks Community Center in Ocala. On Saturday, June 15th, the Father's Day weekend from 6 p.m., dress code is white with a touch of red. Come and meet Mr. Feely, the CEO of WAC Radio, your favorite radio station. You make the wrong choice. That's for singers with them gold. Music for dancing by DJ Richard C. of Wack Radio. All inclusive tickets, singles $40, couples $75. Book your ticket for the Wack Meet and Greet now. Call Shortman at 813 263 2127 or Dance a Boy at 917 753 3123. Get discount and hotel accommodation. Call 352-261-0024. Mention WAC 90.1 F. It was nice, so we're doing it twice. Hello, Mr. Feely. The United States is consistently ranked among the best internationally for its competitiveness. Are you planning to start a new business or branch of your business in New York? Attend our Chamber Coalition's five-week webinar series, Small Business Sense Bootcamp. We provide education and business preparation for small business owners and startups. Learn the basics of business planning, how to finance your business, business credit, marketing, and social media strategies, small business solutions, legal, tax, accounting, banking, and insurance, and how to do business within New York City, New York State, and corporations. Register at startupsbootcamp.eventbrite.com. Toronto, get ready for Fusion on Saturday, April 6th, St. Peter and Paul Banquet Hall, 231 Milner Avenue, Toronto. Doors open at 6 p.m. Dinner, 7 p.m. Show starts at 9 p.m. Fusion, a collaboration of string music and Caribbean vibes, featuring Andre J. Donovan, Trinidad and Tobago's virtuoso violinist. 
accompanied by Ozzy Gurley and the Truth Band and soloist Tad Wilson, vocalist Mandy Woods with dance performance by Tamla Matthews and music by DJ Maceo. Tickets are $140. Limited tickets are at $135 until March 15th. You get discounts for tables of eight. Get tickets at www.ticketgateway.com or call Angela 647-262-6594 and Norman 647-998-4708. A production of P.S. Smith & Associates. This concert takes place under the auspices of the consulate and it's supported by Trudan and Tobago Music Company Limited. Music TT. Toronto Fusion is coming. Tells me I must say The workers we must go back Back to the days of a clock After they we all under pressure From an oppressive master Listen, we must go back Back to the times of Uriah To stop the pain and his distress We must find us a cheap servant again of self in the interest of his people, brought him the name Chief Seven. Early in the struggle, I've learned he led a hunger march from Point Forte to Port of Spain, uniting workers in oil and sugar pain. Workers' rights, he made a political issue. But said he found workers in the land face too much abuse. And that's why when I see what's taking place today From the grave I hear Ethelin Roberts telling me to say The workers we must go back Back to the days of a clock If today we all under pressure Betrayed by a party and leader She say we must go back Back to the times of Uriah To stop the pain and his distress we must find us a cheap servant again. Because of his belief, but his concern at all times was that his people find relief. For six long years, he was held on Nelson Island, framed on a charge which he won, accused of sedition in 50 when he won national elections. 
They conspired to deprive him of the chief minister's position. And that's why when I see what's taking place today, from the grave I hear Lord Richards telling me to say, the workers we must go back, back to the days of a clock. If today we all under pressure from an oppressive master, shall say we must go back. Back to the times of Uriah, to ease the pain and stop the strain. We must find us a cheap servant today. title official that but lay the foundation for independence there can be no denial this British Empire citizens home rule party had as its philosophy a people must decide their own destiny but was called arrogant and uneducated rubber rouser but to the poor he was dedicated and that's why when I see what's taking place today Them butler rights still alive today tells me to say The workers we must go back Back to the days of butler For rejuvenation and some direction for action We must go back Back to the days of Uriah To stop the pain and ease the strain yeah, that's the voice of the man, Brother J. Good morning, Point Four. Hey, what's up, Rando? Good morning, Royal Benji. Hey, good morning, Barnett Henry, the preacher. What's up, Neil Iwa George? What's up, Austin Land? Super blue one. Good morning, Tiny. This nation we built it With the blood and sweat of Africans Dripping from mass out I say we moved And we went to indentureship Still building a nation But without the whip mm-hmm. The pursuit of emancipation That should have been we rallying call But we let that pass by the wayside So back in the trenches we fall Then many other races came And we continued a true sense of national pride we sought to instill and we sang this is my land this is my land so i am living no 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 this is my land this is my land side by side we standing history and culture that's the beat of a people's soul it's the only thing sometimes onto which we hold so look, we rally in still after Lord Brian, I won the first independence, Calypso crown. And up to today, Calypso could still uplift a nation. After Shorty, I had Jamu creating soca music. Soon down through Kenny Curry, then soca chutney came to the mix. So who want to go could go, I am here to stay. If you for your country, be for your country all the way. We rally in still Just to bring some pride to my nation All patriots just come on and show patriotism Yeah, yeah Oh Yeah, yeah, yeah mm-hmm. Colonialism, straight to independence. Block by block, we building a nation. As we told England, go to France, red, white, and black. 
and it made a people so proud. Side by side we stand and we sung it out loud. Mm -hmm. Discipline, production and tolerance, that's what we would follow. The guiding light of our people, those words would be our motto. But as the years went by, we paid a heavy cost. We're still building a nation, but like national pride we lost. But we need faithful, no, this is my land, this is my land, so I am living. No, 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 this is my land, this is my land, for she will keep on fighting. You see a nation that must always be your first love. Both are all you have to fit like hand in glove. So look, we rallying still after 1970 when we fought together in black power. Till we got by the 1990 takeover. After 1986, when the economy took some licks. We fought and we fought, and together is we who overcame it. So who want to go could go? I am here to stay. If you for your country, love your country all the way. Yeah, yeah, cause you rally in still. Just to bring some pride to my nation. We rally in still. All patriots just come on and show patriotism. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. We move up the road to Republic, planting with foot on the ground. Train it, continue moving towards true nationalism. But at the side, so much trying to pull we down. Like they wanted the queen to give me back she crumb. Murders on the horizon, the oil barrels that do overflow. Trinita land on the world stage, Hazley, Giselle, Penny, and Atto. Sweet pan music start to rise out of this land. But they said the pan used to create a violent man. But still, this is my land, this is my land, so I can't stop playing. No, 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 this is my land, this is my land, Lord, we can't stop beating. All the while, the scene changed here in Trinbego. Youths no longer jam into the songs of the Calypso, yeah, yeah. We rally in still after invaders, boy, they clash with Tokyo. Till they tell we it have no more bargains in Calypso. After the days when they told us sugar cane was king. Well, sugar cane gone and my country still surviving. So who want to go could go? I am here to stay. If you for your country, be for your country all the way. Yeah, yeah, cause you rally in still. Just to bring some pride to my nation. We rally in still. All patriots just come on and show oh, your patriotism. Oh, yeah, yeah. It has a lot of voice of Brian London, but. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, music, man. As we show our love for beautiful Twin Island Republic of Trinidad and Tobago. As we continue flying the flag. In times of crisis, band together. Stand on solid ground. Don't play no games with me culture. Don't let nobody push me down. If culture born, born, then we go die fast. Because we children, they wouldn't know about the past. We got to hold on to a history. Hold on to a pride. One people fighting all battles. Putting differences aside. All for one. And one must stand for all. Time is now, Trini's answer to the call. And everybody sing, this is my land, this is my land, so we are leaving. No, 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 this is my land, this is my land, keep the flag flying. Trinbego, for you we will always stand. Trinidad and Tobago, you would always be our land. After 1973, when they robbed the footballers in Haiti, 1989 was more heartbreak on the road to Italy. But then we start a rally around White York and Latapi. 
And 2006 Trinidad and Tobago in Germany So who want to go to go? I am here to stay If you love your country, love your country all the way Yeah, yeah, cause we rally in still Just to bring some pride to my nation And look, we rally in still All patriots just come on and show patriotism Yeah, yeah Kai so vibes on your culture crazy radio. Get out of it, get off your mind. This is singing Sandra. Go on, but will never ever be forgotten as her music lives on. What is I get to? I run down crowded space according to some conditions of standard. The grassroots live and they die hard. While some call it home, others call it slum. Physical lack of resources cannot be minimized. But when to drugs and drug bosses is a daily exercise. Ignored by government, subject to every too many use it, get to us an excuse. So when the universal education, everyone has access. Look how Jamelia raised from love until they the stairway to success. But some only caught up in name brands. Their lives do have no focus. Black man take a look in the mirror. Who keep it? Who are the back?
shanty town. In the void of no leadership, young gang and gang leaders bloom. Some may question the hero worship, but later hates a vacuum. In this land of double standards, where we embrace the Robin Hoods, as the light becomes blue between. Song. Hi, good morning, you're live. Good morning, neighbor. Good morning. Oh, God, thank you, thank you. You're troubling my spirit with them songs, man. You're troubling me. Once is a good you trouble. Know? Once is good trouble. A good, a beautiful trouble, a reality trouble. That's right. You know? And you know, Sandra was my neighbor, eh? so every yeah. time I drive out the road and I see her out, you know, I mm. just remember, mm. you know? Awesome. God is good. Every time. Yes. Yeah. Okay, darling. Listen to you. Hey! Living in the ghetto of your mind. A whole lot of people in there. More than a space, a place, a mind. A ghetto in the mind. You are resigned. And it's something you just had to stop. In the ghetto. Take a check. Take a self check. Yeah, take a self check. And realize how, how, how blessed you are. Yeah. Realize how blessed you are. And just change your whole mindset. Change your whole mindset. Speak life into your life. You hear? Speak life into your life. Hi, good morning. Hi, good morning. You're live. Good morning, Damien. How you going, bro? Good morning. I am good. Nice, nice. Good to hear you. I'm here up now. I want to hear Lydia. I have a tune about ancestors. I would like to hear that this morning. You know, to pick up the Baptist week now. Well, all right. Right. Yeah, we will do that. We could do something about that this morning. Mm-hmm. I really want to hear that before I take lunch. Oh, and you have a time for it too. All right. Yeah, before lunch. Because you have to lunch. You know, there, and I'm not sure if they're crazy, but I'm in the evening. Hey, like... all right. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. I'm ready to go. Can I go home now? No, no. Hi, good morning. Can I go home now? Good, good. good morning, Jill and Melville. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Hi, morning. I listen to the program all the time. All the time. But this morning, I love your vibe. Thank you. I love it. I love it. So, have a good day, you, Blessings. your whole family, and work family. Blessings right Thank back you. to you. Okay. I, I could have... I want to go home. I want to go For a long time I'm wondering why's the cause For the rich and poor they have 
different laws. They might act the same, but friends, it's absurd. For the rich and poor, they have different words. If a poor man helps himself to relief, they waste no time to call him a thief. If a rich man falls to the same fate, them go simply say misappropriate. They go spread it out far and abroad. How the poor man was caught practicing fraud. But when the rich man, when the money gone, and they call it diversion of funds, what they call the poor, they don't call the rich. Higher up you go, the language does switch. The quick to call the grassroots the lowest name. Like we are no character to defame. But once you have to deal with the bourgeoisie, just so they change vocabulary, I find they're very out of place and fast. How come language just change with class? They too bias. You can't read powder. How come language just changed with class? Take, for instance, ladies of the night. If you're poor, it's poor, rich is socialites. Paris Hilton skin for the camera. That's not porn, she's a video star. But if a poor girl only exposed, she bought. They quick to condemn, she as a slut. Lazy low hand could do what she wants. She's a talent and a debutant. The media go. I'm telling you, it's cash if you're broken. Your it's red and trash. What they call the poor, they don't call the rich. They won't call Paris a slaughterer. Oh no. What about you and me? They will just expose. When come to the rich, well, they're free cut clothes. But once they have to deal with them, so what? Well, them don't change vocabulary. Rich people smoke her, poor people smoke grass. How come language just change with class? They so pious, they too bias. You can't read powder if you're playing mass. How come language just change with class? of Kizzy Reed. You can't print powder if you're playing mass. How, How come language does change with class? And you know that, right? Huh. As they hold it, a hold it for marijuana or weed. But when the language change, it's a plant-like substance. You need to check it out. Come on. Get caught becomes a massage and a brothel. Well, excuse me, sir, for the filth. 
pretty rich, it's a resort spa. What for you and me, they will call a freak if it's Michael Jackson. He's just unique and he's not a child molester. It's just inappropriate behavior. A poor man beating his wife is a good with the rich. It's a domestic dispute. While they treat the poor drunk like a scare for the filthy rich, they just need rehab. You are Piper. Higher up the. You don't need rehab. Ting the switch. Does I remember Lady on the Hill with this one? Do they He's real. Blossom. Good morning, Uncle Rodney. Good morning, Emilio. Man, the wet they does get soft. That's how What the poor will do. See, Tabo. Wow. And do it, things turn around when. See, Tabo. Do it, <laughs> low and crass. How come language just change with class? Too bad. Mommy Charles, good morning. Yeah. Mommy Teresa B. Mommy Boswell, good morning. What's up, Betty? Good morning, Beverly. Good morning, Anne Marie George Quancha. It's Culture Crazy Radio, WCK 90.1 FM in that band. Good morning, you're live. Good morning, Damien. Hi, good morning. Damien, is there any topic under the sun that our Calypso art form hasn't no, touched no, on? No, no, not from, from Earth to, to, me, to, to Mars to the moon. To, and moon. there is not another <laughs> genre of music that okay. allows for that. Correct. And I don't know if we, if this has been underrated for too long. Yeah. We, we have to move it forward in some way. Hmm. Every topic you would think of, you know. Every, every. And, 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 and not just the topics, you know, but it's so wrapped up in history. Yes, yes. Yeah? You, we, anything that you want to touch on, the atom bomb, the anything, you could find a Calypso to do. And you know what's the thing eh? that, though? That they, they, because they know, because they know, they, they try to let the young people know. We not to listen to that. You see, that, that, that is old people thing. All they do is Which is sad. That. So they, they is lose sad. that history there because they're not listening there and they go on and feed them all the garbage that they want to feed them so the mind will But you know, it's only we could change that. There we go. You know, it's only we who could change that. That's why WAC 90.1 FM, we're here and we're blazing it. And people. And I wonder if it's it. only... I only I wonder if it's only you all on work that have it here. Yeah. <laughs> because all the other radio stations they wonder one yeah. or two of them do token <laughs> representation, but come on. Oh gosh. And listen, continue doing what you're doing. <laughs> Blessings you don't to you. know the immensity of the job that you are Thank doing. Thank you very much. Blessings <laughs> to you. Okay. Bye. A 
build me a coffin. I make it my home. Because that is my only choice, this kind of life. I leave it alone. Because when I look around and I see man raping your own daughters mercilessly, man living with man, woman with woman. So how must I live? I can't understand. Look, I'm frightened to live. Where you? I'm frightened to live. My own ends and began to run. I'm in the station reporting what the bandit do. And was the same bandit I was reporting to. Look, I'm frightened to live. Oh, you're yeah. frightened to live. I'm frightened to live. Yeah. I'm frightened to live. I'm frightened to live. Oh, you're frightened to live. I just hear and see, my God, how could I go on? Children killing children every day. Parents guiding their children to go as mm. Hi, good morning, your life. Good morning, Damien. Good morning, Miss Anne-Marie George Quan Chan. How are you? I am good. I know you're the longest I've oh. cared in Trinidad today. Hi, girl, how are you? <laughs> oh, I'm good. How was your time? So, there we my weekend was well good, you know. I went to the beach, girl. You know, long me and gone on the beach right there, son. I take wonderful, a, I take a beach wonderful. bath, and that was real nice, though. That was real, real, real nice. And I go far yeah. right on my cliff tunnel right there, so. And I get a really, uh-huh. really nice trip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was awesome. It was. Yeah, well, Easter weekend coming up, so you have more time to take a little bath. Well, you know it goes. You know, you know, <laughs> we, it has been right there. Let me. I don't go on the beach, you know. I don't go on the beach, you know. I don't go on the yeah. beach, you know. And then it does yeah, appreciate I mean, it. When you get that moment, it does really, really appreciate that moment. And people can do that. It's how people just can get up and say, let me go and take a beach bath and they yawn yes. for it. You know how it is. Well, I want to wish you a happy and holy Easter week. Thank you. And you and your family. Blessings to everybody locked on, both locally and internationally. And you all have a wonderful week, a nice, holy, peaceful week. Just right. You be safe on the road and blessings to you and your family as well. Now I don't pass by your old school. <laughs> by my what? Your old school. Which one? Point one in secondary. Oh, PFC. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, bless us. Okay, thank you. All righty. It's original right there. Taking in the PFC, right? The almighty, you know the breeze. It's a Bacchus, boy. Wow. Me. It's a Gene Bacchus. Live, boy. And of course, point fourteen Junior Sec. I'm frightened. Mr. Rennie, good morning. I'm frightened to live. I'm frightened to live. I'm frightened to live. Yeah. Inside of Kaiso Bag, dropping some six minutes after 11 o'clock, I have transitioned into my final hour with you. we looking for skateboard, so we blame in the between me and you, them is the fruit and we is the root. Is we have the world in trouble. We fail by example. True evidence, the story is told. Is adults who brought trouble to this world. Hey, it started with me. It started with me. Take a look at history, and you're sure to agree. Delinquency, parents juvenile delinquency. For this world of calamity, we owe them youths an apology. It started with me. It started with me. Before criticizing mercilessly, we owe them youths an apology. This is how we do now. Hey, good morning, Mr. Celestine. How are you doing, sir? Good morning, uh, Cochran. Good morning, Miss Gary. Barry Land boy. There's also a saying, we make them but not the mind. If that is so, we waste we water, we waste we wine. It's time to stop passing the buck. Them is chip up the block. In other words, go to make sheep. What we sow is that we go reap. It started with we. It started with we. 
Started with Weaver. That's a man, Hamidullah. Why, boy? Good morning to you, sir. Good morning to you and your family, man. How are you doing? More vibes. This is Hezekiah Joseph. My fellow drivers in this land. Life lost on the nation road, and it's all because we not obey in the highway code. The amount of accidents happening, it getting overbearing, and I know speeding is the main cause. Some drivers the speed like they can have a plate engine. But in the end, is innocent people they killing, and most of the time they come out scotch free, or just with some slight injury. So I say, drivers be responsible while on your journey. Remember, someone is someday waiting for you. Behind that wheel, you feel you have to have control. In a flash that could be the end of your world So please, listen to me Please slow down and drive carefully Cause on the road is more less this killing me Some drivers don't care about nobody On the road is more less this killing me We need to show some more courtesy Cause on the road is more less this killing me On the road, it is so sad. What I see on the road, I just feel like some drivers going mad. Not too long ago, I almost freak. When I see five people lost their life in an accident down on the creek, they was on their way to Port of Spain, up in the Oval. That is when disaster struck. They tell themselves they're going to see Brian Lara. But I run a rich truck and up causing this great disaster. And again, it oil boils back down to speed. Please.
Please tell me when we as drivers will take heed. So I say, now if that truck was not speeding, I want you to know those people would have been alive today. It's time for all this reckless driving to cease. And that driver went as far as to be cursing up the police. So to those in authority, enforce the law and do it quickly, cause on the road is lawless, is killing we. Guys, okay, so hi, good morning, alive. Good morning, I'm Damien. I need to send out some condolences to Bobby Downs. <laughs> Daddy Downs died yesterday. yesterday. Hello? Hello? Yes, good morning. I'm listening to you. Yes, I need to send out some condolences to Mommy Downs, Alja Karim. Her husband died yesterday. All right, condolences to the family. Do that. Now. Yes, yes. All righty. Of course, we send in love and blessings to Mommy Downs and the family, though. Daddy Downs, eh? Dongzy boy. Why it is so some of us like to drink and drive? Blessings and strength, Mommy Dongs. Why it is some of us don't like to drive, mm. drive alive? What I see going on, it is a real sad case. It does suit me hard when I see drivers using the road to race. Like they don't understand, just by their action. They put in innocent people's life at risk. Sometimes I wonder if they don't see danger, especially when they overtake it all on the shoulder. I sometimes feel that they just trip, but they turn in the road into a dead trip. So I say, I'm appealing to the police, let your presence be felt as we drive on the road daily. Look at that mother and child who was thrown from inside of their car. But how could you have a baby as a front seat passenger? Now please explain that to me. These are the things that get me angry. Cause on the road is lawless, is killing me. My heart goes out to that young baby. And all the father could say is that he's sorry On the road is lawless, he's killing me Sometimes I just have to watch in fright when I see drivers breaking the traffic light Let me explain to you what I mean It's not safe to pull off if you're on red and then your light turn to green Some men will be flying through Like they tell themselves That they have the right away but they speed in so much they don't want to stop when their light turn red. But that is how innocent people does end up dead. So again, oh this could be right. Please refrain from breaking the traffic lights. So I say to my fellow drivers, obey the highway code as we drive on the road daily. You know you're drinking, have a designated driver. Wear your seatbelt that is to protect you from danger. And that will make me happy. We 
drivers, good morning. Good morning, lovely the girls and glory. Good morning to your passengers as well. You hear the song, right? The song of all the drivers, all the ticket easy done. And the other day I heard the, <laughs> the president of the Taxi Drivers Association made a comment and I'm like, serious? When you say the red light uh, system that he implemented is going to affect uh, the drivers mostly because you know we just be driving on the road for long hours and you know we just be breaking the red light. I'm like, serious? Love you, tell us, man, don't, 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 you can't be talking for you, please. It killing me. That is a wrong. That 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 mad dog. Make me happy. Comfortable, comfortable discussing that is going to affect them in the pocket. Because them must be breaking the line. Are you serious? A close friend of As a president of a taxi driver association. Let me tell you. Love you all. Love God, boy. See them speeding taxi. That 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 that, that statement was wrong. All form and fashion though. On national TV. Like. But you have, I don't feel it was that he wanted to say. I feel he get caught up in the hype of camera and the moment and just decide yeah because we just be driving for long hours and you know we taxi drivers are just be breaking the line like that is normal we could kill people on the road but don't charge me for that because you know all the look here leave me alone you're here it's your culture crazy radio 19 minutes after 11 o'clock good morning the glory all the taxi drivers association good morning i feel when all here and i do all supposed to jump out and say hey 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 that, that statement all right i'm supposed to see something coming up saying hey that statement and right and when i ain't see nothing i figure that all you in support of breaking red light but love you all let us do that right love you <laughs> The prophets of doom and gloom, they see nothing on the horizon, nothing good on which we could build a plan. All they see is sad faces, spiritual wickedness in high places, and each day man continue to lick down man. By the junctions now we no longer grace with the presence of a good creature, no Baptist, no Jehovah Witness, no sorry. They said the future looking red gloomy, no kind of cleansing for this country. Well, in my vision, friends, here is what I see. I see the master sending down St. Peter. So here comes the rock. Here comes the rock. Michael, Ezekiel, and Jeremiah to put Satan in chain and padlock. Here comes the rock. Catherine and Philomena with plenty water, blood stains on the ground, they come to wash it down. Well, after all that's done and we still can't get them blood stains from off the shelf, I see the master coming for himself. That is what I see, that is what I see, that is what I see in my vision of TNT. of doom and gloom all they see is disaster nothing positive in sport or culturally Attila the hands Sparrow David Rudder Marshall Montano Fayan and Father Kitchen and Son Bunchy Rose Stalin and Ronnie Darren Ganger and Dean Barrett Rampard Dwayne Bravo Tom Sue Lucas Quow and Senate who now join the family Names mean nothing to the prophets of doom, but mean a lot to we. So while I'm on this object, here is what I see. I see a statue of the prince of Porter State by and Lara. Standing at the entrance to the stadium in Taruba. I see a statue of Lata P on entering Mova. Like you thinking about the senior football team of the future. I see. 
That is what I see. That is what I see in my vision of TNT. Prophets of doom and gloom, all they see in this trouble, they predict 1990 coming again. I have a funny feeling somebody's sleeping with the devil. They better know it's different people now in charge of all the speed. They continue to encourage civil disobedience to the leadership of the country, they predict total mayhem. They continue to advocate political alliance. They seem to forget that is what started this whole problem. I see Kamala Prasad Bissessa doing everything to take over from Bastio Pande, leadership of the UNC. There are those predicting her future as the first female prime minister with support from Jack Warner and company. The prophets out there waiting to start celebrating. I think I need to tell them what else I see. I see an opposition Kamala would be, but supporting effectively the government of the day to build a better, brighter country. That is what I see. That is what I see. That is what I see in my vision of TNT. As the voice of the man protect him. That is what I see. That is what you see in his vision of TNT. Hey, good morning, Ingrid. Listen. We say Kaisonian is profit. People have laughed. But everything that's going on now with Kaisonian is that long time. Hey! From Cypher, Spoiler, Dilamo, Nelson. Get his story. Check my passport, it say I'm from Trinbago. The land of commerce and lacure. We just fix 
That's when they call we tricky daddy hands. We say we don't deserve that name. But every time I told her wrong is our next politician. Trying to put our great songs to shame. It's best they fire Neil and hire Pink Panther. Boy, so once you caught there, that same this sprint. Judge himself, I'll give you a bit. Listen. This place nice, this place less. A disguise, nothing less. So drink your rum, fat and spree. If the priest copy, who is we? Where else you can find an inquiry? Funded by taxpayers' money. An entity that's owned by the state. Saying cut it off, yes, invalidate. And for the same thing, they want to kill. The AG bring a validation bill. Like some Tell you to wait, see what I'm yet. This place nice, this place less. Paradise, nothing less. This place so sweet like snipers portrait. It's not a bit spoiler's magistrate. Saying the future is in our school bags. They both see me back, but I'll be here the burden. For the children's sake on the ground I drag. But the youths today, well, they're in a model. To find a hero, Lord, how they search. Yeah, we can't find five honest men. This place nice, this place less. Paradise, nothing less. We love us and it one score and more. We beat back Sodom and Gomorrah. Hey, Trinidad and Tobago. You see, Gloria, Saturday, Saturday, the 30th of March, San Fernando would never be the same again. Because everybody heading to Azulis by the park. Because Carib Street Boys and Wilkies presents the annual Back in Times party with the best DJs in the land. Featuring Peter, Alpha B, Mr. Desmond, and of course, yours truly, Mr. Q. Starting time is 9 p.m. and we dancing all the way till dawn. Admission is $80, two-on-one tickets for $140. And at the door, you pay more. For more information, you can call Atelier's by the Park, Sion's Bar, that's on Royal Road. And of course, you can get your tickets from Wilkie's, 620-3169. That number again is 620-3169. Remember, we dancing down at Atelier's by the Park. It's another Carib Street Boys and Wilkie's promotion. San Fernando, we coming. Spiritual Baptist Faith presents on Friday, 22nd March 2024, our first open air service at Isaac Junction, Coover at 7 p.m. Our dress code is national colors. Come and hear some dynamic men and women of God expound the gospel of Jesus Christ. On Monday, the 25th of March 2024, the following activities will take place. Opening of the second entrepreneurial village at 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Men of Balov service, 7.45 p.m. to 9 p.m. Dress code blue. Tuesday, the 26th of March 2024, exhibition which commences from Tuesday to Thursday, 28th March 2024, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Entrepreneurial Village, Tuesday to Saturday, from 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. DOC Presentation, Tuesday to Thursday, 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. 
Youth for Christ, dress code white, starts at 6 p.m. Wednesday, the 27th of March, 2024, Woman of Substance Service. The time is 6 p.m., dress code pink. Thursday, the 28th of March, 2024, Myla Spiritual Baptist Experience. Starts 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The Spiritual Baptist Diaspora Service. Time is 6 p.m. Dress colored. Saturday, the 30th of March, 2024, Spiritual Baptist Liberation Day Service, which commences at 9 a.m. Dress code colored. All events will take place at the Administrative Building, Balmain, Kuva. See you there. Toronto, get ready for Fusion on Saturday, April 6th, St. Peter and Paul Banquet Hall, 231 Milner Avenue, Toronto. Doors open at 6 p.m. Dinner, 7 p.m. Show starts at 9 p.m. Fusion, a collaboration of string music and Caribbean vibes, featuring Andre J. Donovan, Trinidad and Tobago's virtuoso violinist, accompanied by Ozzy Gurley and the Troop Band, and soloist Tad Wilson, vocalist Mandy Woods, with dance performance by Tamla Matthews, and music by DJ Maceo. Tickets are $140. Limited tickets are at $135 until March 15th. You get discounts for tables of eight. Get tickets at www.ticketgateway.com or call Angela 647-262-6594 and Norman 647-998-4708. A production of P.S. Smith and Associates. This concert takes place under the auspices of the consulate and it's supported by Trinidad and Tobago Music Company Limited. Music TT. Toronto Fusion is coming. This Easter Sunday, March 31st, at the Cipriani Labor College, Valsane. I Am Jazz Festival presents Jazz is Blue, featuring saxophone sensation Mike Phillips, Elan Parley, Len Booksy Sharp, Nisa, Irvin Alves, Marcus Hippolyte, and more. Come and see our unique artisans and interact with your favorite artist. Tickets are available at Simon's Musical Supplies, Crosby's, King's Lounge, Barber Spa, Arima, and Movie Town, Port of Spain. Sasu in Mid Centre Mall, Sion's Bar, I Live for Glam Val Park Shopping Plaza. Gates open at 4 30 pm. Showtime is 5 pm. Wear something blue, bring a friend or two. Sponsored by King's Lounge Barber Spa, Clinical Media Group, Mount Irvin Bay Resort, Blue Water, Carrot Brewery, Duft Hair Products, Prodel Sound, Music TT, Amps Professional, The Lullaby Group, and Blind Effects. Thoughts proceed go to the Diabetes Association of Trinidad and Tobago. For more information, Call 386 4748 or 380-1222. I am Jazz Festival. Jazz is blue. They call themselves superpower. Jazz. Jazz. Nobody does jazz like we do jazz on WAC 90.1 there FM. Is one. Jazz. Nobody does jazz like we do jazz on WAC 90.1 FM. And he's the master, the creator of the heaven and the earth. Yes.
music from Michael Bootman. Right on your culture crazy radio niceness in your morning. 15 minutes before I pack it up and head out of here. But all for now, let's enjoy some beautiful music. And we trust that some part of our day, you know, what 365 touches you in a special way as we give you total local right here on your culture crazy radio WCK 90.1 FM. As my vibes continue up until 12 o'clock, yeah. This is the Trinidad and Tobago Police Band.
music, eh? Hi. Awesome, awesome. Ten minutes before as we vice continues, yeah, man. I really join the police and put the hands together, man. Come on. All aboard. <laughs> Shiver hard. Now if you feel like you're up here, wherever you are, get up on the rock, all right? Come on, that's right. Come on. Can't be bad for me. It's a must for we. Wakes me out my slumber. Makes me do a number. That's right. Risk me time again. To loosen my brain. Find yourself up and now. Just the we. I don't want to sleep no more, I don't want to rock no more, tell me what you're waiting for, it's time to hit on the floor, I don't want to sleep no more, I don't want to rock no more, I want to get in the heat, yeah, see me chipping down the street, can't live on that door, time to rock this boat, yeah, come and get in line, swing the party. Jack boy, it has a Trinidad and Tobago police band. As it gets very close for me to pack up and head out of here. Mm -hmm. Non-stop. Oh, baby. Original. Yeah. Anthony Prescott, but our up? very own Tony P. All aboard. Classic of a song. Could be anywhere in the world. And it's a boat ride. Must, must hear this vibe. I don't want to no I don't want to no Tell me what you're waiting for. So that's why I'm gonna pack it up for today. Remember, tell somebody you love them, take much care of the children. I want to feed your mind with forms your characteristics. Be blessed, be safe. Until tomorrow, God's will and Damian Melville get in order here. As I make way for David Matthews, who takes your puts in three o'clock. Then it steps Tony Prescott, Mr. V uh, Mr. Desmond, and your vibes continue. And remember, do what you need to do to protect yourself, your family, and your peace of mind. Washy washy. Watch and pray, wash and spray, sanitize, be wise, and be mindful of people's personal space. Be safe, stay safe. I'm out of here.
As the last echoes of Carnival Fee, the spirit of Trinidad and Tobago continues to resonate through the alias of WAC Radio 90.1 FM and WAC TV. While the rest of the world goes on, we stay rooted in the rich soil of our culture, celebrating the Trinbagonian spirit that dances in our hearts all year round. Black Radio 90.1 FM is your constant companion, bringing you the essence of Trinidad and Tobago. Of Trinidad and Tobago. ACK 90.1 FM. This is News 901 to 12 noon. In the headlines. Minister dismisses UNC's Wasa mass retrenchment claims. Michaela Pandya says PNM and the UNC failed on property tax. Regionally, Dominican Republic will continue to deport Haitians, says President, and internationally, Trump has hours to cover $454 million judgment or risk property seizure. With the news in detail to 12 noon, I'm Cohen Borny. Good afternoon. Public Utilities Minister Marvin Gonzalez has dismissed claims from Opposition Senator Wade Mark and Princess Town MP Barry Padarath of imminent mass retrenchment of workers at the Water and Sewage Authority. During a visit to a well site in St. Joseph on March 23rd, Minister Gonzalez said the restructuring process at Wasa was well underway. Minister Gonzalez said the Cabinet's Human Resource Advisory Committee was reviewing a compensation package for the new executive leadership at WASA. He added that once that was approved, an announcement would be made. On Sunday at the news conference at the UNC headquarters in Chiquonas, Mark claimed the removal of those managers was the tip of a mass retrenchment exercise planned for WASA. He alleged the UNC had information that WASA planned to retrench 2,000 to 2,500 of its 5,000 employees. In a statement, Padarat supported Mark's position. In dismissing Mark and Padarat's claims, 
Minister Gonzalez challenged them to answer certain questions. He advised both UNC members that if they could not answer those questions, they should not engage in political hypocrisy. Patriotic Front political leader Michaela Pandey says the PNM and UNC have both failed when it comes to the implementation of property tax. Pandey, the daughter of former Prime Minister and UNC fund ambassador Pandey, made those comments in a post on her Facebook page. She recalled the PNM was defeated in a snap general election on May 24, 2010, ushering the UNC-led People's Partnership Coalition into office and one of the PP's main campaign slogans was Ask the Tax. However, Pande said for five years they failed to do so. She noted that being in opposition does not relieve political parties from taking responsibility for actions taken and not taken while in government. Pande said 14 years later, the fractured UNC, now an unrecognizable shell of its original self, is singing the same election song. Despite holding a constitutional majority of 29 seats in Parliament during its tenure, Pande said the PP did nothing to bring meaningful change to Trinidad and Tobago. She recalled the PNM's local government campaign promised last August about regional corporations using the collection of residential property taxes to provide revenue. Pandey urged local government corporations to ensure there is transparency and accountability for all revenue generated from the collection of property tax. The Senate will debate the Property Tax Amendment Bill 2024 when it sits at the Red House today from 1.30 p.m. The bill was passed in the House of Representatives on March 18th by a vote of 20 to 15. United National Congress Senator Wade Marks says the party stands on strong and resilient democratic principles and anyone who is suggesting otherwise is misguided. At the UNC's media briefing yesterday, Marks said only the membership of the party decides on its leaders and he has faith and confidence in the membership. On Friday at the news conference at the Coover Chamber of Commerce Hall, UNC Member of Parliament for Mayor Rushton Parry said the party's internal elections were pivotal to its continuity within the political landscape. He made the call for the national executive to hold elections by June. However, in response to Parry, UNC members of Parliament have thrown their support behind political leader Kamala Prasad Bissessa. Mark said the 100,000 plus members of the party will determine the leaders, as has been done in the 35 year history of the party. Mark called on the party's membership and the people of the nation to remain laser focused on the objectives of the UNC. He said anyone interested in fighting elections for the UNC can submit their nominations by April 11. Tourism Minister Randall Mitchell and Panchin Bago President Beverly Ramsey Moore are both denying there is any conflict of interest in the rental of the Steel Band Body Sport of Spain headquarters. The claim was made at a UNC press conference yesterday by Senator Mark, who alleged that Minister Mitchell is collecting rent from Panchin Bago, one of the interest groups in the National Carnival Commission, which falls under his purview. Mark, who showed copies of a deed of covenants to support his claim, said in 2021, Dr. Bruno Mitchell sold his property at 55 Dundonan Street to Deer Street Limited, a company owned by Minister Mitchell and Dr. Gina Marie Kolas. Pan Trinbego relocated to the Dundonald Street property last August. The one-year lease comprises $50,000 monthly rent for a portion of the building and $20,000 for its car park. However, Minister Mitchell said he has never collected rent from Pantrin Bago. He said the Street Limited has a tenancy agreement with a company called LMG Property Management and Pantrin Bago is a subtenant of LMG. Minister Mitchell said LMG's decision to sublet to Pantrin Bago was made independently without his influence or direction. Roman Catholic Archbishop Jason Gordon has urged citizens to reflect on the passion and resilience of Jesus Christ and other characters who emerged during Holy Week. As he delivered the homily yesterday at the Palm Sunday service at Our Lady of Perpetual Help on Harris Promenade in San Fernando, Archbishop Gordon said there was much to learn from the characters who emerged in the story that led to the crucifixion and resurrection of Jesus Christ. The Palm Sunday service began with the solemn procession of the congregation outside the church as they waved palm branches reenacting the arrival of Jesus into Jerusalem days before the crucifixion. The Archbishop blessed the palm trees which symbolized peace and victory with holy water. During the homily, God asked the congregation that as they mediate on the events of Holy Week, they focus on one character from the narrative of the events of Holy Week. Originally, the President of the Dominican Republic, Louis Abinada, has declared that his country will continue to expel Haitians and will not authorize refugee camps ignoring demands from international organizations that have asked the neighboring country to stop expulsions and welcome Haitians fleeing violence. Speaking in a recent interview, Abinada said his administration will continue to develop and enforce laws related to migration. The president said there are many alternatives that do not include the Dominican Republic that shares the island of Hispaniola with Haiti. 
internationally. Donald Trump faces a Monday deadline to post a bond to cover a $454 million civil fraud judgment or face the risk of New York State seizing some of its marquee properties. Trump, seeking to regain the presidency this year, must either pay the money out of his own pocket or post a bond while he appeals the February 16 judgment against him for manipulating his net worth and his family real estate company's property values to dupe lenders and insurers. The Trump campaign on Friday called for donations from one million poor Trump patriots, saying that the iconic Trump Tower was among his properties at risk of seizure. In sport, it was a return home to remember for the Trinidad and Tobago men's indoor hockey team, which arrived at the VIP lounge of Piaco International Airport to a rousing applause early yesterday morning. The team was greeted by officials of the Ministry of Sport and Community Development and the Sports Company of Trinidad and Tobago, as well as representatives of the Trinidad and Tobago Hockey Board. The squad arrived via Houston, Texas after competing at the just-concluded 2024 Indo-Pan American Cup in Calgary, Canada, reaching the final at which they lost 5-2 to Argentina. The local stickmen's credible performance earned them a spot at the 2025 FIH Indoor Hockey World Cup, which will be this country's third appearance at that global tournament. And Nicholas Puran launched his latest Indian Premier League campaign with a stellar unbeaten half century, but it proved in vain as his Super Giants team went down to Shimron Hetmaz Rajasthan Royals by 20 runs on Sunday. In pursuit of 194, Super Giants got a top score of 64 not out from Puran and 58 from captain and opener KL Rahul, but fell short of their target. As a look at news to 12 noon. Recapping the headlines. Minister dismisses UNC's Wasa mass retrenchment claims. Michaela Pandey says PNM and the UNC failed on property tax. Regionally, Dominican Republic will continue to deport Haitians as president. And internationally, Trump has hours to cover $454 million judgment on risk property seizure. That's a look at news at 12 noon on WAC 90.1 FM. You can get more news online at www.wacradio901fm.com. Join us at 4 p.m. for another major newscast. I'm Kerwin Borneo. Good afternoon. You raise me up. As we embrace the season of renewal and reflection, WAC Radio 90.1 FM and WAC.TV invite you to a musical journey that transcends the ordinary. Master, bring it splashy and dashy like water. God tell me bring fire. This Lent and Easter, let's embark on a soulful exploration of hope, rejuvenation, and the sheer joy of gospel, jazz, and uplifting music. Whether you're at home or on the move, make us your cultural soundtrack to your life. Sunday, March 31st at the Cipriani Labor College, Valsane. I Am Jazz Festival presents Jazz is Blue, featuring saxophone sensation Mike Phillips, Elan Pale, Len Booksy Sharp, Nisa, Irvin Alves, Marcus Hippolyte, and more. Come and see our unique artisans and interact with your favorite artist. Tickets are available at Simon's Musical Supplies, Crosby's, King's Lounge, Barber Spa, Arima, and Movie Town, Port of Spain. Sasu in Mid Center Mall, Sion's Bar, I Live for Glam, Val Park Shopping Plaza. Gates open at 4 30 p.m. Showtime is 5 p.m. Wear something blue, bring a friend or two. Sponsored by King's Lounge Barber Spa, Clinical Media Group, Mount Evan Bay Resort, Blue Water, Carrot Brewery, Duft Hair Products, Prodel Sound, Music TT, and Professional, The Lullaby Group, and Blind Effects. Parts proceed go to the Diabetes Association of Trinidad and Tobago. For more information, call. Call 386-4748 or 380-1222. I am Jazz Festival. Jazz is blue. Toronto, get ready for Fusion on Saturday, April 6th, St. Peter and Paul Banquet Hall, 231 Milner Avenue, Toronto. Doors open at 6 p.m. Dinner, 7 p.m. Show starts at 9 p.m. Fusion, a collaboration of string music and Caribbean vibes featuring 
Andre J. Donova, Trinidad and Tobago's virtuoso violinist, accompanied by Ozzy Gurley and the Truth Band, and soloist Tad Wilson, vocalist Mandy Woods, with dance performance by Tamla Matthews, and music by DJ Maceo. Tickets are $140. Limited tickets are at $135 until March 15th. You get discounts for tables of eight. Get tickets at www.ticketgateway.com or call Angela 647-262-6594 and Norman 647-998-4708. A production of P.S. Smith & Associates. This concert takes place under the auspices of the consulate and it's supported by Trudan and Tobago Music Company Limited. Music TT. Toronto Fusion is coming. Baptist Faith presents on Friday, 22nd March 2024, our first open air service at Isaac Junction, Kuva at 7 p.m. Our dress code is national colors. Come and hear some dynamic men and women of God expound the gospel of Jesus Christ. On Monday, the 25th of March 2024, the following activities will take place. Opening of the second entrepreneurial village at 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Men of Balov service, 7.45 p.m. to 9 p.m. Dress code blue. Tuesday, the 26th of March 2024, exhibition which commences from Tuesday to Thursday, 28th March 2024, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Entrepreneurial Village, Tuesday to Saturday, from 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. KOC Presentation, Tuesday to Thursday, 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Youth for Christ, Dress Code White, starts at 6 p.m. Wednesday, the 27th of March, 2024, Woman of Substance Service, the time is 6 p.m., Dress Code Pink. Thursday, the 28th of March, 2024, Myla Spiritual Baptist Experience. Starts 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The Spiritual Baptist Diaspora Service. Time is 6 p.m. Dress colored. Saturday, the 30th of March, 2024, Spiritual Baptist Liberation Day Service, which commences at 9 a.m. Dress code colored. All events will take place at the Administrative Building, Balmain, Coover. See you there. Hey, Trinidad and Tobago. You see, Gloria, Saturday, Saturday, the 30th of March, San Fernando would never be the same again. Because everybody heading to Asuli's by the park. Because Carib Street Boys and Wilkies presents the annual Back in Times party with the best DJs in the land. Featuring Peter, Alpha B, Mr. Desmond, and of course, yours truly, Mr. Q. Starting time is 9 p.m. and we dancing all the way till dawn. Admission is $80, two-on-one tickets for $140. And at the door, you pay more. For more information, you can call Atelier's by the Park, Sion's Bar, that's on Royal Road. And of course, you can get your tickets from Wilkie's, 620-3169. That number again is 620-3169. Remember, we're dancing down at Atelier's by the Park. It's another Carib Street Boys and Wilkie's promotion. San Fernando, we coming.
a luxury and like too much a gallery But you know for them, no for them, no for them pretty But you know how me do for me, you know how me remember No for them, no for them, no for them pretty Look up for me, love for me, you know how me she is My true girl, she have the time for me, too, yeah My true girl, and she love the grand tea for she My true girl, she have the time for me, too, yeah My true girl, and she love the grand tea, yeah My true girl, and she love me badly, yeah My true girl, she have the time for me, too, yeah My true girl, and she love the grand tea, yeah My true girl, and she love the grand tea I should go look, cause she put in a body Me woman land a mercy, cow the people Cause she no too damn pretty If she pretty land a mercy, if be a misery Land a mercy, she could have filled with the can hurry That a woman who me have, she a save me money Every two weeks in the human, she a buy lottery Sometimes cabbage not to mention, still a re This a woman, she a want to cook rice and body And I wish she is my chunk of lungs Love her every day of my life She's my chunkolos What's I make the human for me wife? She's my chunkolos My chunkolos she is 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 My ch
Like all around me, but dies too much. You see me there on a show It's not a politician singing a kaiso Despite what is the task they give to me Calypso is rooted in my belly So I want everybody here to see Is a Calypso near representing we He get cool your mouth Some people they smile and some people cuss Saying how this youth playing black conscious The parliament staff they all agree Kai so inside here yeah, is so strange to see From his perspective what he's going to say And how he interprets the lack array Like if the opposition and Jack unite After they had one of the biggest fights Or if we PM get put in court By the same Venezuelans for which he fought Or if our ex-minister end up viral Fighting to get inside a funeral No invitation, but the scene get tense If you see how she stick up on top of the fence But hey, that is too, too much, much. And, and I don't like that at all Inside the song So if you hear me on your radio It's not a politician singing a guy so oh, Whatever no! they want, they want me play Calypso's a part of my DNA So I hope it makes everyone happy Is a Calypso near representing me Yeah 
Levantine Stonian start to pick the side And immediately start to roll the eyes By talking him like they were not friends And saying it really should have been them Hoping his job will distract him So this year he won't get no chance to sing But this Calypsonian will fill his shoes And always sing the relevant issues Like how the people are afraid to use their lights Cause they find tea and tech not treating them right Or when you go down inside the HTC House is mashing up like Chini oh, BB no! Or maybe you want to try to protect your home Cause the bandits and them won't leave you alone Calling the police for you might get this They might say and you know where the station is hmm. But that is too much Whether I'm close or whether I'm far Singing Calypso is in my nature So despite wherever you see me go It's not a politician singing a Kaiso I just follow God Almighty And I'm not sure what he will choose for me But I'm satisfied once we all agree Is a Calypsonian representing me? Good morning. Hi, good day. Um, my wife called about two hours ago mm -hmm. to report a home robbery. Okay, so what are y'all doing? Saying down home and waiting for the police to call out here? Do you know where the police station is? So why didn't come and make a report? Trinidad mm -hmm. Fire Service, good morning. Yes, hi, good day. I called about two hours ago, but nobody got back to me. Uh -huh. My house is on fire. So what are you doing? Sign up there watching the fire? Do you know where the fire station is? Why don't you come and drive the truck and all the fire yourself? Huh? Goodbye. Trinidad Ambulance Service, good morning. Hi, yes, good day. My husband has fallen down the stairs. Uh-huh. I can't get up. So what are you doing there? Just watching the man on the floor? Do you know where the hospital is? Why don't you drag your body and carry him to the hospital? Huh? What? People. Ninety point one FM. Hello, this is Walk ninety point one FM. Yes. Hello, this is Walk ninety point one FM. Yes, it is. Hello, this is Walk ninety point one FM. Yes, it is. Hello, is it Walk 90.1 FM? Yes, it is. Good afternoon to one and all of town. Hope your day is great, super fine. Thank you very much, Damien. 
Oh yeah. Oh, it's Monday. Oh, oh yes, it's Monday. In case you forgot. In case you forgot. Hello. Good afternoon. This is Walk 90.1. Hello. Hello. Hello? Uh, Mr. Matthews. Hello. Um. Is there? A is joke? that joke you playing on the radio? Uh huh. Did you smile? No, because I saw that's not like a drama. Good guys, that's not like the same person making them them clippings, man. Uh huh. Uh huh. Well, I don't know. I am. Um, that, that, that can't be real. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Um, do you know, do you know, do you know where Wak 90.1 is? Yes, sir. Okay. 91C Coffee Street. Okay. Okay. Well, go down there and make a report. I've been up them stairs already. I ain't coming back up there to make no report. <laughs> <laughs> too much, too much steps to climb. <laughs> yes. Oh, uh-huh. these knees are getting up these days, so I'm climbing all them steps at all. Oh, uh-huh. mm. okay. Well, well, um, well, um, make a phone call, Mr. Matthews. But that is a that is a that is a skit that somebody played, man. Well, maybe it's some like the same person who called the ambulance, who called the fire, or she's an operator. Um, maybe I don't know. Like, that had to be because that person had the same phone. I see the operator who answered the phone. She probably not even a phone. It's open or one of them things. Well, she because how you gonna tell the man? To, how you gonna tell the man to drag the body? She didn't say he must body dead. She said fall down. Well, maybe that's how that's how they speak to the callers. Nah, man, that had to be a that had to be a skit, man. That's a joke. That is not real. Well, I know the section that is not a real place, but that can't be real. Well, that's how they speak the the, the callers when you call them. No, somebody, somebody playing a prank on all your man. That's not real. That's not real. No nah, man, that can't be real. Well, maybe you need to try calling one of the um one of those places and see how they'll speak to you. Try calling them. Okay. Man. And, 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 send me and, the number you know. because I don't know the number for them places. Okay, I'll send you the I number. Try. Okay, thank you. All right, good. So you could call them and you'll find out, right? Okay, I will. Okay. All right, good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, uh huh. Woo, 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 woo. Welcome to one and all on this beautiful Monday afternoon here in Trinidad and uh, Tobago. I don't know if it's a nice day in Tobago. Hey, we had a little sprinkle over the weekend, boy. Nothing too heavy, but just a little sprinkle to cool it down a little bit. And um, I don't know if it made a difference to the reservoir, you know. I don't know if it made a difference, but, you know, a little sprinkle to cool down the, the, the heat because it's very hot these days, right? Woo! All right. But it's either... It's hot or it's not hot. It's either it's rain or no rain. So no matter what, we complain, right? All right, that is great, man. Well, there's a short week, right? It's a short week. If you work five days, oh my goodness, because all right, today is Monday, then you have Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Oh my goodness, and look at that boy. Friday is supposed to be a holiday. Saturday is two holidays in one. I don't know. I don't know. Half day might be one holiday and half day the next holiday. Two holidays in one on Saturday, you know. Way. Yeah, boy. Sunday and, and then Sunday. And then Monday is another holiday. Way. It's a long, 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 long weekend, you know, boy. Yeah, because Saturday is two holidays in one. So then Saturday is a very long day. Yes, Saturday is a long day, boy. Two holidays in one day, so it could be a long day. All right? So Saturday is a long, long day. All right? 
Shout out Baptist and uh, um, Gloria Saturday. Yeah, what? Friday is Good Friday. Monday, Esther Monday. I mean Easter Monday. Which one? Esther Monday or Easter Monday? Esther? You see, I don't call a woman name again. I don't call a woman name again. Let me say Easter. Let me say Easter. I don't call a woman name. Woman, woman name had to be calling and everything, you know, boy? Woman name had to be calling everything. All right. I said Easter, not Esther. All right. So that's a long, 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 long weekend. So right now, the young ones are on vacation, boy. Easter vacation, boy. Easter vacation. And then we are the next. Well, anyhow. So just after we come out of that. Oh, my way. And it's mountain too. All right. So it's a good time. It's a good time. All right. So wherever you are, good afternoon from Trinidad and Tobago. Whatever noon means, you will know. All right. But good afternoon to you from Trinidad and Tobago. And I was told this is Holy Week. Eh? Yesterday was Palm Sunday. And I was told this is Holy Week. So this must be a very special week. Eh? All right. I don't know. You know, I, I, I have to get the, 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 the run-ins. You know, I don't know what Holy Week is all about. But this week is a Holy Week. I wish every week, then every week should be a Holy Week, you know. Anyhow, I need to know what a Holy Week is all about. And then I will know whether every week should be a Holy Week. All right.
need to find someone with a familiar face so we could take and celebrate. This is not the time to be alone now. This is the time to whine and about time. Let's be amazing. Keep the fire blazing. With no care in the world that we get on bad in here. I want you to jam on, jam on somebody now. Mash up the mash up the place and dun dun. Walk up, we walk up, we walk up, we ways and dun dun dun. Jam up the jam up the jam up the place and dun dun. Walk up, we walk up, we walk up, we ways and dun dun dun.
Good afternoon, I'm Kerwin Borney and welcome to our 1 p.m. news update on WAC 90.1 FM. Public Utilities Minister Marvin Gonzalez has dismissed claims from Opposition Senator Wade Mark and Princess Tong MP Barry Padarath of imminent mass retrenchment of workers at the Water and Sewage Authority. Patriotic Front political leader Michaela Pandey says the PNM and the UNC have both failed when it comes to the implementation of property tax. United National Congress Senator Wade Mark says the party stands on strong and resilient democratic principles and anyone who is suggesting otherwise is misguided. Regionally, a plane carrying 21 Americans fleeing Haiti arrived in Orlando, Florida on Saturday night, the latest in a series of U.S. chartered flights from the embattled Caribbean nation, which has descended into chaos amid rampant gang violence and political instability. Florida's Division of Emergency Management announced the plane's arrival on Sunday, noting that to date a total of 35 Americans have been rescued by state-coordinated emergency flights. Internationally, Israel told four European countries on Monday that they plan to work toward recognition of a Palestinian state constituted a prize for terrorism that would reduce the chances of a negotiated resolution to the conflict between the neighbors. Spain said on Friday that in the name of Middle East peace, it had agreed with Ireland, Malta and Slovenia to take first steps toward recognizing the statehood declared by the Palestinians in the Israeli-occupied West Bank and in the Gaza Strip. And that's a look at our 1 p.m. news update. Join us at 2 p.m. for another news update on WAC 90.1 FM. Hey, Trinidad and Tobago. You see, Gloria, Saturday, Saturday, the 30th of March, San Fernando would never be the same again. Because everybody heading to Asselis by the bar. Because Carib Street Boys and Wilkies presents the annual Back in Times party with the best DJs in the world. Featuring Peter, Alpha B, Mr. Desmond, and of course, yours truly, Mr. Q. Starting time is 9 p.m. and we dancing all the way till dawn. Admission is $80, two-on-one tickets for $140. And at the door, you pay more. For more information, you can call Atelier's by the Park, Sion's Bar, that's on Royal Road. And, of course, you can get your tickets from Wilkie's, 620-3169. That number again is 620-3169. Remember, we dancing down at Atelier's by the Park. It's another Carib Street Boys and Wilkie's promotion. San Fernando, we coming... Spiritual Baptist Faith presents on Friday, 22nd March 2024, our first open air service at Isaac Junction, Coover at 7 p.m. Our dress code is national colors. Come and hear some dynamic men and women of God expound the gospel of Jesus Christ. On Monday, the 25th of March 2024, the following activities will take place. Opening of the second entrepreneurial village at 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Men of Balov service, 7.45 p.m. to 9 p.m. Dress code blue. Tuesday, the 26th of March 2024, exhibition which commences from Tuesday to Thursday, 28th March 2024, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Entrepreneurial Village, Tuesday to Saturday, from 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. DOC Presentation, Tuesday to Thursday, 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Youth for Christ, dress code white, starts at 6 p.m. Wednesday, the 27th of March, 2024, Woman of Substance Service, the time is 6 p.m., dress code pink. Thursday, the 28th of March, 2024, Myla Spiritual Baptist Experience. Start 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The Spiritual Baptist Diaspora Service. Time is 6 p.m. Dress colored. Saturday, the 30th of March, 2024, Spiritual Baptist Liberation Day Service, which commence at 9 a.m. Dress code colored. All events will take place at the Administrative Building, Balmain, Coover. See you there. Are you interested in investing in real property, a home, or investment property in New York or other states? Then Equity Smart Realty Inc. can work with you. From potential returns to portfolio diversification, buying international property comes with its perks, but it's also a complex process and there are tax matters to consider. Equity Smart Realty Inc can help you purchase real estate in New York. We have the knowledge you need to simplify the process. Ready to discuss your options? Schedule a consultation on this matter. 
or start a business or a branch of your business at www.askthelawyer.us. That's www.askthelawyer.us or call 855-768-8845. Again, 855-768-8845. This Easter Sunday, March 31st, at the Cipriani Labor College, Valsane, I Am Jazz Festival presents Jazz Is Blue, featuring saxophone sensation Mike Phillips, Elan Parley, Len Booksy Sharp, Nisa, Irvin Alves, Marcus Hippolyte, and more. Come and see our unique artisans and interact with your favorite artist. Tickets are available at Simon's Musical Supplies, Crosby's, King's Lounge, Barber Spa, Arima, and Movie Town, Port of Spain. Sasu in Mid Center Mall, Sion's Bar, I Live for Glam Val Park Shopping Plaza. Gates open at 4 30 p.m. Showtime is 5 p.m. Wear something blue, bring a friend or two. Sponsored by King's Lounge Barber Spa, Clinical Media Group, Mount Irvin Bay Resort, Blue Water, Carrot Brewery, Duft Hair Products, Prodal Sound, Music TT, and Professional, The Lullaby Group, and Blind Effects. Parts proceed go to the Diabetes Association of Trinidad and Tobago. For more information, Call 386 4748 or 380 1222. I am Jazz Festival. Jazz is blue. These products have not been evaluated by the Food and Drug Administration. This product is not intended to diagnose, treat, kill or prevent any disease experience the power of five experience five of the world's top antioxidants in one powerful nutritional product introducing to you la vie from artists la vie the power of a drink in a bottle experience the power of mangosteen noni acai berry goji and pomegranate experience the power of five experience levy with the regular use of levy you would experience a decrease in the level of harmful free radicals which cause aging it helps maintain a normal cholesterol level helps maintain a healthy blood pressure helps fight virus and bacteria it also keeps your skin and hair healthy improve your vision enhance your sex drive improve digestion increase your level of energy controls your blood sugar level improve your memory protects your children's health lose weight and allows you to have a better night's sleep experience the power of five experience la vie mangosteen noni acai berry goji and pomegranate now what are you waiting for it's time to feel good again get back your life take charge call 516-286-7079 that's 516-286-7079. Get all the information you need and place your order now. Don't hear. It's just about 10 minutes after 1 o'clock in Trinidad and Tobago. And in case you forgot, it's Monday in this part of the world. The day after the day of sun, which is Sunday. And the day before Tuesday. Alright, so that's Monday. 
All right, the day where, the day of the moon. All right, moon day. All right, so probably moon day didn't say song too well, but I say Monday, or probably no, it depend on who's saying it. Monday. So if you, you can't say moon day, if um, if somebody like um, if somebody like Ingrid want to say Monday, she wouldn't be able to say it. Yeah, she would be speaking like a Trini. So she had to speak like um, she had to speak like an American and say Monday. Okay. Oh, anyhow. Don't worry that Ingrid. Don't worry that. <laughs> Monday, Monday. All right. Good. And it's um as I said earlier, it's a holy week. I don't know if it, well. Yeah, it's a holy week. All right, it's a holy week. Okay. Every week should be a holy week, right? Then this world will be a fantastic place. So I hope for this holy week, those who indulge in illegal activities could ease up this week because it's a holy week. So, you know, they could change their behavior to something spiritual, you know, so they could ease up. And make this week a nice, memorable one. Let me see, boy, I, I, I don't know. Let me see if there's anything to speak out on today. Because um, hmm, the, week, the week has gone last week. And you know there were a couple of things that um, stood out last week, and then this week, it's all over again. But one thing we're waiting to see how it plays off, and we're waiting to see whether there will be charges laid, is this incident. With this young girl that went missing for seven years. They dug up her body in her backyard. They say it was the girl. Postmortem done. First, yes, it was that girl. Then they say, all right, holes were found in the, in the skull, in the skull, looking like gunshot. Okay. So they say it was that young girl, Hannah. Then they come back again, second time around. And they say, no, okay, the bone in the skull look a little longer. It look like the skull of a man, the bone. And then they look at the abdomen and say, no, but this abdomen look like of a male. So they confuse everybody now. So... To come to some level of conclusion, a DNA, DNA test have to be done to know whether the bones found was a man or a woman. So hopefully sometime early this week, those results should be out and we'll know whether it was a man or a woman. And then when they figure out now whether it's a man or a woman, if it's a woman now, they have to make sure that is Hannah. If it's a man, next question to be answered, who is this male person? Who is this male person? So that will be another twist again. Because a bone was found in my backyard, and I living on this property for all these years. And bones were found in my backyard, bones of a human. Something is wrong. Because if neighbors could be smelling something stink and they're saying it's their dog, then you have more problems again. Neighbors smelling something stink, but they're saying it was their dog. Did they really see a dead dog? Did they really see any dogs dead? But anyhow, this is the different angles 
of this case and again we come right back to someone missing family said nothing no report was made nothing Somebody eventually have to answer to these questions, you know. Somebody eventually have to answer to these questions. Because, you know, they could only hold people for about 72 hours without a charge. So they have to release them because the DPP say, hey, there's not enough evidence here to charge. So they went and dig up the yard again, came up empty-handed. I don't know what they went to look for. Maybe they went to look for bullets. If they went to look for more body parts, I don't know what they went to look for, but they came up empty-handed, right? So, we wait on the DNA to know whether the body found or the bone found was a male or a female. And then, if it's a male, who was that male? If it's a female, is that female Hannah? So, we wait we wait. And um, a couple other things here is um, hmm. um, what, what, what was that, boy? What was that? What was that? Oh, well, sometime last week, boy. Sometime last week, yeah. I wonder if I have it, boy. Oh, some, anyhow, I have to check. I know I didn't remember that, boy. I suppose to that, you know. Yeah, but anyhow, I'll come to that. So, sometime, so over the last few days, people only realize, I don't know if this is some kind of game that's taking place now. You know? I don't know if this is a game that's taking place in the UNC. Rushton Parry. You know, I heard when um, I think this Paris called him out in Parliament last week, challenging the leadership of the UNC. And since that, it gone clear. Since I think Paris called him out, yeah. Since after that, it gone clear. You know, he had big press conference over the weekend, over, over the weekend and thing. You know. And he's calling for internal election for UNC, for the UNC now. And then you have all these um, political scientists now saying, hey, the leader of the opposition must be removed or should be removed before the next general election. Because if they don't, do, if they do, if they, if they don't remove her, they're going to lose. They can't win any seats. They can't win any more seats to move the PNM. And Rustin Parry, that's the MP for Mayaro, he continued to speak. And he's not giving up. So I am wondering now if this is a game going on here in the UNC. Because you have some... Well, you don't have much support from the MPs. You don't, have, you don't have no sort of support from the MPs, you know. One political scientist is also saying apparently like Parry is committing political suicidal so suicide now. This could be the end of his political career. Well, again, you have to be brave. Because it's so strange. Oh, I mean, no one must challenge a leader. It's so strange. The last internal election that the People's National Movement had. Anybody challenge the Prime Minister? Anybody challenge Dr. Rowley? I'm sure people would have challenged him. And Dr. Rowley came out victorious, right? He came out on top. Hmm. You see? So, I don't know. Apparently, you're not supposed to challenge your, your leader. You're not supposed to challenge your leader. Okay. Well, if it is that um, they think that um, if the leader of the opposition remains in power, 
it will take them to victory, well, leave her there. Leave her there. Because you're seeing where by, you're seeing that, how to put it, boy, anyhow, you're seeing the UNC calling on the small parties to come on board. They're calling on the small parties to come on board. Come up, come and join. Well, two parties play game already. Like Pep with Philip Alexander and NTA with Gary Griffith. They don't play, they play their game already. I don't know what's going on. But now, understand NTA, Gary Griffith, party here. Uh, Calling for candidates now for the 40 for the 41 constituencies. Well, let me say 40 because he done he have declared. From what I realize, from what I understand now, he going up for St. Joseph. St. Joseph constituency. That is the one that's held by Terence Dial Singh. Yeah. He going up. He going to fight that seat. So he's calling for. People to come on board now to represent the other 40 constituents. So, with that now, is it that he's no longer a part of the UNC? Politic politics is a game. Politics is a game in this country, yes? And that's a good thing about the PNM. That's, why, that's a good thing about the PNM. You win alone, you lose alone. You lose alone, you win alone. You fight alone, you win alone. You fight alone, you lose alone. Good. You don't have to team up with, with nobody. So continue, continue, continue fighting PNM. Right? While the others try their best, continue fighting. You could win, you could lose. But at least you do it on your own, right? Good. So, so that is another little drama that's bubbling around. And then the other little piece of drama that's bubbling around, you know, sometimes you, 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 you wonder if people are really serious. Because, you know, we have a lot of state agencies in this country. That are not performing and we will cost them morning, noon, and night. There are state agencies that's causing hemorrhage on the treasury. And we, when action has been taken, we cost them day and night. And I remember saying some time ago, the only government who is fearless when it comes to taking action against state agencies is the People's National Movement. They do what they think is right. And right, and when it comes to running the country, they, they believe if this is right, they do it. And they I have no problem when it comes to suffer any consequences, right? Who close on Karoni? Who close on Karoni? Trinidad is still alive, right? What happened with TSTT? Well, they didn't close on TSTT, but uh, some serious restructuring took place in terms of sending home workers and that sort of thing, right? It's still operational, right? What happened with Petro Trin? Who did that? It's still happening, right? Those are three major areas where the government, and when I say the government, in the government in power the time, saying, hey, these are areas where 
we are losing is hemorrhaging the treasury. Something have to be done. It's not profitable anymore. Something have to be done. And they took the action that they thought was necessary. Government. Things are still happening, right? So, you have these things happening. And uh, over the last, well, hmm, months, conversation on the property tax is in the atmosphere. Over the last few months. Well, I think the Senate meeting today, I think it is, where the Parliament met. But anyhow, they are meeting today to discuss that again. Because up to sometime last week, it was reduced from 3% to 2%. So it's all these things happening. Not everybody is for property tax. A lot of people are not for it. And everybody have different reasons why they are not for the property tax. Right? But, I don't know. No matter what happens, it's coming. No matter how much we cost, it's coming. Right? Because the government, they are not giving up on implementing the property tax. I remember, was it in 2010? Somebody had a slogan, Ask the Tax. Will we hear Ask the Tax again? Because Ask the Tax is one of the slogans that they used to get them in power in 2010, right? Ask the Tax. Okay? So, Ask the Tax came and, uh, well, it was, a, it, it, it was a slogan. New government came into power in 2010. Nothing happened, right? Because Ask the Tax. So, this people national movement is in power right now and they are not holding back in implementing property tax because paying property tax was always there but under the UNC it was no more for all these years right they were in power right so this government is bent on putting it back in place because they have to find revenue to run the country and um, one of the areas of getting that is from the working class right they have to find ways of getting it and the working class is one way of getting it right so you have that happening right so eventually it will come it will come right we don't know when but it will come but the same way with the Tech rate. Right? That was something that we were making noise about. Increasing the Tech rates. Well, it's a little silent right now. Right? It's a little silent right now, the Tech rates. So, that, that also we wait in to see when it will be implemented. I mean, again, for me, I have no problem... I have no problem with the taxes, you know. But for me, it must be done incrementally. I no problem with the taxes, but it must be done incrementally. Or let me let me put it in simple language: it should be done. It could be done on a phase basis. Because to hit everything in one blow is a little tough, right? In the sense that, okay, property tax, higher electricity rate, all that, all in one blow. A little tough, right? It could be done incrementally. So we have that that we have to deal with, right? And there's, there are two other little areas that I just want to touch on here again. One, if you have a public utility that is not performing an action have to be taken for that 
utility to perform. Is there a problem? Do you have a problem with it? So let us, because there are a couple of areas, there are a couple of bodies, I will call them bodies, right? That we'll be hearing about. I know the Port Authority was one area, but let us deal with a major one, WASA. Are you satisfied with WASA? Every day, people are cussing and making noise. They can't get water. Every day, people cussing and making noise. They cannot get water. What is the reason for this? What's the reason for this? Well, now you're hearing all kind of, you're hearing excuse. I mean, around this dry season time, you're the traditional excuse about the water levels, right? Traditional excuse, water level, right? You're hearing it. But this is not the only time people have problems for water. You're having problems for water right through the year. But during this time, your excuse now is the reservoirs are low. So we have to distribute water to different areas. Okay. Even if you have to do that, then why do you have to take water from people for one week, two weeks, three weeks? People are without water. And people must be comfortable and sit back and do nothing and say nothing. Even if you take water for an, from an area for a day or two days, and then you give them water again for another day or two, and they take it again, at least people will have some water to survive. But you're locking off water. For 7 days, 14 days, 21 days, 30 days, people can't get water. And this is wasa, right? Now you're hearing all kind of thing now about racket, the racket that goes on in wasa. You're hearing that You're hearing that Tone Cox have been locked off. Right? These areas. Right? Who's locking off? Okay. You're hearing about Wasa officials, people who work in Wasa now, locking off the water. And the reason why they're doing it, they have connections with trucks. They have connection with trucks. So they lock up the water and people in the area can't get water for days and weeks. Trucks have to come and deliver water and pay in all, and you have to pay a truck all kind of $500 for a tank load of water. Right? You spending all this money for water. So it's all about connection, right? It's all about connection, right? This is what they are saying. Right? Because, okay, up to recently, I heard the, the, the minister spoke about that area in Maraval, that they worked on recently and they were supposed to have a supply of water. But strangely, water are being locked off. Who doing it? Like they don't even know who doing it. Just for trucks. Privately owned trucks to go up there. Give them water. I understand also they spoke about Mon Diablo. The same thing. Water being locked off. Privately owned trucks. Have to go to give water. All these things you're hearing. So it's happening all around. Racket is happening. 
right? Racket is happening in the water, right? So when they lock off water and you catching your family for water, truck have to come, right? Truck have to come. You see, this is the problem that we have here. Now, the government, they are speaking now. Well, it has been in the air for a while. But it's getting closer and closer to reality. Restructuring of WASA. Right? Restructuring of WASA. And that entails, because, okay, what they are saying that WASA has too many middle management. Too many middle managers. Let me put it differently. Too many middle managers. Wasa has. And what they are saying now, there is no need for all these managers. You have all these managers in Wasa, and yet still, people can't get water. You have all these middle management in Wasa, and still, you make a complaint, and it's problems to get things done. So what have to happen now? Well, the government or the Minister of Public Utility, they will have to take action, and uh, apparently some of the middle management workers will have to lose their jobs. Now, losing your job is not a good thing. It's not something that anybody wants, right? Because I may have, I, I would have made an investment last year. I may have made an investment this year. I may have made an investment year before, and now I could be out of a job. What is responsible for this? You see the you see the problem here is people are just it look like people are just working. They are just on the job for a salary. But in terms of doing their work, this is where the problem comes in. This is where the problem comes in. They are not doing what they're supposed to do. If they do what they're supposed to do, then we wouldn't have all this problem. WhatsApp will not be in this kind of predicament. So, a serious piece of restructuring had to take place. You know, the thing about it also, how these UNC MPs could know between 2,000 to 2,005 workers could be sent home. How would they know that? No. They could be right, you know. They say they get inside information. They could be right, you know. But when they were in government, how much they sent home? And how much came back on? And how much were rehired? How much they sent home? And how much was rehired? That is why Wasa is back up to full strength. 5,000 plus, right? Because they send home about half of them and then reemploy them. That is why there could be outside there making noise, no one letting you know between 2000 to 2005 workers will be sent home because they know what they did. They know what they did. They know how many workers are. not worthy of being on the payroll. They know. That's why they could come out and make noise and tell you between 2000 to 2005 workers could be sent home. Who knows? They could be right. Because it will not be that amount, but I know if a few hundred of the managers could be out of a job, 
because there are a lot of middle managers which Wasa is saying they are they don't need all that they don't need all of that so it have to be Wasa had to be restructured in order to bring this company i will call it a company or public utility let's I mean, call that public utility up to a level of worthiness because we will be complaining every day about wasa as one of the worst performing public utility We'll be complaining every day. And if the government think, all right, we have to fix this problem, you know. And one of the ways to fix it is to restructure. Well, it will have to be done. Because if you have people sitting in their office as a manager and doing nothing, you have people sitting in the office, you have people as middle managers doing nothing and wasa is being cost more than noon at night then drastic action have to be taken to bring this public utility up to standard and as i said it's one thing about this people's national movement, they do things fearlessly. They don't care about the consequences. If they have to lose an election, they don't care. But they do what they think is best for the country. I don't know if you feel the same way. I don't know if you feel the same way. But things have to be done in order to get these public utility agencies up to standard because it's been going on for too long. It is going on for too long. That is why one area they're not supposed to touch. You see, increasing water rate. That's one area they're not supposed to they're not supposed to touch. Because people cannot get a proper water supply. So that is one area they're not supposed to interfere with. Increasing water rate. Right? Because that one not supposed to happen. What you're paying for? Water that you're not getting? No, they cannot interfere with that one at this time. When people could get a more stable water supply, good. But not at this time. Water supply in this country is terrible. You know, you know. I, I wonder. There are areas that have water 24-7. How those areas are so fortunate to have water 24-7? And there are areas that cannot get water at all. Some of them may get water once a week, twice a week. Some of them a whole week you don't get water. And there are areas that has water 24-7. How do these things happen? Then these are the people you should you should tax. Because they have a regular water supply. But areas that are getting water once a week or twice a week. So a whole week will pass. No water. And you have to wonder how they are, how come we have areas that are never out of water. They have water 24-7. How do these things happen? And other areas cannot get water. So, eh, something is really, really, really wrong, you know. Something is really, really wrong. And we need to understand the runnings of this utility called WASA. You understand? We need to understand these things. I have procrastinated procrastinated enough. It's 15 minutes to 2 o'clock. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, David. Yes, sir. 
I agree with you 100% on that. That some places are water mm-hmm. and some places don't once a week. Mm. And then at all. And then you have to pay the bill. Mm-hmm. Why? You have to pay the bill. You know when you train at the bill? Sometimes you have to wonder. So some people get every day. And some don't. So the richer, the poor have to pay for the richer. Or, 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 what went on it? That's your unfortunate thing, boy. I sure. But I sure feel that you run out of water right now. And the wet, and the rain loss, and the wet loss. Mm-hmm. I sure you run out of water. I went up there yesterday. And no water. And you want to water come one class week. You see? Cut up. I went to wash my hands. I still remember the water. I didn't wash my hands again, is that right? <laughs> no. Uh-huh. Yeah, David, I went to wash my hands. And your man said, water come one class week. And I said, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Because I didn't want to wait. I didn't want to wash my hands. I didn't want to wait. No water. Yeah. Because gentlemen, my girl. Mm-hmm. The man got tank, we have stepped that. But how rain falling? That is the thing. No and rain. The next thing too, you have tank. You have no pipe. It depends on rain. Rain full your tank. What are still selling a bill for you? Mm hmm. What are still selling yeah. that bill? So, as I just say, things need to clear. Right, David? I listen to you. Yes. Hmm. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so if you have anything to contribute, the lines are open now, right? Because I don't know if you are happy, if you are comfortable with the restructuring that they want to do with Wasa in order to, for us to have a more stable water supply. Good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. Um... Aye. We mm-hmm. have been having water problems for years, years and years and years and years. Mm-hmm. But but the thing is, um, when the UN came in in 2010, when the country had money after Doctor after Mister Martin Mister Manning left, they didn't do anything much to improve the lines. They had a lot of rotten rotten lines and all sorts of things. Mm-hmm. But they did put the country in debt because they signed some agreement where they desire friends, the Salinian plan friends. And tax they are saying either five million, either five or seven million US because they want the money in US. The people who own the desert land. Mm-hmm. Every month. We pay for water. Mm-hmm. So where this money must come from? Seven million US is not a little bit of money. And I I looked up the, the um the south. They get the water from the Gulf of Paria. Yeah. So I want to know who paying the Gulf of Paria for water? That is why I want to know. I want somebody to tell me that. Who pay the girls for power for water? Hmm. In my estimation, they're getting this water free. They just have to do what they have to do at the plan and distribute it. Hmm. You understand? Yes. So it's a no-win situation. And the thing is, people have to go to the hospital. They have to get medication. Medication is not cheap. And they have to get it taxes from somewhere. Mm-hmm. You understand? Yes. And then another thing that is worrying me now is with the Venezuelans. Uh-huh. They come, you send them back, they come back in two days, and now they see the government and get them millions of dollars. Hmm. Wow. They come, send them back. But you see, everybody making money from Miaro Beach to wherever they're making money. Yes. You uh, understand? Uh, so this will continue. And look at the money that they pay this to the child. Is it two million? Yeah. And then they're holding these people who paid a little three thousand dollars and in the SS Susu and they can't even get back their money. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You understand? Yes. It's something else. Right? It's corruption. It's all over with this corruption. Every little thing is corruption. Every little thing for the lawyers making plenty of money. Yeah, sure, right. They send back to do something at them and three days they back in some lawyer office. They sue in the government and they gain money. Mm-hmm. And sometimes I just get, you know, send them back where I'm going to and ban the belly and, and, and see where they could wear the country. Venezuela have money, you know? Mm-hmm. Venezuela have money. Yes. You understand? Anyway, thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you. All right, 652 That's our number if you need to get on. 652 Yeah, because, I mean, 
we have to do something now and um we have we got to take a stand there's too much going on right now speak out good afternoon mr matthews coming off of what your last caller would have said mm -hmm. this venezuelan family came here begging a lodging mm -hmm. but like they, they win the lotto twice and they're going back home they don't need to come back trinidad well. because when you convert mm -hmm. you sure for sure yeah you'll be fixed You'll, you'll be able to afford some kind of real estate if they didn't have their own already. Right. You understand? Mm -hmm. So I wonder if our... You remember the other day, there was a strange um, strange judgment, I would say, where... I, 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 I don't think I need to say alleged, where they would have given something like $20 million for the, the perpetrators who would have allegedly um, murdered... Mm -hmm. The lady, yeah, and they said they're holding on that judgment. They can't let that judgment go through. How does alleged? Anyhow, what? Well, I'm saying, al yeah, I'm saying right. alleged because okay. you're not sure which. You understand? As, as, as how the matter still in court, that kind of mm -hmm. way, right? Mm -hmm. I wonder if they could file something like that to reverse that judgment for this. Because remember, you were caught here illegally, <sighs> but I'm... the judge is saying that they were held in almost almost a paraphrasing, almost inhumane conditions. So what kind of conditions do you expect them to be held in? When you're held in a detention center in the United States, isn't it a detention center? Am I a hotel? Am I probably in a hotel? I don't know because... So a catch you here illegally, you're supposed to put your put bed and breakfast, yeah. massage your feet and everything? Yeah, it looked like that. I, I wonder if any one of our citizens were detained over there, if they get that kind of luxury, especially our fishermen mm. who go missing... And we can't seem to find them from time to time. Right. It 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 it, 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 it is a very it is a very strange judgment. When I heard of yep. that that thing of two point five million dollars, when I heard of that, I found it very 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 strange to see the kind of money that these judge give to these people for something like that. <laughs> and not to, <laughs> as a matter of fact, I go to throw it in the ring. You see who the, lo the lawyers are? The? Well, one of, you see who the lawyer is, one of the lawyers. No, I, I, who was one of the lawyers? You do your research, I ain't calling no name, you check. Who was right. one of the lawyers? You check, when I come up the air, every time I come up the air, somebody will call you and remind you. So, My next thing is, uh, uh, go ahead. No, I don't, you're, you're frightened. If he, if he was a, a lawyer, you're frightened to call his name? You can't get in trouble? No. No, 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 no. Uh -huh. You, you call him. You have, you have the guns and everything. You are the caller. You are the caller. <laughs> you could easier for you to call the name. Let somebody else call. Just, just uh -huh. look at the details of the case and who is the lawyer. Uh -huh. Right? Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. Right? The next situation is, uh, I want to throw this in, in your mind for you to Just think now, about just it, right? now. Was the lawyer a, a member of the um, opposition? I don't know. Uh -huh. Okay. I can't I can remember. Uh -huh. When you read the name, you go find it and tell the nation. Uh -huh. What 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 the lawyer name start with? I could tell you where it end with. <laughs> what, the lawyer end with name, end. what the lawyer's name? What lawyer's name start with? It start with a, a R. Uh huh. How you know yeah. that? Well, I, I glimpse it. You glimpse it. Oh. Yeah. Okay. And I couldn't believe it what, with what I was seeing, so I rested on and I look at it again. Okay, Mr. Ramdin. Go ahead. Uh, <laughs> 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 so, something I want to put in your mind for you to think about, right? Mm -hmm. You just said that the, the the management in Wasa is holding the pay in public to ransom, where apparently if they know somebody with a truck or family member with a truck, mm -hmm. they'll be in corruption with them, right? Yes. When you're bringing a water truck, Mr. Matthews, where you store any water in? Where you? Where will you store the water when the water truck reach? Where will, where will you store the water? Well, that's another area. It's a combination. You have to get a tank. Exactly. Exactly. If you have a family member or you have a, tank, a, a, a hardware yourself or you have shares in those companies that supply water tanks, what do you think is going to happen? And the cost of tanks are going to go up because it's in demand. Yeah. And the sale of tanks are going to go up. Mm hmm And it's happening. So, 
So we will drive that. And there's a saying, and I'll use it from an animated movie from Hollywood, which is a little lizard in the desert. The turtle said, when you control the water, you control who drink. Oh. oh. Right? Right. Oh. If any of your callers saw that movie, they could identify with what I say. Mm. When you control the water, you control who drink. Oh. And you know we can't stand this. Yeah. Well, this is what we right? have to put up with, boss. And I, I, I hope something could be done to bring this level of corruption down. Because the minister is saying it. I am not just saying it. You know, I'm just saying what the minister would have said. And I, I, I honestly, now the la- one of the last callers would have said that the UN came into power and they did nothing to try and fix the problem. I remember when, I do not know if it's this present utilities minister, but one of them would have said it's not a quick fix to Wasa in terms of the the, um, the infrastructure. It will take you an average of, let's say, 15 to 25 years for them to fix and, and remedy everything, right? Well, that will and entail, that will use, that, that's something different. That, that will entail running of new lines and that sort of thing. That's something that's right. different. Right. So, so this is what I'm saying. Not in defense of the last administration, but with this on the books, to say, for the remedy water, we know now we cannot be using 1960s pipelines to run 2024 water pressure with the pumps and systems that we have in place. We cannot do that. So now that we know it will take us a 25-year period alongside the, the as you say, the, the, the restructuring of the employees and what have you. Mm. Hopefully, because even though you restructure the employees, they would now say they're short staff, they can't deliver here and there, right? The, 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 the system's not up to mark. So I hope that they they work hand in hand where they they, they restructure with mm. the employees and they do the infrastructural work alongside and they fix it in such a way that government come, government go, cannot be interfered with. Well, boy, it sounds interesting, government come, government go. Once right. government changes... They stop what was being done and they will try to do something different. That is why a lot of things remain remain just hanging when the government changed in 2010. A lot of things remain there hanging because the government that came into power left it. I know nothing about that, so I leave it there. There were a lot of things remain hanging in 2010. Right? So when government changes... You see what happens. All right, man. I'm well, hoping that it doesn't change, especially with those things in place that need to be ironed out. You remember water because for all? Be... You remember water for yeah. all? What happened? Yep. Yeah. What happened? Well, pipelines were run, but I don't know if everybody gets. Oh, okay. And of course, right. somebody said they only know about one pipeline. Anyhow, I hear but you. But you remember, remember mm. on the, on the, when they when they when they um when they demitted office, remember there was a fire in Valpain, Wasa. Mm-hmm. What become of that? And why suddenly that particular department where all the paperwork was had a fire? Because somebody wanted to get rid of the records. Oh, okay. Yeah. So all the right. only way to all do right. it is to is, is to burn it down, and that's what happened. All right. Well, we go yeah. leave it there for the for the other callers to call in. Okay, Thank man. you very call. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Hello, good afternoon. Hi, Mr. Matthews. Uh-huh. Um, well, when they file that judgment and they get that money, they go back to their country. They're not allowed to stay in Canada and Tobago no more, right? So work also get no more money, right? Uh-huh. You can't. Because if you sue a country, you can't buy the hand that feeds you. In America, here, yes. if I sue my company that I work in for, before I sue them, I have to resign my job. You understand? Okay. You could sue them, but you have to resign. They're not going to keep you here on other, uh, um, other employer. 
Right? You have your rights to do what you need to do to get what you need to get. But these people cannot afford to, to sue you and then stay in the country they need to get out. And that is that's supposed to be included in the judgment. I don't understand them judge and them all you have here. Because I could say for myself, I think all of them to get a cut in that money. Hmm. Those people are getting half of that money because they understand half of the English that they tell them when they finish there. Okay? Mm. So this is another, mm. everywhere you turn into that is racket. And you know what? Everybody will say, oh, no privatize the company. But you need to do that. So much strain is on the government. If you probably privatize all these companies, then you might not have to pay land tax. You understand? Because they need to be run efficiently. And all these middle man, ma- management people, them just say for a paycheck to some at you. You know that? And then they have your friend with all these, who own all the companies in Trinidad. It's not me and you, Mr. Matthews. Hmm. So when they're done now, they're setting up their friend and them, and them getting a cut, okay, and suffering people. And how you think? Why you think they're losing their water every other day? They have to come and clean it back on. That's too much work for them. You understand? Yeah. If they cut it off for 30 days, they don't want to come back. They just go back and they put their foot up on their desk and they sit down and they relax, right? But mm. if they want to give you water for three days, they have to come out on the truck and do their work. That is too much work for them to do. But you, but, but what are you going to do? It's a paradise, no living it. Oh, yeah. So they milk the government until until they can milk them no more. That's all. Yes, I got you. You know, and you know, and you know, we we, we sit down and we, we we say these things so carelessly, and we don't understand what it is we're doing to the country and to the people. And then the poor man keep getting poor because we have to continuously pay. You can't buy food for your family. You understand? Mm-hmm. And then you have these people coming from another country. You give them a shelter, and then they turn around and they sue you. Eh? And walking away with millions of dollars. You all need to put something about on the constitution. Need to change. That can't happen here. Because the, the other day, right? We mm-hmm. have a set of people down on the border in Mexico. They support pictures. They say they're inhumane. I ain't here nobody to them. Hmm. Right. And down there was bad, okay? Yeah. People got rape and all kind of things. You know what? Because the first thing they would do is just put them over back over the border and wash their hands of the situation. Yeah. How you won't get in my country to sue me? You understand? So something, something is adding up. These lawyers are them running all your country. They make sure they sit down and they save all the money. They send the children to be lawyers. And now they sit down and they're laughing at me and they're getting rich off of all of us. Well, all I can say right now, all I can say right now, Paula, what is wrong is right. So, and what is right is right. Very, very right. <laughs> You know what, something got to give, Mr. Matthews, because we, it's too much, it's too much. This government is dealing with, and all we hear about is crime, but we're not hearing about the white-collar crime. We're not hearing about all the other injustices that are going on. When we give up our space to bring people into this country, whether it's my country, the U.S., whatever, and what about the other people who are suffering in the process? You understand? When you could turn around and sue my country and get two million, no, I, I don't understand. That could only happen in Trinidad, but probably that's what the paradise is about. So uh, much fun, they must get in talk. You have lawyers. Yeah, well, them lawyers and them smart because they need to change the constitution. So, what's a lawyer? A lawyer have a right to decide any law and dissect it and come up with a way where he could win money. And if you have all these loopholes, that is what is going to continuously happen. You can't blame the lawyer from doing their job. Well, well, you know what? I will blame you now. <laughs> It's time for the 2 o'clock news update. Okay, bye. Thank you. (laughs) All right, so we take the 2 o'clock news update and we'll be back. Welcome to our 2 p.m. news update on WAC 90.1 FM. 
Public Utilities Minister Marvin Gonzalez has dismissed claims from Opposition Senator Wade Mark and Princess Town MP Barry Padarat of imminent mass retrenchment of workers at the Water and Sewage Authority. Patriotic Front political leader Michaela Pandey says the PNM and the UNC have both failed when it comes to the implementation of property tax. Tourism Minister Randall Mitchell and Pantry and Bago President Beverly Ramsey Moore are both denying there is any conflict of interest in the rental of the steel band body's Port of Spain headquarters. Regionally, the Institute of Professional Petroleum Accountants of Guyana Incorporated, established only four months ago locally, is gearing to roll out a specialized oil and gas audit training for locals. Internationally, a judge in New York has granted Donald Trump's request to pause his $464 million fraud judgment, giving him 10 days to put up a reduced sum of $175 million. And that's a look at our 2 p.m. news update. Join us at 4 p.m. for details of those stories and more in our major newscast on WAC 90.1 FM. This Easter Sunday, March 31st, at the Cipriani Labor College, Valsane, I Am Jazz Festival presents Jazz is Blue, featuring saxophone sensation Mike Phillips, Elon Parley, Len Booksy Shaw, Nisa, Irvin Alves, Marcus Hippolyte, and more. Come and see our unique artisans and interact with your favorite artist. Tickets are available at Simon's Musical Supplies, Crosby's, King's Lounge, Barber Spa, Arima, and Movie Town, Port of Spain. Sasu in Mid Center Mall, Sion's Bar, I Live for Glam, Val Park Shopping Plaza, Gates Open at 4 30 p.m. Showtime is 5 p.m. Wear something blue, bring a friend or two. Sponsored by King's Lounge Barber Spa, Clinical Media Group, Mount Irvin Bay Resort, Blue Water, Carrot Brewery, Duft Hair Products, Prodel Sound, Music TT, and Professional, The Lullaby Group, and Blind Effects. Parts proceed go to the Diabetes Association of Trinidad and Tobago. For more information, Information call 386 4748 or 380 1222. I am Jazz Festival. Jazz is blue. Ayo. It was nice, so we're doing it twice. Join us for the WAC Meet and Greet Local. We're celebrating the 20th anniversary of WAC 90.1 FM at Marion Oaks Community Centre in Ocala. On Saturday, June 15th, the Father's Day weekend from 6 p.m. Dress code is white with a touch of red. Come and meet Mr. Feely. The sea of WAC Radio, your favorite radio station. You make the wrong choice. That's for singers with them cold. Music for dancing by DJ Richard C of Wack Radio. All inclusive tickets, singles forty dollars, couples seventy five dollars. Book your ticket for the Wack Meet and Greet now. Call Shortman at eight one three two six three two one two seven or Dance a Boy at nine one seven seven five three three one two three. Get discount on hotel accommodation. Call 352-261-0024. Mention WAC 90.1 F. It was nice, so we're doing it twice. Hello, Mr. Feely. Hey, Trinidad and Tobago. You see, Gloria, Saturday, Saturday, the 30th of March, San Fernando would never be the same again. Because everybody heading to Asselis by the park. Because Carib Street Boys and Wilkie's presents the annual Back in Times party with the best DJs in the land. Featuring Peter, Alpha B, Mr. Desmond, and of course, yours truly, Mr. Q. Starting time is 9 p.m. and we dancing all the way till dawn. Admission is $80, two-on-one tickets for $140. And at the door, you pay more. For more information, you can call Atelier's by the Park, Sion's Bar, that's on Royal Road. And of course, you can get your tickets from Wilkie's, 620-3169. That number again is 620-3169. Remember, we dancing down at Atelier's by the Park. It's another Carib Street Boys and Wilkie's promotion. San Fernando, we coming. Spiritual Baptist Faith presents on Friday, 22nd March 2024, our first open air service at Isaac Junction, Coover at 7 p.m. Our dress code is national colors. Come and hear some dynamic men and women of God expound the gospel of Jesus Christ. On Monday, the 25th of March 2024, 
The following activities will take place. Opening of the second entrepreneurial village at 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Men of Balov service, 7.45 p.m. to 9 p.m. Dress code blue. Tuesday, the 26th of March, 2024, exhibition which commences from Tuesday to Thursday, 28th March, 2024, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Entrepreneurial Village, Tuesday to Saturday, from 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. DOC presentation, Tuesday to Thursday, 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Youth for Christ, dress code white, starts at 6 p.m. Wednesday, the 27th of March, 2024, Woman of Substance Service. The time is 6 p.m., dress code pink. Thursday, the 28th of March, 2024, Myla Spiritual Baptist Experience. Starts 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The Spiritual Baptist Diaspora Service. Time is 6 p.m., dress colored. Saturday, the 30th of March, 2024, Spiritual Baptist Liberation Day Service, which commences at 9 a.m., dress code colored. All events will take place at the Administrative Building, Balmain, Coover. See you there. Numbers to call. Local, 652-4901. International, 1786-292-2789. Numbers to call, local, 652-4901, international, 1786-292-2789. Numbers to call, local, 652-4901, international, 1786-292-2789. So it's just about 10 minutes after the of uh, 2 o'clock, uh, the time ticks along to 11 minutes after the hour of 2 o'clock right here on 90.1 FM in the beautiful island of Trinidad and Tobago. We back, speak out. Good afternoon everyone, how was your weekend? My weekend was tiring. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but the kind of things I created in my side, yo. Yes. But be positive and be strong. Thank you. Um, uh, what I want to say is, um, I look at the situation with the bones that have been found. You understand? Know, mm-hmm. And um, with the body in, in this area. And um, if you put to a sentence, you know, 18 years or so, mm-hmm. or what age, a teenager, or what, um, any bird, if it's a family that died among them, any birds and death should have registered all these children um, that this man have children for or somebody in the neighborhood or something who could be missing the daughter. It's just, this is a son now. Therefore, he, that boy has to be registered with birth and death. Mm-hmm. Yes, oh. and with birth. Buddha so they're going to be... Buddha yes. Oh. Yes. So, so they must know if this father had a son that is missing, or a daughter that is missing. You know what I mean? Oh. If they go through the record, they have to be registered, or in some hospital, yeah. this child has to be born. So they must have a record, if it's, if it's a boy, if he was born in a hospital, or if he's registered with birth and death, with birth especially. Mm-hmm. You know, so they will get a record of the father name, and all the children name, that, that, um, that he um, think, oh, if somebody, you some the old missing or something oh. Anyhow, I just have two beers. According to what they say, drink oh. rubber, mind your business. Okay, well... Go drink water and mind your business. Oh, okay. Have a good day. Check well, one minute, I'm not there. No, no, no. I, I will be... <laughs> I don't drink beer. I'll you be have, eight and mine. You have enough over. You have enough over the weekend. I'll be eight and mine. Okay, have a good day. <laughs> Thank you, too. Bye. Thank you. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so. mm. So, this is the interesting areas that we had to pay attention to people. Good afternoon. Yeah, David, how are you going? Easy, man. 
Mm-hmm. I lady running, she mouth and them lawyers in the country, boy. So she shouldn't do that? No, well, but you know, wild man too, boy. The first, the top three people in this country. Uh-huh. The first lady, the president, and the speaker of the house. She had a lawyer, boy. I ended up them in the same category. So, what, what do you mean then? So, so, so you shouldn't run your mouth on them? You shouldn't say nothing about them? Well, I, now I say she heaping up everybody and them is with Lily White, you know. They may have no problem. You know. They may have no corruption. They may not. Because them is, them is a different kind of lawyer I looking like. Mm. When she lumping lawyer. Mm. And, and to beat it to, I have a lady to call, I think it's Leticia James from in the States, boy. Mm. I think she's a lawyer too. Okay. She's the one who in Trump backside. I'm trying to get your point, you know. No, well, I tell, I see the lady saying how them, well, them lawyers are corrupted. Uh-huh. I tell you, they are the three top of man in this country. President, Speaker, mm-hmm. and the other one there. Oh. The, oh three of them are lawyers, and the, and the Prime Minister's wife, she's so, a lawyer. So she was referring, I'm over the idea of their position. She's a lawyer too? She and her is a lawyer too. Oh, so, 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 what were they saying? So, the call was targeting women or something? No lawyer. So how you only call now the woman? No, when I say top top people now, nah. I don't want them little, 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 little fellas and them. I don't want real big lawyer, high lawyer, and the one they call Letitia James in the states. She put her boyfriend to see about Trump and paying him. That is high lawyer. That way you call lawyer. Oh. <laughs> yeah. All right. When she come back, ask you if she mean them kind of lawyer. Okay. Yeah, Thank you. <laughs> Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Mr. Matthews. How are you? Everything sweet for now. Great. Mm-hmm. I didn't get a chance to call before the two o'clock news. Uh-huh. But I wanted to to address you know, to, to speak on a couple of things that I was addressed with regard to the taxes and the water and things like that, if mm-hmm. I may. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. So, but the first thing I want to say is that the price of progress is high, no matter what we do. Um, people are complaining about the property tax, but property taxes are there to fix the roads, etc. While I know Trinidad, there are a lot of potholes everywhere. Mm-hmm. That is what the property tax is there to do, to help the, for us. To increase the to build the infrastructure. Mm-hmm. However, the problem with the, the the whole the infrastructure as far as the government in itself, there's no accountability. Mm-hmm. And while the people are complaining, they are complaining to the wrong entity. Mm-hmm. They have to rise up in essence against that which is impeding on them. As far as the water is concerned. I'm 60, I'm 62 years old. Great, great. My grandmother, my grandmother w- was born into water restriction. And that's how it's identified as water, as water restriction. Why are we still in 2024 on the island of Trinidad, still under water restriction in the, the context that it is? Great, great question. The, yes, the people need to rise up not by just running their mouth. They need to rise up and, and make the, the country accountable, those that are running the show accountable for ensuring that the people, based on the money that they are paying into as far as taxes, et cetera, they need to be accountable for those funds. And that's part of the problem. There's no accountability. Mm-hmm. And so, But property tax should be paid. You cannot live for free. We need to look at countries like China. Mm-hmm. China was at the bottom of the totem pole, as they, they they still put it. Look at where China is today. We have to invest in order to have progress. Mm-hmm. But we also have, as a people, you paying your taxes, you have to make the government accountable for those taxes that which you pay. I'm living in a neighborhood, I'm paying property taxes. Property taxes should be based on a certain dollar amount 
based on the cost of the house. Mm-hmm. Those roads need to be fixed in your in your neighborhood. You know, things like that in mm-hmm. terms of the country, the infrastructure, roads, etc. Those things should be done with the property taxes. Mm-hmm. You have people that's collecting a pension that has never put anything in the system. There needs to be some, it, it, those things need to be re-looked at because 200 years of pain doing the same thing without a refresh is not going to help the country. So that's just my two cents. Great. Thank you very much. Have a good day, sir. To you too. Mm-hmm. Good afternoon to you. All right. Good afternoon, sir. Yes, sir. Uh-huh. I just want to address something here that you know, wait, 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 wait. You know, because you know foreign caller today, right? No, 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 <laughs> no. Right. Uh-huh. But justice is justice when I live in South Africa, India, Africa, Pakistan, America, Canada. Justice is justice. And justice must be a must appear to have been done in your country. Otherwise, internationally, you're going to get sidelined. So, you want to be in that money for something that the court decides. Is not, nothing is wrong with that. If you in America and you get in a vehicle accident and the court awarded damages, what is wrong with that? So, because you're not from the country, justice, you are not entitled to justice. Any part of the world you go, justice is justice. The court is independent. How could you say? That is just getting part of the money. That is not, that is true. That is unrealistic. The justice, the, 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 the judicial system is an independent organization. Mm-hmm. And the, the, the administrative justice associates fit. It doesn't matter if it's red, green, blue, yellow, black. I mean, if somebody could speak that way, mm-hmm. they, will, they will uphold apartheid. Because mm-hmm. apartheid was wrong to a certain color of people. So you can't treat a certain people one way because they come from a different country. Whether they are born in the moon and they come to this country and they were wrongly treated, the court is there for you to use to get justice. Mm-hmm. And nothing is wrong with that. Whoever you are, mm-hmm. some, something was done against you and you feel that you feel remorse and you're, you want to go to the court to seek justice. I mean, nothing is wrong with that. So, tell Benny, you don't get money it's no big thing. I could go in America right now and win the lotto. I, I could be a foreigner. Uh-huh. Yeah, but it could be my money. So I I love how the judgment went. It shows children in a real mature light. And that the guys away from, if you come to this country, and injustice should perpetrate against you, you could get justice in Trinidad. And that, that goes well for our country. So that goes well so, for our country. So that little baby boy, so that little two year old boy was right to get that two million dollars. Well, according well, to the I, judge, according to the according to the judge. See, of course, according mm-hmm. to what the judge to have all the facts and, and evidence. And he made his judgment, nothing is wrong with us. He said fit award that damages to the boy. And we can't be angry for that. I and I, I try to make fact came across whether the state is going to challenge it, you know, or appeal it. it be well, they have, a, they have an option to appeal it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and they have an option to do that. But we can't, we're not supposed to question, well, we can question it, but the, judge, the, the judicial system is independent, and the judge makes his decision. You can, we can appeal it, we can, we can go to England and all of it. Mm-hmm. But justice is justice. Justice must be only something that people feel and they must know it exists mm-hmm. in our country. So I am for in our community that now we're gonna feel comfortable to know that I am I, I, I am afforded justice in Trinidad. And I cannot be I cannot not be that fair with wrongly. But on the other hand now mm-hmm. we have to put our house in order. If somebody's illegal don't wait for it to be the state before them in the earliest time. You see Cuban boy get deported, you have nothing to say now. Before them, under all the legal ramifications, do it within the state, and they wouldn't be going through that. You understand? Mm-hmm. But, Uphold the law. But you feel, you feel deported the Cuban boy was something wrong? You come from Cuba and come here and, 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 and cost any government every, every time on social wrong, media. Take, well, I... 
I couldn't believe that Salah was in legal in Trinidad and behaving that way. Oh, all right. And I have all rights to deport him. You have to be mad. Mm-hmm. You illegal. And you cut to the gun. Nah, 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 nah. And then making some racist video with a black face and that. You don't know that? That is racist. Right. That was racist in America about 40 years ago. How you can come and play that here in Trinidad? Yes. Let them live in regret in Cuba, wherever you came from. Right. Good to Yeah, man, thanks. <laughs> yeah. There's the thing. You illegally and you cussing the government every Monday morning. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Mr. Matthew. Yes, sir. This is Tony. This is Tony from New York, sorry. Well done, well I done. Am, mm-hmm. I'm responding to the young lady who called a little while ago and mentioned China and how to condition China was in years ago and the way they are now. Mm-hmm. I, I've called him several times about this and mentioned this before on, on the radio station. You see, we, we, we who live in abroad mm-hmm. also want things to change in Trinidad. We want Trinidad to be accommodating to us the lifestyle we live in abroad. So when we go back there, we can have that comfort. And also the Trinidadians will also have that same comfort. But the thing is, we have to get together out here. China and all these other countries that's doing really good, they have the extensions outside also bringing in income. If we, as Trinidadians abroad, can organize ourselves and create business here, I can guarantee you Trinidad is going to benefit from it and Trinidad is going to change. Mm. It, it, you know, it, it, it's, it's hard for some of them to see it right now, but some of the changes that need to go on in Trinidad, mm. we have to be responsible for it outside here too. You know, it's... It, it, in, I, I can't understand why we cannot come together. In yeah, we're not doing it. We're not doing it, and it will benefit Trinidad so much. All of us love our country, so let us get together here, build cooperation here, and it, and, and and carry it back home, carry the funds back home. You know, make the country a, a, a better place. We always call it a paradise, and, and it's not the way we left it. It has changed. Take some of the blame. Let us bring it back to where it was. Don't just complain about what, what, where Trinidad is now and what the people are doing. We have to um, accept some of the blame. Let us do something. Let, let us come together and do something about uh, what the place of our birth. Mm-hmm. And stop sitting back and, and complaining. I'm listening, Mr. Matthew. Okay, sir. Thank you very much. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Oi. I... There'll always be views. There'll always be views. You understand? But it comes right back to one thing and one thing. We have been engulfed in wrong for too long. And it's about time we put the wrong in the circle it's supposed to be in, which is the right circle. Move it from the left circle and put it in the right circle. Good afternoon. Yes, sir, Mr. Matthews. Uh-huh. I just want to call back and address your last caller. Mm-hmm. Uh, I agree completely. The problem is that what the the bureaucracy that you have to go through when you get to the to Trinidad, and I think we can take a page out of the the of, of Africa where they, they're doing certain things to, in, to encourage people to return to Africa and build. They did not say come in and, 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 and take over or come in. They say come in with your knowledge, with your, your skill set to help build a country. And that's the bureaucracy that we have to deal with. Because I come home to Trinidad a lot. Mm-hmm. And I mean, just the simple thing, I, I went to a, a, a spa appointment. The young lady had me sitting there an hour past my time and when I, I uh, addressed her. She told me, oh, I thought you were local. Oh. What? Mm. And I had to explain to her, the people that live here pay your salary. You treat everybody the same way. Mm-hmm. It, it's the mentality that's hard to deal with. When I come in, I try to do certain things. I wanted to open a, a business in Trinidad, but the bureaucracy is what I had to deal with. So, you know, if you don't look a certain way, it's not accommodating. Yeah. Mm. I digress. I heard that too, my girl. Thank you. 
Thank you, sir. All right. Hmm. Good afternoon to you. Yeah, good afternoon, David. Uh-huh. Uh, when you start off your program, or so many in your program, you were talking about the situation with water. Yes. And you mentioned a very serious and important and truthful thing is that they're not doing what they're supposed to do. Mm-hmm. Now, we're going to tell you something. Both WASA and HDC operate the same way. You know why the class in, 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 in WASA doesn't do what they're supposed to do? Tell me. It's not only because they're doing what they're supposed to do. Because the vast majority of employees of WASA don't know what to do. They don't know what to do. Mm-hmm. And I can tell you why they know what to do. Do all, don't be more of them. They have some people in WASA who are highly skilled who don't do their work. But they are of the minority. Do you know how we get our work in WASA and HEC? Tell me. They had the same problem, had the same problem in HEC. When you call and you make a, 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 a complaint about a problem in the house, whether it's electrical plumbing or otherwise, or tile falling out, yeah. they have come and fix it three, four, five times and it never fix properly. Never. Right. Problem. So here is the problem. Do you know how we just get our work in HEC and WASA? Oh boy, friend and family. When you, campaign, when you campaign for election and you hit the pavement, all all the politicians, whether it's UNC, PPP, PNM, or all who go, mm-hmm. as soon as they get in power and you hit the pavement in, 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 with them, campaigning with them and so on, and they win, whoever wins, mm-hmm. you go back by the man who you, you, you campaign for, you go back by the fellow who become the NP. You see, well, you know I can't be with you right through the election. I work hard in my son, and I had to get something to do. You know what they just send him? Mm-hmm. He said, I work for this girl, let her send her by WASA, who by HDC. You see, they very rarely will give a letter to go by TNT. You know why? Why? TNT is highly skilled, and you could dead day if you don't know what you're doing. Well, what about your train? Well, no, Petrochen had very, it, it's a different story. That's why I'm calling it. Uh-huh. Petrochen had very, Petrochen had very highly skilled workers who know how they're doing. Okay. You think when they come, right? So we, that's a different story about what it is with contractors yeah. and all kinds of mamas, different yeah. things. Yeah? The contractors yeah. will, well, as a contractors will end up, have to do the same work four and five times. So that's what that problem is. Mm-hmm. But the workers that was employed directly with Petrochen. So that's how in Petrochen, you have to have a, you have to have a skill yeah. both times. But you didn't have no laborers. Mm-hmm. The contractor is doing labor and things and other things. So, yeah. Petrochen is a different story. I call those two names, they may be others, yeah. because what I think is true. Now, yeah. We like people that they work, and you make a point to say nobody wants people to lose their work. Mm-hmm. But they were happening. What was supposed to happen when the PMP or whoever helped these people to go and get a work in WAS or HDC, they're supposed to have a training program. But you tell them a training program. NP have a training program. The other company we could call would have a training program. Mm-hmm. When workers join them with the, with the subjects and things, according to their, their skills, they are sending them in a training program to train them to do work. Now, you see, you're very rare to say people talk about tea and tech, do our work and tech do good. Yes. You know why? Right. It's training. And they, all of them have a little fault. But that's one of the best run entities around. Because mm-hmm. then, for that, they have this comfort technical school and know they work. Yeah. They can't, the MP can't take at the most the MP could do, and they have a letter to work. Tier text for work is as a driver or some other thing. Right. But to work there, you have to be skilled. So I said the fault is, is the various different government over the years was in power. As again, power did not send people to work there because they, and I'm not wrong with that, you know. I sure, I sure, I sure about WASA. I heard that one from people who walk in there. I sure about yeah. that one. So yeah. the first thing you're supposed to do, nothing wrong with helping a, 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 a human being to get a job. Anybody with a job, but you're supposed to have a training program. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So when you feel that come, you train them somewhere to be going to work. Right? If you use the send the people to WASA because it's have plenty of manual hard work me up like do. And if you have ambition, you go watch and you go load the work and you go come and you go load the work. Yeah. But if you have no ambition and you just want to work and collect it, pay and go. And there is no training program for mm-hmm. that individual. That is how they end up. So you see, in making a WASA and HDC always is, we have to blame them politicians for the last 60 years. They don't do that. Right. End up doing that. As I tell you, I don't want people to feel that I feel like a man must know a woman must get a work. Yes. But you have some kind of program to train them so let them know this is what we do and this is how we do it. You understand? Mm, yes. So that so that they find um they are walking down the road, I drive it and I go, have a picture it. <laughs> mm, mm. I drive it to go by and I see some people putting up a sign. 
at 50, at 40, 40 miles per hour side. Okay. 40 miles per hour side, they have a backhoe digging the hole. Mm-hmm. And they have, I check 11 men putting up that side, 11 people. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> okay. It happens. I, I, think, I think what I picked up, you know. Uh-huh. So I we don't need bypass it to go on a better day. I say, but we are all these men to put up this. Well, well that, that, that really, that really is a work for, for three people, you know. You see? back off. You back off for it and tell that people to, to hold up the post and throw this event inside of it. Anyway, mm-hmm. that, that is what caused what I said is Jesus the only is. If you're giving somebody a job, they say, teach them the job. Teach them so they could promote themselves and get better and better and have the entity running properly. Yes. Have a nice day. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. yes. Thank you. Yeah. Good day to you. Speak out. Good afternoon, Admiral David. How are you, sir? Well, everything sweet for now. Well, you know, I intended to just listen today. But when I hear people calling with misinformation and speaking so authoritatively of those the gospel truth, I am forced to call, okay? Now, many times I call here and you hear me when people say about in America, we got 50 states in America. I keep repeating myself, okay? Florida has 67 counties. And the laws vary from one county to the next. And I keep saying, so when people call and say in America, okay? I just mm-hmm. miss it immediately. A caller said there is justice and justice all over the world. Let me explain quickly, okay? Mm-hmm. That. In America, all right, we have what you call sanctuary cities, like New York, one of them, where illegal aliens go and they're getting benefits, and they're giving the Mayor Adams a hard time because of it. Our, our nincompoop governor here shipped all illegal aliens, you must have heard already, to the north, okay? Mm-hmm. He doesn't warn them here. So a two-year-old, five-year-old, you can be a hundred-year-old, you would not have been in New York, in our Florida, to sue the government, okay? Mm-hmm. And now our governor passed some draconian laws. If I were driving with an illegal alien, I can be charged. All right? Mm-hmm. So please, before you get on the airways and make statements, please do a little research. And somebody could call from here and say that the boy doesn't know what he's talking about. But we do have sanctuary cities. Um, uh, Texas just went to court, to the Supreme Court, because they said, you know what? Anybody come here from Mexico, wherever they come from, we're sending them back. So you can't go there and sue them. If, you, if we come here illegally, we have to hide in the underground economy. Okay? So please. When you're making statements about America, research it. Have a blessed one, my friend. Thank you. Right. Mm-hmm. Good afternoon to you. Good afternoon. Yes, sir. Uh-huh. The guy who talked, I was talking about the, um, about Petrochin, the, that didn't so go on Petrochin. Mm-hmm. The labor officer used to collect that. Oh, the labor officer? Yeah, that yeah, them was, yeah, them was making the, the thing there. Mm-hmm. Oh. If you have a call, if you have a call or a boat for him, you bring him inside outside and you go to go. Yeah. Oh. Uh-huh. Right. We're running all the all institutions, everything run. Once it's a government institution, it happens. Yeah, yeah, it happens. Yeah. Yes, yes. Uh-huh. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, brother. That's why they have a lot of unqualified workers in all these areas. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Mr. Dewey. Yes, sir. How can he get past all the community? Um, um, you want to find, okay. find out from him for me? You know what Yeah. I still don't think he gets past all. Well, I don't know if he get it. He, he, he must come through. He must come across the border, probably. So you don't have one. Is the wind come through? Is the wind come through? Through the border? <laughs> right. So you don't He's have my one. Father, man. You don't have one. Huh? You don't have one. You think afraid of come back? You think afraid of come back to the land? That? You think afraid of come back to the land? Mm-hmm. You don't have one. Yeah. You never have a good paper. Good. 
Right. Number four, number 45, number 45. Uh-huh. Okay? Not me, eh? Number uh-huh. 45. Uh-huh. Good. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Hello, good day to you. David Admiral Fireman Morfire Ono Matthews Boy. I wouldn't call the next one. Uh-huh. Yes, sir. Thank you. Well, I know getting my vehicle, so I'm not sure if what I am about to speak about was spoken already. Uh-huh. Um, but all you talk about the the award what the Venezuelan get? It was mentioned, but if you want to elaborate on it, you go ahead. Yeah, but David, something had to be wrong in this country. Because, David, listen, hear that. You come here illegally. Mm -hmm. Not to say you come and you overstay your time, you know. You come here illegally on the 20th. They deport you back. You came back again four or five days after. And they hold you. Now, the government, through some of these unscrupulous lawyers, mm-hmm. you, the government, had to pay two point something million to somebody. What is the message you sending to the rest of people? What is the message you sending to the rest of the um, Venezuelans or immigrants? Come. And then now, you have these, well, when I say it, people just say it, but how I think. But all of that is why our, judi- our judicial system is why we have so much crime in the country. Oh, oh. Why? Because why? 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 Be- because of some of these judges and magistrates, uh, the, the, the judicial system. All of that is why we have so much thing going on in the country. Because people, you know, they're laughing at me. You come here illegally, you know. Yeah. Illegally, not to say that I say, not to say that you come here to the normal channel and you overstay your time. If that was the case, okay, fine, we could. Because, you know, Trinidad and a lot of Trinidad and up in the states who overstay the time and still up there. Mm-hmm. You understand? So, we have a problem with that pussy. But you come here illegally, you didn't pass to the normal channel. We send you back. You come back and now we have to pay you. The government supposed to appeal their case. I, 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 this was trying to figure out if the, I can't remember if I heard them spoke about appealing it, you know. You know, but I'll have to check it out. But, 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 are the government supposed to appeal their case? I, I wouldn't be surprised. I think they will. Hey, let me, let me go up the road. Who are more confident, more foul? Let me go up, go up yeah. the road. Mm-hmm. If you are doing it, please come, so we go in. Because you, I mean, you know, here, David, you know the, the, both the gentleman admit in court that he come here illegally. Well, yeah, well, I mean, he didn't lie that he came illegally, yeah. The man admitted. Mm-hmm. Yeah. By David, by listen, eh? by this writer right, always say. Eh? And the award is ready for the baby, you know. Is the baby really, you know? Yeah. But not the mommy, but, really the baby. But David, I don't care who it is. A two point five part of my my tax money gone there, you know. Mm-hmm. Well, well, you know what you could do for me. What? Try going when it will like illegally and you let me know what won. If you have any. But you don't see what you don't see what you don't see what has happened. Some of them don't even come back. <laughs> I don't know if they has reached. Well, 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 well. You understand? Mm-hmm. So you want to come to tell me, and I want to say, it has certain lawyers in this country and judges. And I make no apologies for that because I know there are people who come and say that they're doing the work, but you. You can't tell me that that makes sense. Well, I ain't care what nobody say. To us, to us, to us, it may not, but to the lawyers, it make financial sense. Yeah, because, sense. because, yes, because them getting out of that 2.5 million, the baby might, might just get, if the baby get 500,000, he get plenty. Especially if, if they're doing pro bono. Well, again, well, I'm but sure. they, they, Listen, 
Nobody ain't doing that pro bono, David. Yeah. Come on. Yeah, because no. yeah, because the 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 the, the people we represent them will not have the money. So you did pro bono? David, you what happened? Yeah, what's going on? They they're doing it on a percentage of your award. So oh. that can be pro, pro bono. How pro bono works? Pro bono mean you're doing it for free? No, sir. No string, no, no string is attached? No, no. But if I'm doing it for a percentage of what is awarded to you, that can be pro bono? Is that pro bono? Oh! Uh, if a percentage, a percentage of what is awarded to you. Oh, uh, okay. Right? You get the money after, it, uh, right? After a judgment is made, you, uh, you get the money on, on a percentage. Well, on a percentage, but... Yeah. but I can't see what that is pro bono. Well, get into the field of law. All right, okay. I will I will do my research and come back to you. You know that. Do it for me, please, sir. Yes, I will. All right. You understand? Yes, sir. And them fellas and them, they're getting big money, David. Well, yeah. Big, big money. That is the work. Yeah, that is the work. Yeah. I hear you. Everything does go good until the chickens come home to roost, you know. Well, until, until then. Until the chickens come home to roost, you know. When it reach in your, when it reach in your garden, then you just know, you know. Then you just know. Yeah. Well. So let it go ahead now, man. Let it go ahead, man. Okay. God don't sleep, you know. He does only put on pajama. Papa, I'm gone with that. Thank you, sir. Nice. Oh, you know God has put on pajamas, boy. Hello, good afternoon. <laughs> Mr. Martin, good afternoon. How are you doing? Easy, easy, man. Mm -hmm. you, you know, we, we like to talk, as Dancer Boy rightly said, we talk about things we don't know about. Mm -hmm. Trinidad and Tobago have signed certain memorandum of agreement to help foreigners when they seek political asylum in the country. So we have to actually be glad that this did not reach the Privy Council because it would have cost more. Judges don't... Judges don't, 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 don't make laws. They, they, they interpret the law. The decision the judge make was based on the law. So you can't be against the judge. Trinidad mm -hmm. and Tobago has certain agreements that they sign. So you cannot have people seeking political asylum such as the child and just deport them. That's not how it works. Mm -hmm. And Dan Saboy was correct. In certain states, where I live, Maryland is a sanctuary state. So you find you have a lot of people coming here illegally. They're getting benefits. They could, they could get food stamps. Their children go to school. They get license to drive. Hmm. Certain states have different laws. Mm -hmm. As Dancer Boy rightly said, their, their state pass all kind of laws that you can't even help. An immigrant, you could be arrested, you could be yeah. prosecuted. That is not here in Baltimore. Mm -hmm. Just as with the abortion thing, a lot of people from different states come into Maryland and seeking abortion because it's still legal here. Yeah. So, like I said, if they had reached the Privy Council, Trinidad and Tobago, we may have had to pay more to that child. If the judge just interpret the law according to what the government signed. <laughs> All right. Well, it's the appeal court and then the privy council. If it's, if it, if it, if it, I don't know if this if is the case goes, with the yeah, privy council. Like I said, mm -hmm. we might have more money to pay. <laughs> well, boy, have, well, a, good, uh, have we, a good one. Thank you. We go wait and see. We go pay ten bolivars. Thank you. All right. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Good afternoon. David. Uh huh. Good afternoon. Pro bono yeah. is a Latin word. You know, long time when you're going to do law, not like no, you have to do Latin 
and certain kind of thing before you do law. A lot of things in law is described describe in Latin. Mm-hmm. Pro bono means free. So when a lawyer tell you do not job for you, pro uh-huh. bono, that means he's not, he not charging you a cent. Uh-huh. Yeah, pro bono means free, free of all incumbents. Free, free, free uh-huh. of charge. Uh-huh. But, 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 the, but where they call him call a while ago, he's correct. The, the benchmark is when them lawyers do work for you, you have money. Like them kind of job as you for the venue, mm-hmm. they will tell you, they'll make a contract and you have to sign it, Mark, saying you have to pay 10% of whatever you, your um, judgment you get. 10% that be the best. Now, they don't go lower than that. Mm-hmm. Right? So that is a 10%. They have to sign a contract to mm-hmm. so say 10%. Not only lawyers, the, the unions that do that too. When I feel I was like a member of the union and they come off the street and you have a good case and they go by the union and they beg and say they take advantage of me on you work and the union sees a good case, mm-hmm. they just make him sign that same thing that whatever they we go work, do the case for you and um, sign up this document. You pay, keep you, pay your union dues and so on and whatever we get for you, you will have to pay 10% of it, right? Okay. If you say pro bono, mm-hmm. when you get your check, you dust your bounty and you're gone. Oh, okay. And if... And the fellow who just called there and talk about the governmental laws where they sign all over the world. The law co- the laws that is covering um, um, refugees and things mm-hmm. from the United Nations, that will cover that any trailer that the big government have not signed up on, on that law. A lot of third world countries do that because if they do that, it's not a good law for people mm-hmm. in Europe and America who have real land and thing and work for people. Right. But in Trinidad, if the government if the government sign up to that law, that is the government argument. Eh? Mm-hmm. All in Venezuela come here and we can't do nothing about the ref- Trinidad to be the government yeah. have not sanctioned the Refugees Act. And it have a few that they have sanctioned. Plenty. Okay. I could call the number if the man wants. He told him because he hears somebody tell you that and he thinks he's saying. <laughs> and that is we saying they that he not he hear about that. That's why even people in town with the woman, you see now the woman from Venezuela don't be quarreling about mm-hmm. and saying government should um, adopt the law. The government, that is, is very few to the whole country. I don't think it ever country, the Caribbean, sign up that, that law, on that law. Oh, right. All right? Yes, sir. So I show you, those black regular way, you see them talking about and they say no God. You know why? Because a lot of these organizations, we, they call anti. You know what they do? They just get subvention and they see when they check who is the president and who is the that Some of them organizations, mm-hmm. the international organizations, they'll give them subvention. There's a little money, good money to play with and free. So they must come every time something happens to them. Um, Veni or them fellas to come in here illegally and play mm-hmm. the talk on the gas. So they have to look, let the international organization hear them saying something and feel they're doing something. Them know, they know, they know they're only going to pay them like Trump. Hmm. All right. All right, my good. thanks. I I still had to get some clarification on this pro bono, you know. Good afternoon. I uh, quickly, Admiral David, I have a question for Pex. He may not be able to get that call today, but he could answer it tomorrow. And I have a statement to make. Now, if, as he says, Trinidad is not a signatory to these international laws, why can't we send back the Venezuelans? What's preventing us from doing that? Mm-hmm. We could just say go back. You don't have to answer to anybody. I want to answer for that. Because I think if that's the case, just send them back. Nobody could tell us what to do. Anyhow, the word we're looking for is a contingency. That's what it's called. It's a contingency clause, which means when I win, you will pay me. And if there are no such thing as, look, well, it's 10%, 12%. I am the lawyer. I determine what my contingency fee is. Google and see it's a contingency fee. If I go down the road and I get an accident, mm. that's why they have these, uh, these, um, these, uh, that's why they have these, what they call the ambulance chasers. Mm. Wherever there's an accident, they show up. They don't ask for money. But they'll tell you, if we win the case, that's where we're going to get our own. Mm. And they'll take whatever they want. It's up to you to decide and not give any that. If the lawyer wants to take your case and he says he wants the 80%, would you tell him no? Mm. The 80% of what that child get in, would you say no? So it's a no such thing as what a percentage is. And I want to pardon the call back and say, why don't we send the Venezuelans back? Because we're not beholden to any law, international law. Have a blessed one, my friend. Thank you. All right, let me start squeezing this call here quickly. Good afternoon. Yes, David. Uh huh. So, you see, I don't have to go back and do no research again because uh-huh. I don't. I, I tell myself I know pro bono is free. I, I still have to verify it. I still want to verify Yeah, yeah. I know, but I like, if I'm saying, and when I'm mentally doing the pro bono, means no cost attached, okay. free of charge. All right. Yeah, so, so I, you, you, you make me pull back myself there, you know, but so, say what? Right. Nothing wrong with that, man. Okay. And as Peck rightly said, 
law, a lot of the things in law mm-hmm. is from Latin. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of the things in law is from Latin. Because you know in law, there's a difference between, when you're writing up things, there's a difference between shall and must. Well, we hear all these things, but you know what? I'll tell you something. You shall leave now. It's time for you to go. No, I must leave now. <laughs> <laughs> all right, David. Right. So we continue the conversation. Maybe tomorrow, please go on. All right. So, people, that's it for me. It's just about four minutes before three o'clock. So, time for me to pack up and make my way out of here. Until tomorrow, please, God, you stay safe. All right? Blessings flow.
As the last echoes of Carnival Fee, the spirit of Trinidad and Tobago continues to resonate through the alias of WAC Radio, 90.1 FM and WAC TV. While the rest of the world goes on, we stay rooted in the rich soil of our culture, celebrating the Trinbagonian spirit that dances in our hearts all year round. WAC Radio 90.1 FM is your constant companion, bringing you the essence of Trinidad and Tobago.
come out to live me life. Live me life. Play your mass and live me life. I'm the happiest man alive. I come out to live me life. Live me life. Drink a rum and live me life. I'm the happiest man alive. Somebody say, oh, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Live me life. Live me life. Come out to live me life, live me life, play your mass and live me life. I'm the happiest man alive, I come out to live me life, live me life, drink a rum and live me life. I'm the happiest man alive, somebody say, oh, oh. Please, man. 
she beating like Hold on I'm a shop you place and you know you're whining good She call up Hold on Just give me some time now Hold on She want me to stop down the wine now Hold on But there's something feeling good That you come with, tell them all that you don't say. Y'all don't see you with no behavior. You do business, you see. And pretend you're in front of the mirror. Practice that thing there for me. Y'all, your body looking good. And you put me in a mood. When you whine, you whine so good, yeah. Then she ball up, hold on. She grab on the thing like, hold on. And then I do she the thing like, hold on. I'm shop the place and you know you're whining good. She ball up, hold on. Yes, I'm so real. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm phenomenal. I'm phenomenal. We're phenomenal. I'm phenomenal. I'm phenomenal. We're phenomenal. We're phenomenal. Yeah, yeah. So can just give me my powers. Yeah, yeah. Make me jump and fed three hours. So can just give me my powers. Drink me rum and share with others. Fed for your words. Soak up powers. It's a wonderful feeling. To share with others. All my brothers and all my sisters. Today we make it we name. We party in sun or rain. We don't care what the people say. Once the music hit me again. So much powers I can't explain. Until I go and day. Something about this music. 
Madang ding 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 ding. All I seen is your, is your the top of your, your, your mustache. Somebody in You gotta come come down. Down. Yeah. Uh, uh, but the kind I want to hide you with. That is alright, you know. Um, is that better than the <laughs> black? Just a spot. No, that better than the up in your face now. Right? <laughs> but it didn't have that cloud there just now, you know. What cloud is that? Now, nah, well, that, that cloud there. Come, 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 come in. Underneath here. the um. Yeah, but I, I, I make a bad move there. And you press on something, come and. No, 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 I press nothing. You gotta go back up. Yeah. Because there, yeah, no, yeah, because. No, 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 <laughs> you have to go back up. I move it the first time. We had to go back down yeah, yeah. or up, 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 up. Yeah, up a little bit. Nice. That good. That good. Nice. I mean, people really want to see. That's them, okay, man. I know. I, I'm not looking to be seen because all this that big TV and man in bar text. Now nah, I find that all right. Yes, so did the man call and say he's sending a big letter for real? Yeah, the had to send all I'm like, he daughter go no more. <laughs> as, soon as, as soon as your daughter go home, you have a letter to send, pre-protocol letter, letters. Hey, good afternoon, TNT. Good afternoon to the world as a true nation station. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what is up? It's Monday, the final week, it's Holy Week. Yeah, and everything else that goes in it, yes, yes, um, it Palm up, Sunday. Up, palm Sunday. Yeah, I got my palm yet? I know you get palm. Yeah, Show me your palm, I want to read your palm, palm. Nah, I got, I got. Look, I see somebody like to leave a little piece of something here on the table here for you too. Like Kenny, 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 bring that there. Like they there. run out of palm in that. Why? Hey, watch out. Let me leave you a ticket. They run out of palm in that shit, too. Don't say that now, boy. We ain't Don't see. Normally, the palm would be a big pea. Now, long ago, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, you, but you, 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 you ain't see. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Good afternoon. Good afternoon, gentlemen. What's that? Yes, you are mean? What happened, partner? Let me go, man. Yes. I am good. Mr. Prescott and um, Mr. Desmond. Yes, sir. Um, when when um, when 5 by 5 come on, I want a, um, a gospel song or a song to represent Palm Sunday. I've seen it in advance because mm-hmm. yesterday, that yesterday was supposed to represent a show where we uh, would have been hearing some nice little... Um, gospel song mm. but it was a whole time of somebody who didn't who supposed to go back to school he alone, that's all i will say he right alone now by himself or something yeah yeah, yeah because yeah, we yeah. now yeah. checking in anyway the vatican the vatican have a channel you know <laughs> right and why you going to tell you about that and why you listen to the vatican channel uh, let them get access to downstairs where the artifacts is too now right oh, look good. yeah you the vatican have a channel oh you go what kind of crazy thing is that the man want a van The Vatican have a channel. Really? <laughs> <laughs> you ain't see the smoke, what they say? When the smoke come out from on top of the... the, the I, do, the I first, don't know. The first I don't know. thing. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Buy a dozen egg and relax. Hey, I, I went into a place Saturday. Eggs a lot, though. No, not eggs. Hot cross buns is nearly fifty dollars. Yeah, but they might have keep that, you know. Serious, boy. They For six keep... buns, boy. And man buying that, but look, you it said it represents. It represents. Um... Papi business. It represents business because I don't know when, when we was going up there with our heavy cross on we back. Uh, if we was starting to eat any bun, right? We was starting to get refreshed. People was crying for we on the journey. Right. It's not no bun selling, but we will leave it. We will leave it like that, right? All right. <laughs> good with Other than that, I mean, how was your week? I mean, oh God, uh, the Queenie celebrate and I see well Friday night thing, thing, thing. Yeah, on ay, 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 ay. good to make a little jump out too much. Sometimes, eh? yeah, yeah. Good afternoon. Hi guys, let's afternoon checking in, checking in. Sabi. Yeah, Sabi call yeah, Sabi called Friday too, you know. Sabi yeah. and if I don't only lie, yeah. what's that? Is a good thing I don't talk truth and walk, you know. If I don't only lie. <laughs> Savvy call. Hello, Dika. <laughs> Where Tony? I say, boy, look. I say, boy. I'm not holding with guys. Eh? All right, same to you. Same Why? to you. <laughs> Ebo. Hey, if you're the only lie. If you're the only, only telling lies, us. Good afternoon. Welcome. Gentlemen. Hey, what happened? Hey, hey. 
All right, yeah. Just, we just landed. We're taking off going up the road uh, to New York. So we listen to you guys up the road. All right, but the whole airplane is still here. The whole airplane is still there, we Hey, and tell the whole airplane yeah. that the so old we this. Air, we can put um, we can put the, the, the radio on. No, don't go play it on that. You might lose your work, but the oldest. <laughs> The oldest Bible in the world. Yeah. The oldest Bible in the world is the Ethiopian Bible, my brother. Take your bow. You better believe that one there. I have one, you know. I have one. All right, brother. Yes, my brother. You know, I, I am seeing, I, I saw something. I, I know people that put up stuff, right? Yeah. But where Putin was saying that black, he, black, he black. found... He yeah, going black. If he going black, he go, there's a black Jesus. No, but they, the, the European man, right? Mm-hmm. Not, not changing the energy, right? The European man used to tell the truth, you know. Not until the 16th century and 17th century they started to change up all the deities. But everywhere you go, the portrayal of the Trinity was black. Everywhere in Europe. This is not, no, this is not what I say now. Right? This, this, is what, this is what was, right? And then there was, uh, in the Renaissance period, every period, the other period, they started the whitewashing of many of these deities. And if you go in many European countries, they have level African saints. One of them is Saint Maurice. One, and I have many others I could call. Not the day for even kings that came through Europe. Right. Kings that you wouldn't think that those were kings and queens and princes. When you read the stories of how they translated, seeing these people, they would put he was king so and so was dark. He had woolly hair, and. What's well, there's many things now. So there was a deliberate whitewashing. So Putin and them, they always close at our energy, that energy now. So they will always tell that kind of truth. True. Good afternoon. Hello? Caller. Like there's a butt dial, but. Hello? Look at the butt that dial and it has some more breeze. Uh, boy, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you know this? <laughs> You didn't even say, <laughs> your butt died like that, all that breeze. <laughs> come, that come now, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but um. Let's see who's there. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Hey, what's Tony up, buddy? Death, yes, sir. Hey, Too many. Had a lot. Yes, sir. Too many. A lot. A black saints and matters. Yes, sir. Yeah, brother. Best yeah, and I use the word Europe, eh? and it was heavy, 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 and it's, I guess the Western world started to change up that energy. Right? right? Mm-hmm. Let, yeah. Let's take a final call so. before we go to some ads. Hello? Yeah, me again, gentlemen. That's mm-hmm. the story. All you don't realize what's going on. On the ground in Europe, they still do it. Understand? Mm-hmm. All in the, on the ground at the Vatican in, in Rome. They have down church where they go and worship the black Jesus, the true Jesus, a, a replica of them. All right? But people are so brainwashed right now. You tell them that, they, they, they don't believe you. Even when Jesus comes in, in front of them, they're not going to believe that. But, but they, 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 they know that. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, man. Blessings. All right, folks. Um, we come in. And right, guess, one is, guess one is going to yes, buy some go. hot cross buns for us. Hold on, hold on. Good afternoon. Yeah, there's a Tony B. Yes, ah. sir. It is also, I want to say alleged, if I could use that word, that Putin is one of the leaders who saying that he don't want the rainbow in the, in his country. You uh, understand? Yeah, you're done now. So, so, be looking at that too. All right, man, bless. I but guess I, other leaders should follow. Yeah, man. Okay, so we come in right back. Uh, Awa rara. This, huh? Awa rara. We can talk that rara thing when we come back now. Why not a dada? <laughs> Not skinny. See Kenny go hey, yesterday. Trinidad and Tobago. You see, Gloria Saturday, Saturday the 30th of March, San Fernando would never be the same again. Because everybody heading to Athlete's by the Park. Because Carib Street Boys and Wilkie's presents the annual Back in Times party with the best DJs in the land. Featuring Peter, Alphabet, Mr. Desmond, and of course, yours truly, Mr. Q. Starting time is 9 p.m. and we dancing all the way till dawn. 
Admission is $80, two-on-one tickets for $140. And at the door, you pay more. For more information, you can call Atelier's by the Park, Sion's Bar, that's on Royal Road. And of course, you can get your tickets from Wilkie's, 620-3169. That number again is 620-3169. Remember, we dancing down at Atelier's by the Park. It's another Tyrant Street Boys and Wilkie's promotion. San Fernando, we coming? Are you interested in working with the Elections and Boundaries Commission for its national field verification exercise? For more information about this opportunity and conditions to apply, visit portal.ebctt.com. The deadline for submission of applications is Monday, March 25th, 2024. See Press for details. A message from the Elections and Boundaries Commission, your partners in democracy. This Easter Sunday, March 31st, at the Cipriani Labor College, Valsain, I Am Jazz Festival presents Jazz is Blue, featuring saxophone sensation Mike Phillips, Elan Parley, Len Booksy Sharp, Nisa, Irvin Alves, Marcus Hippolyte, and more. Come and see our unique artisans and interact with your favorite artist. Tickets are available at Simon's Musical Supplies, Crosby's, King's Lounge, Barber Spa, Arima, and Movie Town Port of Spain. Sasu in Mid Center Mall, Sion's Bar, I Live for Glam Val Park Shopping Plaza. Gates open at 4 30 p.m. Showtime is 5 p.m. Wear something blue, bring a friend or two. Sponsored by King's Lounge Barber Spa, Clinical Media Group, Mount Irvin Bay Resort, Blue Water, Carrot Brewery, Duft Hair Products, Prodel Sound, Music TT, and Professional, The Lullaby Group, and Blind Effects. Parts proceed go to the Diabetes Association of Trinidad and Tobago. For more information, call 386-4748 or 380-1222. I am Jazz Festival. Jazz is blue. Spiritual Baptist Faith presents on Friday, 22nd March 2024, our first open air service at Isaac Junction, Coover at 7 p.m. Our dress code is national colors. Come and hear some dynamic men and women of God expound the gospel of Jesus Christ. On Monday, the 25th of March, 2024, the following activities will take place. Opening of the second entrepreneurial village at 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Men of Balov service, 7.45 p.m. to 9 p.m. Dress code blue. Tuesday, the 26th of March, 2024, exhibition which commences from Tuesday to Thursday, 28th March, 2024, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Entrepreneurial Village, Tuesday to Saturday, from 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. DOC Presentation, Tuesday to Thursday, 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Youth for Christ, dress code white, starts at 6 p.m. Wednesday, the 27th of March, 2024, Woman of Substance Service. The time is 6 p.m., dress code pink. Thursday, the 28th of March, 2024, Myla Spiritual Baptist Experience. Starts 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The Spiritual Baptist Diaspora Service. Time is 6 p.m. Dress colored. Saturday, the 30th of March, 2024, Spiritual Baptist Liberation Day Service, which commences at 9 a.m. Dress code colored. All events will take place at the Administrative Building, Balmain, Kuva. See you there. Diatonic Pan Institute presents for Separio Fest, Pan Kai Soka 24. Pan Kai Soka 24, Saturday, April 30th. Come, enjoy extempo clash between Abibele and Brian London. London. I want it all the time. King Luther, Lefter Kojo, Johnny King, I want it all the time. and the legendary Super Blue, along with Diatonic Pan Institute with vocals and dance. Pan Kai Soka 24. It's all happening at Diatonic Pan Yard, Mary Street, Separia. Showtime, 8.30 p.m. Admission only $200. It's all powered by the Atlantic LNG and Live Music District. Pan Kai Soka 24. Make it a day. Saturday, April 30th. When you ready, ready, man, the iron and the man, where they can go from. It's a vibe in the session when we jam into the steel pan. Toronto.
So, get ready for Fusion on Saturday, April 6th, St. Peter and Paul Banquet Hall, 231 Milner Avenue, Toronto. Doors open at 6 p.m. Dinner, 7 p.m. Show starts at 9 p.m. Fusion, a collaboration of string music and Caribbean vibes, featuring Andre J. Donovan, Trinidad and Tobago's virtuoso violinist, accompanied by Ozzy Gurley and the Truth Band, and soloist Tad Wilson, vocalist Mandy Woods, with dance performance by Tamla Matthews, and music by DJ Maceo. Tickets are $140. Limited tickets are at $135 until March 15th. You get discounts for tables of eight. Get tickets at www.ticketgateway.com or call Angela 647-262-6594 and Norman 647-998-4708. A production of P.S. Smith & Associates. This concert takes place under the auspices of the consulate and it's supported by Trudan and Tobago Music Company Limited. Music TT. Toronto Fusion is coming. Inside the song, 
So if you hear me on your radio, it's not a politician singing a guy so. Whatever the role they want me play, Calypso's a part of my DNA. So I hope it makes everyone happy. Here's a Calypso Neon representing me. Even Kaisonia start to criticize And immediately start to roll their eyes By talking him like they were not friends And saying it really should have been them Hoping his job will distract him So this year he won't get no chance to sing But this Calypsonian will fill his shoes And always sing the relevant issues Like how the people are afraid to use their lights Cause they find tea and tech not treating them right or when you go down inside the HDC, house is mashing up like Chini BB. Or maybe you want to try to protect your home. Cause the bandits and them won't leave you alone. Calling the police for you might get this. They might say, and you know where the station is. Hmm. But that's too much back and Whether I'm close or whether I'm far, singing Calypso is in my nature. So despite wherever you see me go, it's not a politician singing a guy so. I just follow God Almighty, and I'm not sure what he will choose for me. But I'm satisfied once we all agree, it's a Calypso you're representing me.
WACK 90.1 FM. This is News 901 to 4 p.m. In the headlines. Three men held with narcotics worth millions of dollars in South Trinidad. Michaela Pandey says PNM and the UNC failed on property tax. Originally, New Oil and Gas Institute to roll out specialized audit trading for Ghanaians and internationally, judge agrees to reduce Trump fraud bond to $175 million. With the news in detail to 4 p.m., I'm Cohen Borne. Good afternoon. Customs officials of South Trinidad have held three men with narcotics worth several million dollars. Reports here on 4 this morning, officers received a tip-off that a parole was off the Gulf of Paria. Customs officers intercepted the vessel and found 32 packages with substance resembling cocaine and marijuana. The men and the Perug were escorted at King's Wharf in San Fernando and taken into custody for questioning. The men are from Diego Martin, Marabella and Williamsville and officers believe the men were returning from the coast of Venezuela. Investigations are continuing. Public Utilities Minister Marvin Gonzalez has dismissed claims from Opposition Senator Wade Mark and Princess Town MP Barry Padarath of imminent mass retrenchment of workers at the Water and Sewage Authority. During a visit to a well site in St. Joseph on March 23rd, Minister Gonzalez said the restructuring process at Wasa was well underway. Minister Gonzalez said the Cabinet's Human Resource Advisory Committee was reviewing a compensation package for the new executive leadership at Wasa. He added that once that was approved, an announcement would be made. On Sunday at the news conference at the UNC headquarters in Chiquonas, Mark claimed the removal of those managers was the tip of a mass retrenchment exercise planned for Wasa. He alleged the UNC had information that Wasa planned to retrench 2,000 to 2,500 of its 5,000 employees. In a statement, Padarath supported Mark's position. In dismissing Mark and Padarath's claims, Minister Gonzalez challenged them to answer certain questions. He advised both UNC members that if they could not answer those questions, they should not engage in political hypocrisy. Patriotic Front political leader Michaela Pandey says the PNM and UNC have both failed when it comes to the implementation of property tax. Pandey, the daughter of former Prime Minister and UNC funder Bastyr Pandey, made those comments in a post on her Facebook page. She recalled the PNM was defeated in a snap general election on May 24, 2010, ushering the UNC-led People's Partnership Coalition into office and one of the PP's main campaign slogans was Ask the Tax. However, Pandey said for five years they failed to do so. She noted that being in opposition does not relieve political parties from taking responsibility for actions taken and not taken while in government. Pandey said 14 years later, the fractured UNC, now an unrecognizable shell of its original self, is singing the same election song. Despite holding a constitutional majority of 29 seats in parliament during its tenure, Pandey said the PP did nothing to bring meaningful change to Trinidad and Tobago. She recalled the PNM's local government campaign promise last August about regional corporations using the collection of residential property taxes to provide revenue. Pandey urged local government corporations to ensure there is transparency and accountability for all revenue generated from the collection of property tax. The Senate will debate the Property Tax Amendment Bill 2024 when it sits at the Red House today from 1.30 p.m. The bill was passed in the House of Representatives on March 18 by a vote of 20 to 15. United National Congress Senator Wade Mark says the party stands on strong and resilient democratic principles and anyone who is suggesting otherwise is misguided. At the UNC's media briefing yesterday, Mark said only the membership of the party decides on its leaders and he has faith and confidence in the membership. On Friday at the news conference at the Coover Chamber of Commerce Hall, UNC Member of Parliament for Mayar Rushton Parry said the party's internal elections were pivotal to its continuity within the political landscape. He made the call for the national executive to hold elections by June. However, in response to Parry, UNC members of parliament have thrown their support behind political leader Kamala Prasad Bissessa. Mark said the 100,000 plus members of the party will determine the leaders, as has been done in the 35 year history of the party. Mark called on the party's membership and the people of the nation to remain laser focused on the objectives of the UNC. He said anyone interested in fighting elections for the UNC can submit their nominations by April 11. Tourism Minister Randall Mitchell and Panchin Bago President Beverly Ramsey Moore are both denying there is any conflict of interest in the rental of the Steel Band Body Sport of Spain headquarters. The claim was made at a UNC press conference yesterday by Senator Mark, who alleged that Minister Mitchell is collecting rent from Panchin Bago, one of the interest groups in the National Carnival Commission, which falls under his purview. 
Mark, who showed copies of a deed of covenants to support his claim, said in 2021, Dr. Bruno Mitchell sold his property at 55 Dundonald Street to Deer Street Limited, a company owned by Minister Mitchell and Dr. Gina Marie Kolas. Pan Trinbago relocated to the Dundonald Street property last August. The one-year lease comprises $50,000 monthly rent for a portion of the building and $20,000 for its car park. However, Minister Mitchell said he has never collected rent from Pantry and Bago. He said Deer Street Limited has a tenancy agreement with a company called LMG Property Management and Pantry and Bago is a subtenant of LMG. Minister Mitchell said LMG's decision to sublet to Pantry and Bago was made independently without his influence or direction. Roman Catholic Archbishop Jason Gordon has urged citizens to reflect on the passion and resilience of Jesus Christ and other characters who emerged during Holy Week. As he delivered the homily yesterday at the Palm Sunday service at Our Lady of Perpetual Help on Harris Promenade in San Fernando, Archbishop Gordon said there was much to learn from the characters who emerged in the story that led to the crucifixion and resurrection of Jesus Christ. The Palm Sunday service began with the solemn procession of the congregation outside the church as they waved palm branches reenacting the arrival of Jesus into Jerusalem days before the crucifixion. The Archbishop blessed the palm trees which symbolized peace and victory with holy water. During the homily, Gordon asked the congregation that as they mediate on the events of Holy Week, they focus on one character from the narrative of the events of Holy Week. Regionally, the Institute of Professional Petroleum Accountants of Ghana Incorporated, established only four months ago locally, is gearing to roll out a specialized oil and gas audit training for locals. With the rapid growth of the petroleum industry in Ghana, the country has been struggling to keep up with the accounting requirements outlined in the production sharing agreement signed with ExxonMobil and its co-ventures HES and CNOOC. The contract stipulates that Ghana has two years from the end of each calendar year to conduct orders of the oil company's expenses. The Ghana Revenue Agency that is tasked with overseeing the process has complained of the lack of skilled professionals to complete audits. Last August, the agency said its petroleum unit required 65 persons for the job, but merely had 31 on roll. Internationally, a judge in New York has granted Donald Trump's request to pause his $464 million fraud judgment, giving him 10 days to put up a reduced sum of $175 million. The former president's legal team had previously said he was unable to secure a bond from a private company for the full amount. He had originally faced a deadline of Monday to put up the $464 million bond. If he had failed to do, the authorities in New York could have started to seize his bank accounts and properties. But on Monday, he was granted a last-minute reprieve by an appeals court. If he pays the reduced $175 million bond, it would delay enforcement of the fraud judgment and protect his assets while he continues his appeal. The appeals court also agreed to delay the enforcement of other penalties that were part of the original judgment, such as barring the former president and his elder sons from running businesses in New York. In sport, Trinidad and Tobago senior men's football team head coach Angus Eve, along with key players, all believe that as TNT continues to improve, they will be in a good position when CONCACAF qualifying commences in June for the 2026 FIFA World Cup. TNT lost out on the spot for the 2024 Copa America, following a 2-0 defeat to Canada in a CONCACAF Nations League playing match on Saturday at Toyota Stadium in Frisco, Texas. And the Jamaica Athletics Administrative Association has signed a memorandum of understanding with the German city of Stuttgart to host a training camp ahead of the 2024 Paris Olympic Games. Jamaican athletes selected to compete at the Olympics later this year will travel to Germany to take part in a final training camp to complete the country's preparations for the Games. That's a look at news to 4 p.m. Recapping the headlines, three men held with narcotics worth millions of dollars in South Trinidad. Michaela Pandey says PNM and the UNC failed on property tax. Regionally, New Oil and Gas Institute to roll out specialized audit training for Ghanaians and internationally, judge agrees to reduce Trump fraud bond to $175 million. That's a look at news to 4 p.m. at WAC 90.1 FM. You can get more news online at www.wacradio901fm.com. I'm Cohen Borneo. Good afternoon. WAC Radio 90.1 FM and WAC.TV, your home for unforgettable jazz moments. This Lenten and Easter season, look out for more details on our programming. It's only a tune away.
it's only a tune away. Six five two four nine zero one one seven eight six two nine two two seven eight nine and seven six six four nine two zero. Carry and come in. Do you have anything to carry to, to no, come in? Package conference confiscated from drone sighted over Port of Spain prison. So man flying dead. Man flying drone. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Yeah, yeah. I see they got a big hole in South this morning. Again, uh, yeah, another one. Sando, Pelta boy, yeah. What? Like, coming, it coming in, in the, in no. the in, boy. Hello, good afternoon. Get you, fellas. Mm-hmm. This one is for the opposition leader. Yeah, calling the prime minister to call election. You and your counterpart. How are you calling to the elections and see what will happen? What? Well, and, and they made some some comment on that just recently. Yeah, but she, as far as she says, she might go till general election as the leader without calling the, um, the internal. Internal, okay. Right? Okay. All right, we'll, let's wait and see. What? I want to be, I, I want to be, you know, I mean, I'll, I'll call thing and I want to be. I want to be. What's, 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 what's going on? Call election by you, then. What's going on? Oi. I want God call election on all year on this earth here. Call election. Call I want the highest to call election on all year in this earth, boy. Retired, boy. Retired all year, boy. Father, <laughs> call election on man, boy. I see the, um, the, 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 the S, S, what was it? SSA? SSA man who, I see he went and gave in four high power rifles. When they went to, 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 to the house. Right. They, they found two. Daddy one who was fired? Yeah, the, the, the pastor man. Right. Yeah. He went and carrying four high power, at least from, stating from a, an article hmm. on the newspaper. He went and carrying um, four high power rifles. So uh, if, if he carry four. Why ain't carry? What, what, what did it? Where, where the daddy four that was on the books. But they didn't find that when they went on the raid. They found two handguns or something like that. That's what the article said. 
Okay. So is that one of the rifles that somebody else that came in and gave up because the license had expired to carry such we don't know. such we don't, such weapons? We don't, they didn't give all that all that information. All they say because is if you carrying if you carrying weapons, was he charged so for for for, ha for having oh, these oh, weapons? Hey, you, you know where you live in? Go up and check him out now. You mean I, I, all I, that? I am just reading from. Well, I asking you. How you gonna ask me? I don't know. Well, bring in some high power and 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 and, and let me see what will go happen with you now. Yeah, yeah, I, I bring in some crong and things, some high power amplifiers. No, no I don't want high powered weapons. Nah, I don't know nothing about that. You understand? And let me see. Well, if you go, and you know. I don't know anything about that. Sorry. I know. I don't know anything. So you have what? You have a firearm user's license? Well, I mean. He was the head of the arm. Why? That the man was the head of the SS thing. You see? I say. Wait. What, what role was he playing? Uh SRP, a spy. That is what the man say. He was. <laughs> well, hey. Hello. Good afternoon. Hello. Good afternoon. Oi. Okay. I have a little problem today. Today I went to the hospital. Nice. They asked me for my. Really? First, first, first thing. Load on the radio. Yeah, we get a dread feedback here. Okay, I'll move away from you. Yeah, move away from your radio, nice. Okay, mm -hmm. the ask the of my ID. Mm -hmm. I don't have, I had my driver's permit, I had other things like for ID. Mm -hmm. This mm -hmm. is I need to have your ID. I said, this is a picture ID. I have my price, my card with my my num number and name. So I want your ID. Okay. This I mean, the, 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 the price smart card is a no-no. But the driver's no, 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 permit. But I have my, I have my duty. Yeah, yeah, you understand? No, but you, you can't go anywhere with your price card. Um, card, yeah, sir, yeah. as an ID card. No. Yeah, Sorry. Well, having a, what? Having a GP is not an ID? Yeah, your driver's permit. That is what I said. That is their form of identification, yes. Okay. And okay. they still ask for, for ID. Yes, yeah, it's still active. No, I said, uh, all I could do for you is um, Take it and next time when you come in back, make sure and bring an ID. I tell him, okay, I'll bring my ID and bring my mother and uh, okay, <laughs> All right, boss, man. All right, <laughs> all right. All right, all right man, you too. But what? that's strange. How oh, oh, you see that driver? You are no for fact the price smart can can work. I can. Right? That, that, that but no, the no, 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 no. But the driver's permit, A yes. passport Hello. also and also your yeah, identification. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. Yeah, yeah Mr. Jasmine. Yes, sir. Before... For a bust of my head, I want to make a statement. Go ahead. You know, on Facebook, on Facebook they always have these memories that come up every day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Memories. Yeah. Okay, I noticed yesterday you and I had our first cruise together 10 years ago. Okay, that great, man. Mm -hmm. yeah. And you have to your phone? What I want to bust up my head for ah. is you say that Pastor Brown had four high powered weapons. I de okay. I never say he had. I said he what brought he brought in. I never I don't know right. where you where, where you get from. But I set you up. That's exactly what I wanted here. Because it never said a ledge. When I call and we quote in the papers, you forced me to say a ledge. You never said Boss, I did say I read it in the newspapers. Um. That's what the that's water, what let the water boil now because it, right, it okay. had two more shows coming up. All right, okay, cool. Yeah, you're breaking up. Yeah, you're breaking up. You're breaking up, dancer. Dancer, Hi, dancer boy. Okay. you are breaking up, dancer. <laughs> All right, boss. All right, well, next time I'll say a ledge, I'll, I'll put in a ledge. But I did say that, that, that I, I got the report from a newspaper, so it's not me who say. All right, hey. so. Hey, <laughs> Jenny. I'm not Jenny. Yeah, yeah. Even... <laughs> hey, Mario's ah. pizzeria founder Richard Hartford. No, I'm telling you, died. Apparently, is is Joe was the one who did pizza. Um, there's a, there's two. They had not Mario's and they had another pizza. Um, not Pizza Hut. Is another. Is a Syrian guy, Joe. Um. Mario. Del Piero, tell rem, lock, so, oh, you call Del Piero to find out. Because he, have, he a tongue man, he gonna know, he gonna know because that that that, the, yeah. that that particular person used to be around all the bands, used to be all around the energy. And everybody know 
Joe was the man doing okay. that particular pizza. All right. Le let me also send um, condolences going out to the Downs family um, on the passing of Mr. Kenneth Downs. All right. Um, they know him as Downsy, and uh, he would have been one of the people who would have been calling Wack a lot. Okay. And that kind of thing. Um, he passed, Mr. Kenneth Downs. So condolences going out to the family. Yeah, right. here today, gone tomorrow, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, so I am. Um, I I wondering. I, I, that's the. They didn't find it, but my boy did the right thing and he went and carried it in. Well, let me just hope it's. Four. I not want to talk about <laughs> nine. Uh, like a man do. The, so you're saying he do the, he do the country a favor. No, he did the right thing. Cause if 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 you know it would have it would be legal to have it, it's the best thing to do security. So he that was part of his working undercover. I don't know. Well, but yet, but then hush, because at the end of the day, if we can't solve the case in Trinidad. What we what we, what we going down the road for? <laughs> so then, well, then why you ain't go by the newspaper? No, but I want the facts. Don't print this. But you are the getting as a man who work in radio. Okay. It is a, it is incumbent. Kenny didn't tell you this. No. <laughs> um, Bonio. It is incumbent <laughs> upon you and Radio Man to go and get the hidden truth. I agree with you, partner. Bonio. Bon, who you boning? <laughs> this holy week. Do you say Bonio? Cohen, Bonio. You never said Cohen. You said Bonio. So, so that, that, that is his, his title? But if I hear Bonio, I feel as a man name you call it. Well, so who name it is? I know not to. Me so Cohen, long, you know. Cohen Bonio is a what? You now say Cohen. But before that, you did not say Cohen. You say, well, Bonio. In Trinidad, giggle. Bonio. That's what you say. This wow. English, watch me. This English, you lead all you. Not to believe when the I am reaching. All this right. English tying all you up and up. Partner, let me go back to America or, or first people language or something, you know, because this English, like it ain't working, boy. Hello, good afternoon. Hey, Desi. Hi. Like, Tony so went technical school before you went ordinary elementary now. Ah, so yeah. You always in a kind of defense. No, but I would not. Tie up in a kind of not, way, a market card. Not here, not here. But where get our word market card from, Tony? Or? Not, the same man, or? man. <laughs> Well, you're good, yes. <laughs> not, Take one in the head. Not there, so. <laughs> tie me up now. Mm. <laughs> not. Tone, and before uh, we went to school, right? Yeah. Before we went to school, school, we went to the school of the the highest energy now. The, the universe is our school now. Good afternoon. Before the book writer, a man had to put it in a book now, boy. See, yes. Hello? <laughs> yeah, good afternoon, Mr. Jasmine. Yes, sir. Um, so, hit Mr. Jasmine, my boy. Let me make my statement again. Mr. Jasmine, mm. I want to hit you more because Bonio is not his title. That is name. He's Mr. Mr. Okay, now, Mr. Desmond, that thing you talk about, about the gun, deliver the most salient part. The most salient part is nobody know where those guns come from. They are unaccounted for. That to me was the most salient part of that, of, of that article. Okay, sir? Ah! All right, have a nice day too. Well, I, 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 well, it looked like he walking there too. By Bonio? No, by the SSA. <laughs> <laughs> by the SSA. Dancer, because... dancer. You hear the, a guy just call and said that you're not high enough in the language thing to know that Bonio. Do come with the Bonio thing now, boy. Right? Answer like the title. Right? Is a, a piece of a title or a, is that a deed? Is that the, it looks so. Do they say that the man will call back and say you're yeah, they, they, talking title and say be title in English mean, and a deed in, a, in a Spanish? So, you know? you I never say nothing. Is you say so. I ain't say a thing. I never went to school and thing, you know. No, 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 but I mean, let me tell you this, right? I know every week mm. you just come here with the truth. 
Yeah, that's one thing about you. No, no, I, I, nope. I, I always... Are you 15 years telling I, truth here or anything? I, I, you and I, I, Kenny, you always Kenny come out this weekend? Every year, man. We work yesterday. And yeah. that's why you're so light. Because, like, all you didn't do nothing since Carnivalent. No, you right. Since, yeah, long time. Yeah. Since ah! Like, ah. Month. Yeah, yeah. Your, your, your necks are the hot, you whole girl. Kind of you yeah, <laughs> do not know how wide. <laughs> And 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 and, and we, the man, look what the man bring we, we, in solidarity with you. That's the man. <laughs> That's what if I was your leader, I walked yesterday. Then. Because if after eight weeks carnival done, and this one man go go bring for the team now, boy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to show my care for you, Dezo. That me, nah, boy. Nah, I, I, I was given my palm by Mrs. Philip. Oh, you was given your palm? And and, and and I get I get a big one and a small one. And we're pretty nika. Me <laughs> tell show which part it is. <laughs> but anyway. But well, we are we are we had a very interesting conversation yesterday. Mm -hmm. Very, very interesting. And it was about poverty. Right? Poverty is yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Bada, and, bada, and, bada, bada. and they keep showing me all how that people who living in poverty have no it have some of them who have no choice okay. but to live in poverty. I I I, I can't see okay. that. Who, who said that Mr. Phillips? Well your fans. Not my fans, but the fans it, of work. It it has some people who right. reach to that point. And and what are you saying? I'm really yeah. trying to get what are you saying real? I am saying if I born into poverty right. as a as a youth coming Abject up, poverty. Judgment right. poverty. Right and and yet and you get the opportunity to go to school. You might be in our old sneakers and whatever. And you never buy any books for you. But you get that right. But you get that opportunity now. Right. right. What you're supposed to be on your mind as a youth growing up is to come out of that. You know? Okay. And give me the ratio because I, I don't know. I don't know. Like, yeah, what I, I don't want know to that say. I mean, if you're making up, that I, I listen to you. Me and mm -hmm. Madden. Because if a man say, well, okay, this is that. Because everybody would have seen different things in mm -hmm. different times. And one thing I don't do with human being mm -hmm. is talk down to nobody and, nobody, say, yeah, well, and right. say, well, here happening. You, I don't blame and shame nobody. You in poverty because you want to be. Or you rich because you want to be. I don't do that. Right. This, hum this human humanity. Humanity we're talking right? about. Right. I go all over the world. I see people do things to get rich. And I know I would not have that belly to do what them do. It. Right, right. So it wasn't about no books. It wasn't about no nothing about that. I see people who remain in poverty and I realize the reason for their remaining that way and I'm saying I wouldn't do that because they make a choice too, right? Right? Yes, we see it all. That's what I'm saying. No, that's what I'm saying, right? So I ain't going to add and subtract, no, but we, I say mm. you see it all and I see poverty on a level when you're going in a country, I ain't want to call the name and they had to, they had to, what they will call, um, what's the word I want to use? They have to prompt you before you go there to get your emotions in check don't feel sorry for nobody that is a part of life i don't know how that come about <laughs> but you had to be prepped i just gave you a story into an energy and we talk and you talk about your feel you no know, poverty but when you go on and you see you in a place of millions and millions poor right i don't do trinidad i don't want to do it zoom you're going in that world and you're saying poverty right you know who is a poor person in your country you feeling rich because of what you see because of what you see so uh, good afternoon you understand? yeah hello hello caller that, that the butt dialing no? yeah yeah breeze that man that man on you boy that breeze that the butt dial. yeah so i am um, you know, so i i yeah. I, I, I i think it now again, as you say, yeah, right. It have if it and it might have people in those places who would like to get out and probably live a better life because of where they are. Right. But they can't. And some of them, not only they can't, I think some of them have given their life to for the cause. For instance, if a man jump on them plastic floating where we just throw away and thing and try to make it to America. That man jump on board. 10, 20, time. A boat holding 50 people. That 200 on it. 300 on that boat. Because <laughs> trying to make a day worse than even home day under the poverty and the judgment. A man tell himself, well, boy, yeah, my life ain't even worth nothing there. So if I go out and see and 
I rather take a chance by us with 200 people on a boat for 50. You know what I mean? So we, we see the the, 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 the effect, the effect that it will have on how people through the great migrations we see all across the world. And you know, after af, after the program, right? Yeah. I got a call from, uh, I, I think she, she was a, a high inspector, but she was into the ch ch child... The you, 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 UNICEF and them thing? No, in, oh. in the police service. Okay, here. okay, child. Yeah, you know, Protection the, the unit? Yeah, so, 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 she was one of the mm -hmm. heads of the, uh, there now. And, and, and she was telling me exactly, well, how, how she felt about this same poverty thing. And what she said, a lot of people could come out. Right. You know, if they really want to come out, they can come out. You know, but again... And, and that's what it is, right? That's where the human nature is, right? Mm. Sometimes it's whose story you hear first. Ah! If you hear a certain story, my game empowered and you go run with it. But to every story, there's a, another story too. Uh, on top of that. But how we reach there that, can it say what? We get, if, if I do this, this could change this whole program. You know? A particular song that he play right. from an po artist. Poverty tell? No, no, oh. no. It's, this artist was a big, 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 big gospel singer. And from and, and he, he, he changed. Showing God now? Nah. Oh. And, and, and he changed and, and we tried to play his song. Oh. The new song that he changed into. Oi, 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 oi. And, and watch what we press play. It's obscen obscenity. Eh? We had to stop. So he do that for the... So he say in the, on the, that, that, that the, part of it... He, he was neat. He was neat. Right. So he, wanted, he had to change. No, that happens. Because, you know, the man who making it, you see, sometimes it's relative, right? Because I hear some men who say, you know, like within the music business, everybody, you will have your experience, the next person will have experience. And there's things that people, it has some people in life, they believe, they don't believe in certain things. They will never believe it. Right? So you, you leave that individual too, and that's a good thing about being human. Uh, you you got to force your energy on me. I can't force mine on you. And what none of we know is when we reach that final judgment, who going and be saved if you go and be saved or if I go and be saved. So I think that's be a, a ace in all our pocket. You know what I mean? Who going down? Who, who going, going down or who ain't going to go down? That's the ace in all our pocket. No, we, right? So if you I, might... If I go up and I tell right. the man, boss, I was a good... I was a good fella. You know? oh, Boy, is a, is a video coming up with you? <laughs> right? The, do, a do video you know? coming up with you from since you're born. Uh, you remember this tutu here when you crap <laughs> down the dance here? No, no, it really like that, right? It's a natural mistake. It's going to be shown. You're going to be either judged uprightly, crouched, bent over, hatchback, falling down, standing up, lying down. You, it, but, you know, we prefer to be judged uprightly with your head up, taking with full judgment and accepting it now. You know what I mean? But you, you feel that's how it's going to be? Pa, you hear what I say? There is a judgment. I ain't gay, I ain't can't write it down and tell you if it's 10 steps to the left or the right, but... Just like I, be, I believe in karma and karmic energy, what goes up, down, what goes around, how to come around, certain things. Before I was there, that was the energy. Long after I go on, the same things, same difference, right? That we all will be judged based on whatever. Sometimes it mightn't be what you feel is God or who you feel or I ain't feel or by your own God, who you feel love you and you worship and your grandparents and your father and them worship for 42,000 years, no problem. But something happening. We all know that something will happen. Right? Okay, Regardless of what it is, we, science might call it this word, spiritualists go call it judgment. Uh, 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 um, the, those who believe in the, the, the energy go call it frequency judging or so, whatever. But, but it's coming. But something go happen. It's coming. You know? So, so why you can't, why, why you don't think that right now, while living, you are being judged? Well, all that, that is why I always say, mm -hmm. you see, my. Stick up in, yes, right, Stick up in, stick up in. Hello. I know who did that, that sir. Oh, yeah. Mission accomplished. All right, boss. Bless. But, yeah. I, have, but I have to make, I have to make a long statement, though. Ah. Now. Yeah, we saw a long statement. Now, you, yeah. Now, listen. Now, Trump, Trump's fee was reduced to one seventy-five. Okay. And they give him ten days to pay. As much as I argue and talk about politics, I love politics. But politicians look out for one another. It doesn't matter what side of the aisle they're on. Politicians are not poor people. And when they get into power, they make rules that benefit the rich. That's why the 
the deceased Prime Minister could say that the Indians did well on the PNM. All right, it doesn't boss. matter who gets into power, All right, who's going to benefit the rich. All right, good. Okay, brother. <laughs> Jenny. I, I, I no, well, we... Uh, well... No, I, I, I was, you know, because we... I mean, really, what for that? Say that's time. No, you really, Red Bull is not here. I would just say that. I would, just, I would leave it at that. Go ahead. Red Bull is listen to you. <laughs> you know? Yes, what you were saying. But I forget why I'm saying this. <laughs> Trust me, I tell you. If I'm going back to the poverty, I'm saying too, like, sometimes, you know, with, with poverty, right? Especially yeah. in Trinidad, right? Mm. You know? I went places and see poverty and see judgment poverty now, boy. Okay. It's a man of any poverty here and own their own land, you know? So they are different kind of poverty. Okay, eh? so I'm, go, I'm going to ask you a question. Your, fa your family and them, so your family and them leave land for you. Mm. You have nothing. You, know? you have a whole board check on that land, you know, but the land is yours. Eh? So well, that's that a different level of poverty to them. <laughs> well, let me ask, let's take this call and I'll have a question for you. Good afternoon. Yes, pleasant afternoon, Mr. Desmond, Mr. Tony. Hey, hey. Yeah, man. Well, it has system and all that put the end of poverty to you. Mm. Right. Poverty is hell, yes. Bada 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 da, da. I not even go into that, you know, because if you go up in the language, right? Mm. And dancer go, 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 go give a 15 example right now, right? Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. So you Google it and you hear poverty is a somewhat at least a state of mind. Poverty doesn't really exist. Poverty is what in one brother and the whole zumba zumba. Mm. But I know the Rockefellers never experienced that poverty. As a matter of fact, they experience generational wealth. You know what I mean? That's that why I like to talk about and find that we should be talking about how should we, how can we get our generational wealth back and how, since Putin putting out all these pictures, are we the ones who have been beaten and trodden, down, trodden and left? Because poverty is something, as far as I've been reading from the beginning of time, there's always had some energy where, where that is concerned. I want to say the word poverty or poor because some people might have been living in a place and they didn't want what we want today and they would have been happy, right? Happy just praying, happy living off the land. And they would have been saying, I'm a rich person. I hear people say that all the time. I hear especially the Aborigines and people who live in outside in nature. Boy, I'm, I'm, I'm so wealthy. Look, I get up and I see the... I ain't own it. Mm. I live in, 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 in the bush here or I live in how I would like to live. You know what I mean? So, I don't have an answer to say, well, where is poverty and where it come from and who invented it and, 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 and who, who fault it is that you're poor and, and, and everybody could come out. I, I ain't even going to all of that. Right. Because I know every individual living that pass and grace this earth, you know, and live within this space, they would have had their own experience. Yeah. And we don't have microphones and tapes to hear everybody's experience. So sometimes we go, go with, all right, there's a general. You know what I mean? But you go someplace and you're thinking that you will tell yourself, these people are economically challenged. Right? You might say poverty, right? They are economically challenged. But you know you go there and you was real happy. You enjoy that economic challenge situation. You feel good. It's a happiness. You know what I mean? Because you know why? Because they know how to make it work. So they then, so how, then, yeah. and they're not thinking that, they, 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 as you say, economically challenged, we'll use that word. Mm -hmm. Just like unaliving is a new word that they're using right now. They're not saying he was dead, right? He get killed. They yeah, say no, no, he no. was unalived. Unalived. Right. So let me get up to the timing. <laughs> mm. But it comes again from a sense of a happiness within the, within the space and the person. And and how and their liberty. Because you realize there's people that come and create that energy with you. So you might be happy within your space. Mm. Economically challenged, but you're getting through. Here we are saying, you know, I get up every day and I cooking food. 
you know, God bless him, that I'm cheering and I'm going to school and I was able to buy the books and them to have them go to now school. Go, but listen to this one. You right? know? I just get a text here stating that there are some parents who need to be blamed. Yeah, because they hold on. It, the river <laughs> no, it, it's the same di di direction we we be going because some parents had to leave the kids with the elder one to mind the smaller one and he he or she could not be educated because mm. Well, I, well, you go ahead with that thing because I, was, I wasn't really thinking about. I was just thinking about from a whole holistic what we was explaining poverty, not in terms of mommy was there or daddy was there, but in terms of. But it it had our causes. Right, and if they say they think that that is the cause, I don't have a problem with that. Well, okay. Right. Well, good afternoon. Ah, uh, yeah, gentlemen. Ah. Poverty is objective. See what I tell you? See what I tell you? Measurable. When I go and give fifteen examples. When I was growing up, ah. as a child, we were poor. You know, in spite of what we had. Now, you know, I was poor because I couldn't afford certain things. No, people are poor in spite of what they have. A car. When we were riding, in my days, when you ride, that was for the need of transport. Now you do as I exercise. All right. You have a bike. Wow. So it's an objective. You know, if, if, if you can't meet your, 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 your daily needs, you're poor. All right, brother. Blessings. All right, cool. You yeah, see, there's so many answers you could give. Mm. And who right and who wrong? Because that's why, that's why I learned this in school. Eh? You see, if you don't know, you pop your hand and you ask a question. Now, boy. And sometimes when you ask a question in this modern world, people just find all kind of things and feel. Now. So that's why a man always asking. Now. It's not to be no sarcastic. You know? But uh, that's why we could never get to know truths in this world. None. We, we just only get the truth based on where we live. So if we live in a democratic society, we will get that truth. If we live in, in, Ru in Russia, we will get that truth. Yeah, Putin putting out the things. If we live in Africa, we will get that truth. If we live in Sub-Sahara, you will get that truth. It doesn't get a global truth. In. Because at the end of the day, nobody really listens to each other. And if I'm different to you, then your experience and your poverty and your truth and what you should do or what you shouldn't do it becomes irrelevant or relevant based on the time, place, space. And all that is 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 a is a um the topic that we on is a topic that could never reach to a a, a, a pinnacle in in As terms in of in in terms of a hey, we will agree with that it will never reach to that because everybody every single individual have their own opinion but of we, what it is but we just say that i just we just we say this, and look we say the same things right and explain it in two different ways and we say the same thing so that's telling the english the language the energy that is what it is so that's why i always i don't always go from try to go from you know like the city livers you know i try to go from the world perspective so that's why i was saying you know and we draw the example a man might be economically challenged and you might go by that person and they're happy they ain't seeing themselves as poor now boy you know what i mean there are people who don't see that way you know there are people who see poverty based on the whole money energy too now it's how people you go by their house and they will be moving that energy like if they never even said that word to the children. We poor, we catch you. Nothing wrong. You know wrong. what I mean? Yeah, so yeah, that's what so that is what I'm trying to explain now. But. So <laughs> all the points of just what the, 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 the text are text and say, well, parents leave them and blam, blam, blam. Yes, no problem. And sometimes a person within their own self feels poor. You have an energy where you felt rich to become that musician, to become that DJ. Because you push yourself. Same with me as a singer, same with Kenny. So I could go on levels of how what poverty is to a person, how you feel, and what could be done, or I how do. other people have done other things to bring themselves up. out of. Yeah. Good afternoon. Hi, yeah, good afternoon again, gentlemen. Here in America, <laughs> they have certain criteria mm. for being poor. They might see a family of two that making X among the dollars. That's considered poor. If you have a family of four making okay. X among the dollars. Okay. They consider that poor, so they will say you're living below the poverty line. Poverty line, line right? Yes, okay. Here. Yeah, man. I bless. Don't want to say that. Okay. Well, we, 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 we which just, is a fact. Yeah, yeah. I mean, just it, it, like man will come and say, okay, I'm out with money. Hey, I have this, and nobody, you, everybody rocking here, we good. Everybody who do have like us, all your poor. Right. That is he saying that? That he saying yeah. You good know? afternoon. Hi. Good afternoon. 
Tony and Dazzle. Hey, what's mm. up? Sweetheart? Tony hit the nail on the head. Let me tell you something. Mm. I think I told only that already. I grew up exactly where the John John Towers is, right? right. We always have something, had something to eat, mm. and we always had something to wear. Mm. And you know, Tony and Dazzle, we never know the word poor. Mm. Like, you know, you're poor. We, we was happy. And, you know, Sense. our parents, you know, teach us to live good. And we were happy. And it's only in my older stages hmm. I know about. You know about God. Right. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. A lot so, of people, yeah. That, yes. That yes. Of the head, the head, exactly what I wanted to say. Wow. All right, sweetheart. Okay. Thank you. And yeah. the next year again, we never knew that, you know, the government was this and the government. No, we didn't know that at all, you know, at mm-hmm. all, at all. <laughs> Well, oh, you remember social media is what making everybody know now, you know. Oh, the only how you used oh, to know that is when they put on the TV. Well, when, when daddy did buy the TV, you might have known, well, hey, who is who? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so. and the next thing, race. We didn't know nothing about race. Hmm. Because oh, I, as a child, I remember there was this lady selling milk. I don't know how far she used to walk from, you know. Her name was Mary. Hmm. And she used to have the silver pail. She was an Indian lady, right? Mm. One of those um, people who paint that have a portrait of her in some calendar. And we used to, my mother used to send me with a cup. And she had a little silver cup. Mm. And 15 cents for a for cup of milk. milk. Oh, and, papa. Yeah, and we never know nothing, nothing about race. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow. That, mm. that is how it it's goes, that. Mm. All right, cool. Yeah. Well, I mean, it, when, 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 when the younger ones now get to realize how, what, what, <laughs> what they, they, they all, even like me, right? you know, my, my elder brothers and them used to have to do, I, I didn't have that. Right, I every generation have can have bricks I didn't and have get a betterment. Yeah, 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 of course, so because your grandchildren right now, how them spoil, and, and you only might say we strict with them, but how them spoil now, and imagine their generation will grow up. Mm. They go, you know what I mean? But that's how, that's what we always want to, you know. Not because I had to run across and jump across the river. I think by the time your children come, we should have built a bridge too, you know. Wow. If possible. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah. And, <laughs> or if we're not possible, we have a, we have a rope something. We, we, imp- we keep improving as the generations come forth now. Boy. But you, you know what I am, I am I'm saying? Is that it's, it's, it's a topic that... You have to be on the ground with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cannot have this yeah. big, big set of big words and 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 and, and you have to you, you have to deal with that on a ground level in order for the, the same people who are on the ground right. to understand and to also and have it, their yeah, s- their voices, voices heard, heard. Heard. right all that too right yeah. right because I will tell you something right a lot of people don't know the history of Trinidad and Tobago a lot of people don't care now. But plenty are we had to get into it now, boy. And if we get into the history, we will see, feel, and understand a lot of things. Now, you, you just said, I said that a lot of people say, there are many things that affect all people the same way. You understand? So one person will always go and get you, and he will have a good say about the thing. And he, his, his seed might get you, and they will have good says about the things. Then might have a next person, they go in and they're not getting through. And they do everything that you said to do. Because I believe that every man, woman, boy, girl, animal, person, place, and thing, we come here with our we own energy that is unique to you. Right? I don't care what nobody say. Yes, you can learn to be nice. You can learn a skill in, us, in, in, in being hospitable and thing. But you see your energy? Nobody can take that. That is when you. That's why a person will come walk. Ten people walking down the road and somebody just watch you out of that or watch somebody and say, you see your son? And give you our energy or put you in our vibes. Tell you something that you needed to hear or even help you. And you might ask that same person, why you help me? And you didn't help me. He was better looking than me. Or she was thinking. And they say, well, wait. That's why I connect to you. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I try to be careful in saying, you know, like you always are. It has some people. They get success, but they talk down to you now. They don't really break it down in a certain way. And sometimes we don't understand that everybody may not have the same level of understanding, understanding, right? And everybody not, may not be taught the same way. So, for instance, when you go by certain communities, they know what banking good. Now, if you grow up in a certain community, now you might know what no banking thing. 
<laughs> right? But you end up having a Syrian partner, a certain partner, and he's gonna teach you about the banking. Where you gonna do? Cause your mother and father in the African race, well, all you in this and all you in that, look, them know this. You know what I mean? Different people will have different skills and bring different things to the table. And we are all see ourselves as blessing out here in this world. I don't think when the Almighty make us, and this is what I feel here, right? I know it ain't gonna be so. You go, I go get big stone faith, no problem. But I will always go on the power of a higher power all the time over a man. All day, every day, and twice on Sundays. And I'm sure when the great maker make and the great builder build, but he didn't build no power and no rich and no, and you are to be a scruff and you are to have, <laughs> you know what I mean? The, give it the earth to now, boy, and give everybody a free chance. All they run is a race. Reach as far as you can reach, do as much as you can do. Good afternoon. Good afternoon again. Anthony Prescott. Yes, sir. I sent you a video with Dr. Arikana Chihombori Kwa, that powerful African woman. Now, she has a book called Africa 101, The Wake Up Call. I didn't realize I had it, and I bought it again. So hmm. I'm going to make you a present of this book, okay? No problem. I appreciate it. I have a friend coming home next month. Thank you. For Friday, yes, sir. He and, um, he and alcoholic are very good friends, so I'll send it for you. Yeah, yeah. Grace. So, 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 okay. so, so, how come he gained the book? I want to meet. <laughs> send the video for him. <laughs> All right, that's a boy. Great, great, great. All right, boy. I get a cruise. You see, you get a cruise, I get a book. All right, boy. But dancer next time, give me the cruise, yes? <laughs> I go take the cruise, yes? <laughs> I had the cruise pain. <laughs> yeah, boy. You know, so, mm. hey, and that's the beauty about life, you know. That's why I I really appreciate every day. Mm. I appreciate working with people, seeing people, hearing people's views, getting different liberty and opinions. Because, you know, you realize there are some people that live in a way and what they know, they know, you know, horse. And yeah. they ain't jumping out at that. They ain't moving from that mm. at all. And, and it's so much to learn because right now in the world is a time of enlightenment. If you, if you want to check something, it's the time of truth and enlightenment. And, and it's coming out, it's seeping out, but they can't do nothing about it now, boy. That, so that's what makes it to know that man ain't in control now, boy. The earth of a set time, like it has just reboot itself, whether all you like it or not. So all this way Putin doing, if he leave some, something and whisper to you and tell you how to do that. And other things still have to come out and come forward and come forward and come forward. Mm -hmm. You know, you're seeing plenty of people who was doing things, evil things to people, especially in the American music industry and in that whole movie world. Boom! Marks at a bus. People started to come out since Epstein and big, big ones who have never been touched in this world. Started to get touched. Fella, like, even though we laugh and Trump going up again, you never thought you'll see a day with Trump, will I even get a verdict against him? Oh. Right? It's a serious change in this world, you know? Right? Mm -hmm. And the meek had to inherit the earth, whoever. Right. Whoever that meek is, you know. So I have that belief and that confidence and that energy and that spirit. Because some people may get physical wealth of the world. But is that to say that if you get $10 million in your lifetime, right? right. But God give you, the next man, a hundred years of good, full life without sickness. Who was richer, boy? The man with the money. But the money, money, he make the hundred. Because he had the money and he couldn't buy heart, he couldn't buy kidney, he couldn't buy lungs. But he was rich. So you're saying that if God give you a hundred years of full, good life, health, great grand, you, boy, you, you, you're going in your sleep and all. First, you, first it was nice. You're going I, I, with I, a I, smile on your face. I, I, I was there but longer. But I lift a hundred. I was there longer, but I was broken. So what you are saying, and I like that question, I like how you jump to you know. You learn from you and you learn and you teach me this still, you see me. We, we create our energy right there. So, you saying that a man with the money, the 10 million, he would have lived a, rich, big, a big. better life than the, a, 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 the 10 million and he makes 60. Right. And I make 100 and you say I'm broken. You're broken. That's it. <laughs> you died. Who had the money? The man who died at 60. But give me my 100, yes? Hello, give good afternoon. Welcome to your life. Good afternoon, Mr. Tony. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Tony. Yes, sir. I feel like I'm going to promote it to, to Sunday morning. Because we have two fellas that come there on Sunday morning and they do 
Oh, oh God, no, no, no. <laughs> the, 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 them fellas is the controllers. But I'm going to ask you something, Kola. Which would you prefer? The 10 million and, 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 and you're rich or God's full blessing, 100 years. And you're broken. No sickness. You see all your children, grandchildren, and, you could, and they could have said happy. You're broken. Most, in, most importantly, oh, you you're broken. You're broken. And pension. Jalab. Which one you prefer? Which one you prefer? Jalab. 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 Tell him that. Right, Tell him with God's love you could never be broken. Uh, I I never. I never. Yeah. All right. The man who right. thank you. Thank you for so, so so all these millions of people right. who don't have don't have Jalab. It's who you represent and who, who you who you choose and who chooses you, right? Because all these millions of people have people who they will say, Well, this is my God or, or so forth. Regardless right? of what? Right, but we that's your choice. That is, but right, the brother right. say Jah love, and I have no problem with, with, well, with what he said. Yeah, he yeah, he has a very uh, with with with, with, a, with, with, with a sense of neither yes or no. No, he said Jah love. Said, ja, what is Jah love? Ja love, just to <laughs> get up in the morning and sniff the air. You see, do you check how much how much just now uh. on a daily basis? And I will and I will take get, get right here. Mm. The average person, where you think he checking? He checking how much breath. He, you have you you breathe for the day, or you check your bank account how much money you have in your account. I never check how much time I breathe for the ah, day. Ah, but it have a number. It have a it number. Have, I can get with my seconds. Good, 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 good afternoon. Good afternoon, Mr. Delman. Good afternoon, Tony. Yes, sir. Mr. Delman, money cannot buy health. Hmm. But money Desmond, Desmond say that he say you'll be happy no. with the ten. <laughs> Boss man, boss man, let, 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 let. now Tony moving the gold. Like point. this man. Listen to what I say, you know. Hold on, hold on. Listen to what the question that Tony asks, you know. The question Tony asks is if you're going to live at a hundred broken or you live, or, or you live to, to 60, a millionaire, you know. That's the question. That's how you hear it? Is love. Oh God! Easter weekend. Easter week. Godwin. I agree with you. Godwin this weekend. Also. But that is not how Tony put Don't it. Go study that. Go I do the Desmond. You doing the Desmond? Are you good week? Desmond, that was that the show going good, and I I gain like you. And I, <laughs> I live until sixty with you, money. With ten million, you're dead. And I die at 16. Thank you, Jesus. And you have then. I am every not day going at a hundred. Every day. Broken. Every day. No. One fifty for for Southern America. Hello, die not now. I have it. I have it. Hello, gentlemen. Good evening. Hey, you have it. God, yes. Hey. You could generate wealth. Ah. You're so broken. Yes. And tell me. Hey. Now hundred years. Tell me that boy. You could generate wealth. At ninety, I'll become a TikTok if, star. If, if, if you're checking on a ten million, a mm. hundred years in a hundred years. Matthew, listen, listen, listen. Here, here, we here, wanna here, live. Here, what is, is is the main thing about this conversation? <laughs> Broken yeah. and money. Look, Carol, and I don't say no. We going to hundred. Don't say that 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 after 60 you're going to gain money i talking about going to 100 broke no that was, you put broken okay, on it okay all right all right that's what tony right. said. No, i never I said want to move the, i didn't want to move the no he moving the goal I, I, i'm a functioning poor we, we, we can't be we, we put in broken in a category functioning poor right, right. because right i take an 100 if I function in four, I take it out. Financially challenged. Who, who wouldn't? No, you're who wouldn't? taking the financial no. channel. But I am, say, I, am, I am saying that but you're I going to a hundred broken. How am I going to be broken? How am I going to be broken? never be broken, boy. Going to a hundred. Because, no, no, hold on. Hear what I mean by that. You never put together, together you never put together nothing. You're, you're, you're depending on, on whatever little that you get. You get pension. I prefer to go at 60. No, but check it out. Eh. Some people have nothing that we pass every day on the street. And they're happy, you know. No, well, I agree with that. I agree with that too. So, but so, that is not, that is not what Tony said. That's not what Tony hey. said. <laughs> That's not what Tony <laughs> said. You see the goalpost mover? All right. All right. You're taking me 100. I, I take it 100. No, no, you're taking 10 million. My 100 no. has to be... Uh, no, no. Uh, Kenny... Kenny, Only a final call. Kenny, give you the money. Final call. We go take life. Good, good, good. All right, nobody here. I go in with. God done here, yeah, you know. 
And say what? God done hear your horse. I done pass my thing. You already. put me on the on the middle of the main road there by by clock and back two already. You know. God <laughs> hear you, you know. <laughs> Good yeah, hmm? hey, tell him. Tell him we taking our one ten. Tony P have a thin line in what you're saying, eh? even though I might agree with you. I read an article some years ago. Make a choice now. Yeah. Either you want the money no, or the or the or the one hundred. Oh, listen God. to my story first and you'll go you will tell me after, right? No, I can't tell you. One, on, of the, one of the, one of the, you have 10 seconds, oh, go ahead. Right. One of the, one of the Rockefellers on them, yes. died at the age of 101. Right. Right, when the doctors check, they say he had a heart of a 27-year-old. He created a foundation that when people die in accidents, right. the organs are harvested and brought to his foundation. Yes, sir. He was chosen from them. Mm -hmm. At 101, he was one of the world's richest men. Yes. And when they check it, they say it's not his heart that failed, it's the body gave up. Right, which will always be the case. Yes, go ahead. Right. So that is what I'm saying. So what are you saying? I mean, you could have the wealth and you could be happy too. Right, but I ask you a question now. It's a direct question. Uh -huh. You always spin and try to <laughs> in Shanali, in Shanali the thing. You want to try to be on your side? No, 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 no. You can't be on my side because the body will fail. But the, the end, I could go to him at a certain level. I will ask you a question. A hundred. I hear what I say. Good health. Eh? You notice I said that. Good health and liberty. Children, grandchildren, liberty around you going with your full senses. I'm afraid you went with a smile on your face. You went light. And the next part was 60 with your 10 million. Haggard, beat out, and suck out like a soul prunes. <laughs> Make your choice. Yes, all, that. Give him a <laughs> all right, thank you. Hey, all right. That's it. That's it. That's it for more. All, all, hey, At 60, you suck out all, like all, a chin. You're moving the goalpost. Final, goal final call. Final <laughs> call. You're moving the ball. Good the goalpost. Hello? Dancer. Well, five, 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 you know what Right, hey, five as five you five say five. that, big up. Time for five at five right. inside the culture drive. Mm. As you say that, we let me big up Sister Bev on an awesome performance mm -hmm. in the um, spiritual shout about this. I, ho I hope I'm the, saying yeah, it correct. Yeah, the, the, um, that, the launch. Yeah, the, the PNMs yeah. Yeah, the launch PNM, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she did a fantastic. I mean, awesome. She job. is she's world class. Sister good, Bev is world class. Good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. I would like to get a shoe. Is it um, a gospel singer? Shoe in God night. Hey, yo, gosh, because the man played the song and you hear, well, Desmond, see, a million records. I hear you don't get played already, you know. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Tony. Good afternoon, Desmond. Miss Samson. Yeah, man. As soon as she hear the man sell a, a million, let me get this man. Eh? Hello, good afternoon. <laughs> yes, Alejandro. Hey. Te hey, Alejandro. Uh, ten million. Hey. Ten million. <laughs> or a hundred, boy. Thank you, though. We live in for long, long, long with joy and happiness. Oh, God, life. boy. Full on, Jenna. Right? Yes, my brother. You know why? Yeah. All right, brother. Uh, hundred, hundred and broken. <laughs> that, that, that's all right. <laughs> Tell him, tell him. All right. Okay. Oh, Tony Prescott started this conversation, Me? Is right? He? Oh, stating poverty. You started. No, no, no. We we talking about the the hundred and and and, oh, but, but and it's the gonna 16. continue till seven. <laughs> so right. call this song. It's gonna continue till seven. We here till seven. Yeah, we here till seven o'clock. All right, go ahead. I do have this man. Uh, you are this man, you know. If you even coming out, you had to learn, you know. Good afternoon. I see Kenny good getting vexed this Sunday. How are you doing? Huh? <laughs> hey, we good? We cool. Can I get a Keith Stylus, please? Keith, Keith Stylus Styler. designer. Okay, no problem. Five at five, welcome. Good afternoon. Mm -hmm. Can I get Naya George, please? No, the old Naya, boy. How oh, you only call anything from point four ten, so, boy? We come in and drink you out in them. Georgie boy. You can't shoot me out, man. We need one more. We need one more. Yeah. So, you, you got the rest of the day, right? Until 7 to call us up and let us know 100 or 60 with 10. <laughs> Hello. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, gentlemen. Can I get an Ella Handel, please? Yeah, Ella. Sure. Yeah. 
Is it? My message says that baby and tell she good. Nah, she she bad. She bad. She, she bad. Yeah, she was. Yeah. She really. Oh, oh, she was here or it, it was not, um. Nah, nah, she was here in flesh. Yeah, yeah. She was live, boy. As somebody said, uh, GM, oh, good, hey, Tony P, um, full and um, there's a full belly is full belly. I rather the time with rice and grease than money steak and dead early. Mother Cosell and all. Ah. Watch me. You gonna have somebody most hunt centurion in San Fernando, yeah, you know. We're going and lift up your general no people. Yeah, they say. I rather the time. You understand? With rice and grease than with money steak and dead early, boy. <laughs> hey, that's it. Time for five at five inside the culture drive. for five at five inside the culture drive.
all the abuse of power right across the land. Our disregard for law and order and disrespect to our fellow man are thinking how in sport and culture we share with Watch 
treasuries. We have made them strong, creating authorities as we go along. What? Knowing power develops and absolute power corrupts. Question for the lads, who are the God is God? The royalties and the governments, the many houses of parliaments, the caster of the cards. Who are the God is God? Question for the fanatics, advocating politics in the face. What a God these gods. Guardians of the cities, guardians of the air, guardians over land and seas, here and everywhere. Just like the steady beat of a man. We have become quite obsessed with the militant syndrome To attain dependencies We have conjured up a chain of ascendancies Reaching at the top If it is this whole charade Depends upon rank and grade Question for the lads Who are the God is God The administrators of state defense The many heads of intelligence The espionage Galahad Shall it be the gorillas, the religious ministers, or the professors from Harvard? Who oh, are the God is God? Time for five at five inside the culture club.
Where's my people? Should I die? That's 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 uh, if you are in uh, if you are in Carnegie Hall or you are there in Buckingham Palace. What happened there? What you happened? are going to say, "Where's my people?" Them ain't no way talking. Where's my people? That them them ain't no. no. But you, you have to talk proper English. Where are those people that supposed to oh be? Oh gosh, here? no. We say Trinidad, where's and and you just said something. So when he was saying Trinidad, where are my people? Where are my people? That's, that's how we do it. Where are my people? That, that we go in Buckingham with that. Where, where, where we go in with that again? You go in Buckingham with that? Yes. But I thought you go in Buckingham with a man in the bedroom or something, you know? Oh, you see how life is. <laughs> now, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> you see, I, I tell you on a Monday, where's my people? On a Monday, yeah, just listen to him. And they will realize that he's coming with all the truths from over the week. Philip, my dear, I sing that. I sing Philip, my dear. There's a man in the bedroom. So I go leave Trinidad. And go back in and say, Where's where, my people? Where my people? Yes. That is my song. If you hire me to come back in and Where my people? Where my people? Where Buckingham? And everybody stand up and watch me die all year. Big man, when I was in Wembley Stadium. Who going on here? You think we should take this call? I've seen a kind of. Is it from Buckingham? Is it um, Look, we find Is out. it Philip, my Hello? dear? Hello? There's a butt dialogue. Good afternoon. Oh. Tony and Dezo. Hey, yeah. hey, hey. Good evening. Yes, sir. Um, I, I, I need all your help bad, bad, bad today. I just want to stray from the topic a little bit. Go ahead. Um, my, wife, my wife looking for a tune and um, came out somewhere in between 95 and 97. And it, it goes like this. Um, Agnes, this is madness. Agnes, or you know that tune at all? Agnes or Agnes madness? madness. They say Agnes, this is, or oh, it could be madness, this is madness. That could be the tune too. Oh, oh, oh. no, 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 it's not that. It's not, it's not savage. Oh, no, 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 all right, boss, the world here, yeah? The world here, yeah? Somebody go here, yeah, and that somebody will, yeah, will yeah, because yeah, I, somebody that everyone get no bell. Agnes might even call. Agnes, yeah, yeah. Agnes had all my call, I say, but I don't remember me. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Agnes, There's a man <laughs> in my bedroom. You want to take Agnes? Agnes, <laughs> <laughs> It's me like he I like. Um, Showin Gardner, Protector, King hey. Austin, uh, Designer, Keith Prescott, and Agnes. Na <laughs> Naya George, <laughs> Ella Andal, and Agnes. <laughs> good, good afternoon. <laughs> Hello. Hey, Tony, that uh, man opposite you, he hard drive. And he's that man singing, and that man ain't know that song. <laughs> Trust me. The man and, might have an idea why it is my wrong song. And he's that man opposite you. And, and hear that. that you know what I'm dying in record yet. <laughs> <laughs> that never play on radio. What's that? Me that man, I think that don't belong to the Lord in the Hajj. He's that man 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 in the Hajj. Well, I didn't even know if a man ever make a tune on Agnes. Hey. I hear Angela, I hear all kind of people. You see, all, all, all in that nice. He didn't call her the Eden Corps. That's all, that's all. Ta da ta da 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 when you run to finish it, Devon Judge, call this man and tell him what. You're too rude, Agnes. You're too rude. Hey, hey, let's go to a break, man. Only we come back, Agnes. Hey, Trinidad and Tobago. You see, Gloria, Saturday, Saturday, the 30th of March, San Fernando would never be the same again. Because everybody heading to Athelie's by the Park. Because Carib Street Boys and Wilkies presents the annual Back in Times party with the best DJs in the land. Featuring Peter, Alpha B, Mr. Desmond, and of course, yours truly, Mr. Q. Starting time is 9 p.m. and we're dancing all the way till dawn. 
Admission is $80, two-on-one -on -one tickets for $140. And at the door, you pay more. For more information, you can call Atelier's by the Park, Sion's Bar, that's on Royal Road. And of course, you can get your tickets from Wilkie's, 620-3169. That number again is 620-3169. Remember, we dancing down at Atelier's by the Park. It's another Carib Street Boys and Wilkie's promotion. San Fernando, we coming. This Easter Sunday, March 31st, at the Cipriani Labor College, Valsane, I Am Jazz Festival presents Jazz Is Blue, featuring saxophone sensation Mike Phillips, Elan Parley, Len Booksy Sharp, Nisa, Irvin Alves, Marcus Hippolyte, and more. Come and see our unique artisans and interact with your favorite artist. Tickets are available at Simon's Musical Supplies, Crosby's, King's Lounge, Barber Spa, Arima, and Movie Town Port of Spain. Sasu in Mid Center Mall, Sion's Bar, I Live for Glam Val Park Shopping Plaza. Gates open at 4 30 p.m. Showtime is 5 p.m. Wear something blue, bring a friend or two. Sponsored by King's Lounge Barber Spa, Clinical Media Group, Mount Irvin Bay Resort, Blue Water, Carrot Brewery, Duft Hair Products, Prodal Sound, Music TT, and Professional, The Lullaby Group, and Blind Effects. Parts proceed go to the Diabetes Association of Trinidad and Tobago. For more information, Call 386 4748 or 380 I am Jazz Festival. Jazz is blue. Spiritual Baptist Faith presents on Friday, 22nd March 2024, our first open air service at Isaac Junction, Coover at 7 p.m. Our dress code is national colors. Come and hear some dynamic men and women of God expound the gospel of Jesus Christ. On Monday, the 25th of March, 2024, the following activities will take place. Opening of the second entrepreneurial village at 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Men of Balov service, 7.45 p.m. to 9 p.m. Dress code blue. Tuesday, the 26th of March, 2024, exhibition which commences from Tuesday to Thursday, 28th March, 2024, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Entrepreneurial Village, Tuesday to Saturday, from 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. DOC presentation, Tuesday to Thursday, 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Youth for Christ, dress code white, starts at 6 p.m. Wednesday, the 27th of March, 2024, Woman of Substance Service. The time is 6 p.m., dress code pink. Thursday, the 28th of March, 2024, Myla Spiritual Baptist Experience. Starts 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The Spiritual Baptist Diaspora Service. Time is 6 p.m., dress colored. Saturday, the 30th of March, 2024, Spiritual Baptist Liberation Day Service, which commences at 9 a.m., dress code colored. All events will take place at the Administrative Building, Balmain, Coover. See you there. Diatonic Pan Institute presents for Separio Fest, Pan Tai Soka 24. Pan Tai Soka 24, Saturday, April 30th. Come, enjoy extempo clash between Abibeli and Brian London. I want it all the time. King Luther, Lefter Kojo, Johnny King. I want it all the time. And the legendary Super Blue. Along with Diatonic Pan Institute with vocals and dance. Pan Kai Soka 24. It's all happening at Diatonic Pan Yard, Mary Street, Separia. Showtime, 8.30 p.m. Admission only $200. It's all powered by the Atlantic LNG and Wife Music District. Pan Kai Soka 24. Make it a day. Saturday, April 30th. When you're ready, ready, man, the man, the iron and the man, where they can go from. It's a vibe in the session when we jam into the steel bun. Toronto, get ready for Fusion on Saturday, April 6th, St. Peter and Paul Banquet Hall, 231 Milner Avenue, Toronto. Doors open at 6 p.m. Dinner, 7 p.m. Show starts at 9 p.m. Fusion. Fusion. Fusion, a collaboration of string music and Caribbean vibes, featuring Andre J. Donoa, Trinidad and Tobago's virtuoso violinist. 
accompanied by Ozzy Gurley and the Truth Band, and soloist Tad Wilson, vocalist Mandy Woods, with dance performance by Tamla Matthews, and music by DJ Maceo. Tickets are $140. Limited tickets are at $135 until March 15th. You get discounts for tables of eight. Get tickets at www.ticketgateway.com or call Angela 647-262-6594 and Norman 647-998-4708. A production of P.S. Smith & Associates. This concert takes place under the auspices of the consulate and it's supported by Trinidad and Tobago Music Company Limited. Music TT. Toronto Fusion is coming. A reliable list of electors is an essential element of a democratic election. The Elections and Boundaries Commission is updating its list of electors through a national field verification exercise. Over the upcoming months, persons working with the EBC will be visiting homes throughout the country to verify that electors are still located at the address on its records. This is not a census or voter registration exercise. We look forward to your cooperation and you providing accurate information which will be held as strictly confidential. A message from the Elections and Boundaries Commission, your partner in democracy. This Easter Sunday, March 31st, at the Cipriani Labor College, Valsane, I Am Jazz Festival presents Jazz is Blue, featuring saxophone sensation Mike Phillips, Elan Parley, Len Booksy Sharp, Nisa, Irvin Alves, Marcus Hippolyte, and more. Come and see our unique artisans and interact with your favorite artist. Tickets are available at Simon's Musical Supplies, Crosby's, King's Lounge, Barber Spa, Arima, and Movie Town Port of Spain. Sasu in Mid Center Mall, Sion's Bar, I Live for Glam Val Park Shopping Plaza. Gates open at 4 30 p.m. Showtime is 5 p.m. Wear something blue, bring a friend or two. Sponsored by King's Lounge Barber Spa, Clinical Media Group, Mount Irvin Bay Resort, Blue Water, Carrot Brewery, Duft Hair Products, Prodal Sound, Music TT, and Professional, The Lullaby Group, and Blind Effects. Parts proceed go to the Diabetes Association of Trinidad and Tobago. For more information, Call 386 4748 or 380 I am Jazz Festival. Jazz is blue. When the time comes to honor and celebrate the life of your loved one, you can trust in the dedicated and compassionate staff at Clark and Batch Limited. With over 100 years of experience, we can tailor every detail that reflects your loved one's unique story. Whether you're considering traditional funeral services, cremation, or pre-planning for the future, we offer a range of options to meet your needs and preferences. We're here to provide the support and guidance you deserve. Contact Clark & Batu Limited, 652-3488 or 665-5266, or find us on Facebook and Instagram. I've done from the start. Spiritual Baptist Faith presents on Friday, 22nd March 2024, our first open air service at Isaac Junction, Coover at 7 p.m. Our dress code is national colors. Come and hear some dynamic men and women of God expound the gospel of Jesus Christ. On Monday, the 25th of March, 2024, the following activities will take place. Opening of the second entrepreneurial village at 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Men of Balov service, 7.45 p.m. to 9 p.m. Dress code blue. Tuesday, the 26th of March, 2024, exhibition which commences from Tuesday to Thursday, 28th March, 2024. 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Entrepreneurial Village, Tuesday to Saturday, from 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. DOC Presentation, Tuesday to Thursday, 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Youth for Christ, dress code white, starts at 6 p.m. Wednesday, the 27th of March, 2024, Woman of Substance Service. The time is 6 p.m., dress code pink. Thursday, the 28th of March, 2024, Myla Spiritual Baptist Experience. Starts 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The Spiritual Baptist Diaspora Service 
time is 6 p.m. Dress Colored. Saturday, the 30th of March 2024, Spiritual Baptist Liberation Day Service, which commences at 9 a.m. Dress Code Colored. All events will take place at the Administrative Building, Balmain, Kuva. See you there. Hey, Trinidad and Tobago. You see, Gloria, Saturday, Saturday, the 30th of March, San Fernando would never be the same again because everybody heading to Asselis by, by the Park. Because Carib Street Boys and Wilkies presents the annual Back in Times party with the best DJs in the world. Featuring Peter, Alpha B, Mr. Desmond, and of course, yours truly, Mr. Q. Starting time is 9 p.m. and we dancing all the way till dawn. Admission is $80, two-on-one tickets for $140. And at the door, you pay more. For more information, you can call Atelier's by the Park, Sion's Bar, that's on Royal Road. And of course, you can get your tickets from Wilkie's, 620-3169. That number again is 620-3169. Remember, we dancing down at Atelier's by the Park. It's another Carib Street Boys and Wilkie's promotion. San Fernando, we coming. Diatonic Pan Institute presents for Separi Effect Pan Tai Soka 24. Pan Tai Soka 24. Saturday, April 30th. Come, enjoy extempo clash between Abibeli and Brian London. I want it all the time. King Luther, Left the Kojo, Journey King. I want it all the time. And the legendary Super Blue. Along with Diatonic Pan Institute with vocals and dance. Pan Kai Soka 24. It's all happening at Diatonic Pan Yard, Mary Street Separia. Showtime, 8.30 p.m. Admission only $200. It's all powered by the Atlantic LNG and Live Music District. Pan Kai Soka 24. Make it a day. Saturday, April 30th. When you're ready, 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 man, the iron and the man, where they can go from. It's a vibe in the session when we jam into the steel pan. Are you interested in working with the Elections and Boundaries Commission for its National Field Verification Exercise? For more information about this opportunity and conditions to apply, visit portal.ebctt.com. The deadline for submission of applications is Monday, March 25, 2024. See Press for details. A message from the Elections and Boundaries Commission, your partners in democracy. Join your culture station for Sports Spotlight. Weekdays at 30 p.m. Sports Spotlight is a look at the daily sporting activity around Trinbago and the world. Sports Spotlight. Weekdays at 30 p.m. on the True Nation Station 90.1 FM. Good afternoon. I'm Cohen Borney and welcome to Sports Spotlight on WAC 90.1 FM. It was a return home to remember for the Trinidad and Tobago men's indoor hockey team which arrived at the VIP launch of Piaco International Airport to a rousing applause early yesterday morning. The team was greeted by officials of the Ministry of Sport and Community Development and the Sports Company of Trinidad and Tobago, as well as representatives of the Trinidad and Tobago Hockey Board. Led by coach Rafael Govia, the squad arrived just after 6 o'clock via Houston, Texas, after competing at the just-concluded 2024 Indo-Pan American Cup in Calgary, Canada, reaching the final in which they lost 5-2 to Argentina. The local stickman's credible performance in them as spot at the 2025 FIH Indoor Hockey World Cup, which will be this country's third appearance at that global tournament. Govia thanked his staff and the TTHB for their support to the team. He also congratulated the team for their spirit and passion in representing the country and described their showing as mission accomplished. David Roberts, permanent secretary in the Ministry of Sport and Community Development, extended congratulations to the team for their significant achievement on behalf of the Minister of Sport and Community Development, Shamfa Kujo Lewis. Trinidad and Tobago senior men's football team head coach Angus Eve, along with key players, all believe that as TNT continues to improve, they will be in a good position when CONCACAF qualifying commences in June for the 2026 FIFA World Cup. TNT lost out on a spot for the 2024 Copa America, following a 2-0 defeat to Canada in a CONCACAF Nations League playing match on Saturday at Toyota Stadium in Frisco, Texas. Eve said that the process going forward is about building belief in the players. 
Meanwhile, Costa Rica rallied past Honduras 3 1 yesterday to complete the 16th nation field for the Copa America. Canada will open the Copa America against defending champions Argentina on June 20th in Atlanta, playing Chile five days later at East Rutherford, New Jersey, and Peru on June 29th in Orlando, Florida. Costa Rica start on June 24th against Brazil in Inglewood, California, play Colombia four days later at Glendale, Arizona, and close the first round against Paraguay on July 2nd in Austin, Texas. They join the United States, Mexico, Panama, and Jamaica at South America's championship as invited guests from North and Central America and the Caribbean. Nicholas Puran launched his latest Indian Premier League campaign with a stellar unbeaten half century, but it proved in vain as his Lucknow Super Giants went down to Shimon Hetmaz Rajasthan Royals by 20 runs on Sunday. In pursuit of 194, Super Giants got a top score of 64 not out from Puran and 58 from captain and opener Kale Rahul, but fell short of the target as only one other batsman, Deepat Huda, with 26 past 20. They required 38 from the last two overs, and Seamus, Sandeep, Sharma, and Avish Khan managed to shackle the left-handed Puran. Pakistan fast bowler Mohammad Amir made himself available for the upcoming 2020 World Cup on Sunday, more than three years after retiring from international cricket. The left-arm bowler announced his international retirement at the age of 28 in December 2020, saying he could no longer play under the management and that he was being tortured mentally. The 31-year-old who was jailed in 2011 for the part in a sport-fixing scandal served three months in prison and a five-year ban from all forms of cricket before returning to the Pakistan squad in January 2016. Part of the team that won the 2019-20 World Cup and 2017 Champions Trophy, Amir has played in franchise T20 leagues since his retirement. The Jamaica Athletics Administrative Association has signed a memorandum of understanding with the German city of Stuttgart to host the trading camp ahead of the 2024 Paris Olympic Games. Jamaican athletes selected to compete at the Olympics later this year will travel to Germany to take part in a final training camp to complete the country's preparations for the Games. The German ambassador to Jamaica described the agreement as a mutually beneficial deal for both the JAAA and Germany. He said this agreement was born out of the positive relationships between both countries. And Anthony Davis had 36 points and 16 rebounds, and LeBron James added 26 points and 10 assists as the Los Angeles Lakers extended their winning streak to three games by holding on for a 150-145 victory Sunday over the visiting Indiana Pacers. The Lakers, who start a run of six away games on Tuesday, are ninth in the Western Conference and have 11 matches remaining in the 82-game regular season. The top eight qualify for the end-of-season playoffs. The Pacers are six in the Eastern Conference and have 10 games to play. Elsewhere, the Box beat the Thunder 118-93 to consolidate second position in the Eastern Conference. The Timberwolves edge past the Golden State Warriors 114-110. The Clippers remain fourth despite a 121-107 defeat by the 76ers. The Pelicans defeated the Detroit Pistons 114-101 and the Miami Heat kept up their playoff push in the Eastern Conference with a 121-84 win over the Cavaliers. And that's a look at Sports Spotlight on WAC 90.1 FM. Join us tomorrow for another edition. I'm Cohen Borneo. Good afternoon. Jazz. Jazz. Nobody does jazz like we do jazz on WAC 90.1 FM. Jazz. Nobody does jazz like we do jazz on WAC 90.1 FM. And he's the master.
the sun is descending while the moon is approaching and the crown is gone it seems like nobody is interested to carry on some broken old bottles so far an indication the carnival is over the music that sounding so terrific I would like to know the sweet sweet saxophone the pan and the trombone and so what is wrong like the two hear the sound of a drum or a bass a guitar an indication sing it the carnival is over an indication the carnival is over wow our jazz joints for today Mavis John and of course Mr. John Arnold out of the sisters of Tobago inside the Jasmine joints for today. Jasma, ja, I mean, um, John? John. John Arnold, yeah. Yeah. Um, what was he big? Oh, yeah. He do a lot, a lot of stuff, man. Or, right, it was the same jazz because they used to have a big thing down there in um, mm-hmm. in Tobago, in Charlottesville, Space Side. The Space yeah, Side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we, we played there a couple of times with the band. He, he was, he was a big man inside it. So, Mr. The, the, the guy who called with, yes, uh, with could Agnes. You, yes, could you call us back because we have a tune no, here. No, we're going to play the song. We're going to play the song. If this is the song, the let us know. The closest we reach to Agnes is, is this. Is Janice. We don't know if it's this, but the closest we but reach But if that is your wife name, you're in trouble, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so, call us back and tell us yes or no, right? Yeah.
Uh, but anybody, you know, they don't know bad breeze to blow. Um, anybody can give us any information about Cravat. Um, does he sing any background yeah, there, right? Yeah, Is he Trinbegonian? What happened after the Janice? Um, I know um, Del Piero might have played bass last week, last week for him, but <laughs> you know what I mean. But it's uh, five minutes after the hour of six, and it's Monday, and we call it Holy Week. So you can call us up, talk your mind, what's happening with you for the Easter, what's happening in general. And, 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 and I think it, it's only fitting. I now see our money text coming. They are stopped now. Eh? Uh-huh. Yeah, you know. You know this good the artist now. You know the fight now. I, I think it's only right that way. I have. Right now. Okay. We all know the problems. Why you continue with it? Yes, my brother. Why you continue with it for me to hear? Uh-huh. Never send that to you. Because we are at a point. What do you want? That we can't blame. Mm, we got song, boy. Leaders of the world for what All is right. taking place right now. It, we inside Holy Week, so you know, every now and again inside this week, you gain a little segment of, you know, what it's supposed together. to be, really. Stay yes, sir. So. Yeah. so I brought my family. You was about to say something, yes, sir. Skate votes. Yeah, I, I, you, you, you was talking, and all of a sudden, you're hush. Let you reach us. Yeah. But anyway, it's Holy we, Week. Let me take this here. All right, sir. Father. Help your children And don't let them fall By the side of the road And teach them To love one another That heaven might fall Jesus is love, oh, yes he is, he won't let you down, and I know he's mine forever. Tony, you, you know who voice is that? In my uh. Tell me, listen. We've got to walk on, walk on through temptation, because his love and his wisdom will be of helping hand. You make it out there? I know the truth, and his words will be our salvation. You know it song like? Yeah, it's deceased, brother. That's it. <laughs> yeah. We have one match. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because somebody notes, you know? Yeah. But Anna. Yeah, yeah. Good evening. Hey, sleep in peace. Big, big one, man. Devon Matthews, boy, deceased. But yeah, never yeah, forgotten. Yeah, yeah, never. Big, big one, boy. Yeah, yeah, for sure. A nice, nice one, this. Yeah, brother, bless. Deep down in my soul, cause Jesus is love. You know what amazes me, Tony? Where music is concerned, right? Yeah. It has so much great music. I mean, well, 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 fantastic from all over the globe, wh- yes, wherever. Yes, yes. But there are people who choose to listen to the to, to, to things that will upset your spirit. What, what causes that? <laughs> no, I, I, I just do the death money, I'll just give her a wild answer, now, but. You mean the, some people choose to use to listen to music that upsets whose spirit? Theirs or your or or, 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 or someone else? Well, the, the the thing about it is the reason I, why I went there. Yeah. I, I was talking to a youth. Right. Dreadlocks and yeah. everything, right? Right. And he said there's a we were going somewhere and, 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 and the radio was was playing one of them 
Trini bad thing. Right, right. And he, he turned around and he said, you know what, man? If you know this thing that's upset me, I say, but, eh? I say, I need probably about 30. Right, he's young yeah, enough yeah, to be I, in I, the I team. Yeah, 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 yeah. I say, you sure you know what you're talking about? He said, boss man, I do not listen to this thing. Right. I say, as a youth man, he say, and? You understand where, where, where I'm coming from? Right, so, uh, so in other words, you were saying, mm. because... That was his dialogue with, with, with that, you know, particular mm. song. You would ask, you know, well, why would somebody choose to listen to upsetting music? So, right. right. Mm. And I, I, will, I would answer it this way, because, you know, I always had to answer it, and I certainly maybe in, in the arts too, right? Mm. Beauty is in the eyes of the beholder, mm -hmm. right? Um, what some people may think as upsetting, some people may find soothing. And that is the thing about music. And then there is some music... That I may know a little bit about, a little thing, not as much as most people, that crosses all across the boundary, so you never had that problem. Everybody who hear that song, one love, they never got everybody attached to it. You know that song that uh, Michael Jackson, even though you know who's Billy Jean, you, Billy Jean, he always pulls up in the bush, they sing Billy Jean. In the Congo, man, man was moonwalking on, 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 on turtle back and thing. But, so you know, there's a universal song that everybody will find. And, and be connected to. All right. Yeah? So some of the other forms I don't comment on, I just say it's a person's preference because coming up in our times, mm -hmm. there was a music that we didn't understand or we wasn't heavy into and it they had that backlash. Two, two star music. One was house music, which I did like. And the, house, house music still there. Dr. Abrahams and, and, and all that. Yeah, it, it it's still there. And, and Yaz and them. Think right, it, but right. but we, we were a few who listened to that. And, and rock and roll. And rock. Not and rock, rock and roll, rock. roll but rock. rock. Heavy, like, heavy le metal. Led Zeppelin. Uh, heavy the, metal. Well, you should be, be going on. It has some Josie's printing, screaming for vengeance. Mm. The who, who, who. Um, these fellas, um, with Eye of the Tiger, well, Toto. Kind of thing, yeah. So, you know, but it was a choice, right? All right. So some people wouldn't have listened to that. So I don't want to say like you know any music is a bad form, but I never said no. No, I never. It just, no, had, it yeah. has, it just have songs that things that will upset your spirit. That is all I say. And right. it depends, you know. We coming back. We coming. Yeah, man. We coming. Back. Holy to holy. I listen holy to no, because week. holy week. Yeah. <laughs> the God, God, God put our energy in him. <laughs> say it. Regardless of what they say about the old super, he really passed through, I mean, everything, you know. 
Nobody can say yeah. nothing about that brother. Though. Yeah, he touched a bit and yeah. everything. Else. Nobody is like, you know, that's why we like the, 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 the New Testament now. Uh, you know when some of the energy wasn't as bad mind as the as as back then uh, and the great i am said he without sin pell the first stone in us see all them eye fire and kicking our face them days done you know i come in and do everything for you so you know as they say nobody cannot say nothing about superman nobody, I, I <laughs> nobody and i say that on national radio and the views expresses tony prescott view i agree with that i second that right and mr desmond showing he had there because we work in on a station we work for someone yeah, yeah. nobody under god and man could say anything about superman nah, super austin lyons he has paid his tolls on his third body wait <laughs> wait Do, do, the only thing about it eh, mm-hmm. is that in in in, in other countries yeah he would have been put on a higher pedestal than to where he is now in other country he may have been in dead if he's so. yes because most of the greats who was in the other country they're dead james and them gone you know mm. when you hear this story his story is no different uh, she's super freaking you know? on rick james you know? Mm-hmm. You understand? No Michael and uh, no no Sly and the family stone. I mean, you call a real name art imitates life. So sometimes when you're watching the gods favor you and your favor you in a zone. And I ain't say that with no bad mind. Right? Because the system out there, when they can't suck you no more, they use you until they use you up. At least in the Caribbean, they might they might throw you out and you can still find life. You can still find life. You know, a lot of people grow old within the Caribbean. They mightn't be having the energy that they used to have. And of course, we just forget them. But if you if you read, read this, when, when, when Sam Coke and them fellas, and you read the story how Sam Coke and them fellas dead, you don't know what's happening, boy. Is anybody could dead out there? You know? right, right. When you hear some of these stories of how in this music business and you're really going because they have it written, how this one rise, how this one fall, how this one die. And you was thinking, well, was a plane crash, or you was thinking, was thing, and you in behind the scenes was this one was going change manager, and 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 blase blase. And I talking about from way back, eh? mm. I was the one just checking a story about Sammy Davis Jr. We couldn't marry the woman he wanted to marry, which was a white woman, and she was the number one actress in the world, right? And why why you couldn't? Marry? Because back then Rosa Parks and them we did now get a little space off the bus now, boy. But even though we were making strides and they were putting laws that they're saying that we, are, we love you all and we are making waves, there were places that closed the doors still and segregated and Hollywood was one of those places. So the big man in Hollywood, who, when he found out, they, they documented stuff so people can read this. You know, you know when, we, when some of us African people or people in diaspora started to hear these stories, we started to feel this toting and oh, what they're talking about. But no, it's real things. So if you read it, you go kind of understand the pressures and pains many people went through to bring it to this, this spot. And um, they said it was going to be a backlash because the majority of people who was watching Hollywood were white people. The majority of their top actors, you know, were, were white. Right? So... To have a guy like Sammy, to this interracing thing, and Sam, you know, Sam, they didn't want that. So they, they made a deal. They send the mob for Sammy. This real thing. You know? They send the mob, and the mob telling me happening. If you blase, 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 we go blase. He called he, he people. And he people telling me happening. We go in Vegas. We go in New York. We see Hollywood. <laughs> we are not rich. <laughs> so if you know what good thing, you go marry this black woman. And it documented. He ended up strangling she and at the wedding night for she was in tears and pain that he couldn't do. And eventually he married a white. But hmm. it has stories behind his story. So when you talk about super and you're talking something, you're feeling that if you was out there, out there is a different level as a demons. And out there, out there is, is he 200 way falling? You know? <laughs> Down here is little mother Zampi and them demons. You know? But out there is them, is them 200 falling out there. You know? <laughs> Destination. Destination. 
now, okay, for first man. time, first time I am hearing this, right? Reading, reading in the chat. Oh. No, not this song. Oh. Naomi John said, Blessed evening, guys. Super yeah. Blue has done great from the days of being a drummer mm. at the Eugene Joseph Dance Group. You see where Super comes from? Yeah, we see. Yeah, that's what I said. No, we said it. And, 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 you remember the first year was the word, you know, and the word to be magnified. So once you leave that door open, because, <laughs> watch now, boy. Hmm. This place is so evil and wicked too now, boy. Right? Because you know how I feel about Super, right? Yep, yep. And more so, much, you have an idea how he feels about me. So something I feel about a certain person, but when you get a mutual, I, I go in all out with wit and yeah. for Super. Yep. And just what, what the individual say, I know him all that long and, and in terms of that time, but I just say people just be so wicked and thing because the same ones who praise you are not in this, this sense. But we as brothers who was there in St. James, yeah. you know, a regular everyday, everyday work. work. Yeah, yeah. Right? And 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 sometimes I don't watch people and just watch them so and say, all you're all you really wicked and plus all you no shame. <laughs> because when you see that jump like crap or so and thing down in the fantastic and all these certain things now, but but we know they see God is that you think about the Almighty, co- cosmic consciousness, whoever you, you find is the highest. You don't know boy who they go choose boy. You don't know who he got chose to come and spread his word and to be here. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, and yeah. super is that. It should have cameras in front of his face every day. His, his walking, his going in and his coming out to ask him his secrets, to tell him of the seals and, and, and all the energies. But we don't do that. Yeah, well, man. <laughs> you remember that, that conversation we had from the yes, airport yes, street to where, yes, where, where we went? Yes. Wow. And when we and when we all come back to Trinidad it manifests. <laughs> because we were there talking truths. Yeah. You know, just truths and everybody confident and about each other. And even in the show, mm. there's a picture where I was passing, I didn't even see him. To tell you when I all I see when, when you give the nod and you know well we know we're coming off. Right? And I pass and he pass. And the colours that was there in the two uh, persons, it was like you know what I mean? It was yeah. like, damn, boy, like all they watching each You know what I mean? All yeah, yeah. That kind of way. So that is the high level of spirit, high level of spirituality oh, yeah. and energy. Now, this song, now Calypsonians, right? Mm-hmm. Who, 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 how all put it? Put their. A mark? Their, their mark in, in, into gospel. Yeah. You know, we would have had something out there. Yes. Just a one song. I, like the, the brother that I'm, Johnny, okay. I'm about to play here, right? Johnny King, do I? Yeah, well, that's the man I'm going to play. <laughs> well, you see, when you're vibrating <laughs> on a level, me and him, what, I didn't even know some, where you in the bag day. You understand what I'm yeah. saying? But, but this song, Johnny, this will live longer hmm. than all the rest of songs said, Johnny King ever sang. Hmm. Present.
It's only so you think that's also as a so as a you know I keep hearing you saying it's holy week and holy week as a mm. as a 365 sinner now boy oh, oh, oh. Mm. what what is going to do for the thing now boy if you do for what if, if I sin and I, I sin it no you're not saying that but you know I say holy week and so what, what? but it is not holy week right and boss, I, and boss, I, 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 I find listen to boss, this boss, listen boss, listen boss, very boss, carefully right? dance according I <laughs> I, I, I find that that, that amazing grace. We are the only radio station mm-hmm. will do this. Just out of the blue and 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 and, and do get a kickback or uh, 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 saying hey what are they doing there? And Kenny and Kenny, and Kenny son buy two tugs for him this weekend, go on here. Yeah? What I mean? You are kick back. <laughs> <laughs> Things looking blue. <laughs> no, 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 don't worry. You know they say Amazing Grace, how sweet this song that will save a wretch could be lost and then be found. So when I hear a brother like you, 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 you get hope. Like hoping. me with hope with what are you talking about? Holy week. Holy week. Holy week. I say, well, boy, I say like my brother like he. Like I go and change? No, for me, I feel really looking for some hot cross buns. I say... <laughs> The way balling holy week, I say he's looking for a hot cross bun. <laughs> Anti V. Vizo. <laughs> yeah, we watch that. Somebody, some a old time I go and get catch you know. There's a piece of there's a food. Well, I'm not gonna be partaking in that. Is is a, is mackerel? No salmon. In Easter, salted salmon or something, that boy. I don't know at all. Oh, horse. If he is a big time, he probably was rich. As you say, he was rich. It had to be between rich and wealthy. I ever make that. I ever say that on this video. Is that all he was rich or wealthy? <laughs> right? But I, where I, we I, were from now, and that poorness and poverty, as all they say, you the mm. poor. Is a salmon horse. Mm. Salmon. Salt, salt salmon you, for Easter. Is a salt salmon something, boy? You could afford salmon. That what no. I tell you. If you say you was rich and wealthy and you ain't know about salmon on a Easter and we How do you say that? Why we used to the dog used to get that? All right, look at the that. dog. <laughs> Lassie used to come Lassie, look at piece of salt, salmon, but I'll wait Lassie is no he dead, eh? Well uh, how much years a dog gonna live? <laughs> <laughs> Hello <laughs> Good afternoon, gentlemen. The Tony P. The name of that salmon is Lux. The Jewish company, the Jewish people is called it Lux. 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 Yeah, they teach it around the whole holy day and stuff. But, oh, uh, um, you gotta be a topper to eat that, ain't? You gotta be a topper. Hmm. All right, but what? If you have to be a topper to eat that, to, 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 to eat Lux. <laughs> I, I have no idea. <laughs> 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 All right, brothers. Blessings. You good see, a, good you evening. See, Welcome. You see, I'm a salt salmon. You're, you're so fighting. Hey, you can eat it. That's all too ring. Yes, sir. That's all too ring. Chaka. Yeah, it's, it's mackerel. Mackerel? It's mackerel, boy? Yeah, that, yeah, mackerel. That's why you say give me dog. That's why you say give me dog. For Good Friday. Mackerel, you say? Not salmon, boy? Oh, God. Yeah, for Good Friday, mackerel. 
Right, boy. That is why the dog used to get that. Yeah. All right. <laughs> All right, boy. Yeah, mackerel. Well, oh, good Friday. Yeah, but I think we realized mackerel wasn't a good taster. So we, we went with salmon. Mackerel, he said. Mackerel it was. So what they call mackerel tiger fish out there. The sailors when they were, when Columbus and them was coming and they couldn't get shark and, and, and redfish and get tiger fish, you know. Mackerel that day. You know all that is yeah? Mackerel it had to save the day, you no. Know? Here comes the bitter man. <laughs> yeah, he times of times ring out the news. Another Call him the aloes boy. Uh, Better sweet man. One says now she's royal. <laughs> you may have longed for added strength, your courage to renew. No, do not be disheartened, for I have news for you. I think so far yeah. in, in, in the industry, I know how many men have had gospel albums. Sparrow. Oh, albums. Sparrow had a gospel album. Yeah, um, Rose. Yeah. Um, Glory be, I thank thee. Um, yeah, and she put them. Allos. Well, Ke- he, he, Kenny J didn't do anything? Song. I Kenny. think Kenny would have had Yeah, Jesus two. is love. Yeah, yeah, and he had don't right. let the sun go down on me. Nice. And... Um, who, who, who again? Chuck does had the yeah Chuck, the, Chuck does had the Sankey yeah, and them, Sankey and them right, Sister, right. well right okay as men Chuck does had a Chuck whole does, album yeah, with yeah, the Sankeys right. and them who again um who again? the Lamo and them? yeah the Lamo well the Lamo turn I mean he right. went he went he, protector he, well protector had 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 songs um right. um this boy Luther 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 um Tony P Go one little reggae you sing of um, You see all the fighting me? <laughs> it ain't no not a cuss word in all the board, you know. So what that way we say that? So but, what so that the word that Jesus means? is far we you never hear that? Boy. <laughs> and it no and you laugh, eh? But true 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 story now. Uh, yeah, the, but the, the first mm. official credit I ever get for this and I take it was a certain nun from Mount Mon- St. Benedict. She sourced me for, for weeks and weeks. I went up and when she told me the story of, she telling me the story of my song and what it means. So, and you know, and, and yeah. we kept in touch and I felt good about that. You know, Miss um, Superville, yeah, Baron have not, no. I think they, they were in the process of doing one and let, let, let's wait and see. Right, Angela Baron. Thomas. Mm. Is this the end? We have a Angela Thomas here from Monterey Post, right? Yeah. But I've seen a Mo- Angela Thomas from Minnesota. Minnesota, I say there's no and rainy. Yeah, minutes. so if, it's, if, if, if this is the same or not the same, let us know. Um, how much from Monterey Post? How should we reach there? You're fighting the artist, or? So but we talked to Monterey Post last but week. But Monterey Post have money? I, I, I never said that. So, so if you talk but to I somebody saying, last week, uh, as a fl- what a good thing. Mon repose so that I don't think we are not buying them. Hey, Mon repose so that same fellas, I go nah, in and come again. This man has a flyer. You just need to tell me nothing and you wasn't in the country and come back and work with Kenny Sunday. Right? Wherever. Hey, let me do this. <laughs> <laughs> so, Mon, Miss Mon repose could be out there in Minnesota with her. Minnesota. M- Minnesota. Men are soda? No, not Minnesota. Minnesota. No, 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 no. It, oh, men are soda. Mini or apple? Anyway, whip, whip. Mini Apples. What? Mini Apples. Where, where? Say it again. Mini Apples. music. Mini Apples. Mini Apples. Mini Apples. Mini Apples. Then I have a O in it. 
That is silent. So it's Minneapolis, Minnesota. The home of Prince. The home of Prince? I don't know where Prince lives. If you know where Prince, I, I have a Prince home by me. Purple Rain, Minnesota Viki- Vikings, Minneapolis. Is that, is that kind of okay. town? You know who's a big name we forgot to call? Kenny Phillips? Christopher Tambu Herbert, but Yeah. Big, big name. Yeah, that, that was, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Most, most, most deaf, yeah. yeah. Chris. And, um, I'm on Michelle Sylvester. Yeah, Michelle. Denise right. Plummer, see a player, one on right. the top. Yeah, Denise. Um, who other female would have, would, have, would have gone? Well, Rose, as, as we said from before. Singing Sandra Devines. Yes, yeah, Sandra with us. Yeah, Tigress. 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 Tigress yeah. Sister Bev. Yeah, well, so, yeah, Bev. Yeah. Well, you know, and we had a sister Bev with five to five to five at five from from dance. Boy, you have yeah, put I, on the man song, boy. That was last. <laughs> that is where you vexed with your say I didn't play it. <laughs> last week. Boy. Last week, Friday. Today, I talking about. Today. Today, you a... wanted to. I never hear that. I went outside, buddy, from though. <laughs> good, good evening. Hey. Who? Oh. Yeah, Eastland, Eastland, well, Eastland, yeah, Eastland would have been yeah. in the game and she changed, yeah. Alright. Um, it's about JD too. JD, right. JD was A E O and he yeah, right. He, he um, um, um Nigel. Nigel from Nigel and Marvin. Yes. Yeah, Nigel. Lewis, yeah. yeah. Nigel Lewis, yeah. Mm-hmm. Right, the Jerusalem. Um no, not, but not before that, yeah, before that, right? Yeah, whole album. Yeah, yeah. Um, hey, huh? Oh, <laughs> not, not, no, you wouldn't believe he just went to my mind. Hey, I boy. wonder what it is if, if he would I ever touch it. Like you in here where I sing, that is where I find that it has always crunk me out, you know. <laughs> Put up on your hand now if you don't want to war. They love to see the every race. Good evening. You forget I wanna. Good evening, Tony Dazzle. Tell him now, boy, because I'll oh, tell you him. you forget Lady Adana. Oh, yeah. you forget Brother Valentino. Tino. Right. Joseph. Joseph, right. Who again? That is it. All right. That is it. Yeah, 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 yeah we're well, crazy and gospel too, right? Yeah. Your Jesus and your Christmas. Okay. Yeah, okay, so then. All right, all about. Yes, I wanna do a song with Tony Pena. Yeah. Hey, ha, Tony P. Who are you? Kenny. <laughs> Good evening. <laughs> Good evening, gentlemen. Hey. Sister Bev would be in Ocala on concert for Mother's Day. I know That's you said, yeah, you said, you said. It was 20th anniversary. I just talked to her, you know. <laughs> From 2 to 7. No, I just, I just spoke to my sister Bev. And, and what's the cause? Right. What's the cause? Okay. Turn it down. In advance, 35 at the door. Alright, brother. Nice. Okay. Yeah, man. You know this young boy who was a, a, a five star kill. Yeah, well he. T- you know he, he was. He, 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 went, he went. He went. He went yeah. across there too. Reverend is Benz. 
Pump yeah, Tobago. Yeah, 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 Pump Tobago, yeah. yeah. Um, when yeah. Jah bless her, man. Yeah, 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 if, yeah. God, if God bless her, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we have some, we have some. We have plenty, we have some. Some, yeah. And I think Kenny, we're looking forward to Kenny. Uh, we're looking forward to Kenny Phillips' next album. Doing what? You're trying the Calypso, I mean. <laughs> Let's sing for God now. <laughs> all you fighting the artists, I tell all you, you know. Kenny, Kenny, call me. Kenny, call me. Your fans, we have been we have been besieged with calls, Kenny, and messages. Is Kenny going to double? Is Kenny going to double? Hey. Right in a gospel. Miss Philip writing that. In. <laughs> we, we, we can't serve two masters in Miss Philip. Kenny, we can't serve two masters in. <laughs> but you know you're laughing, no? Kenny sing a gospel and liquid the place, you know? Tony P and him getting a call to, to, to sit down in our front seat, you know. <laughs> and to all those who are, of course, heading out to uh, services and your spiritual uh, religious spaces, eh, we encourage you. We encourage you, we encourage you not only to pray for yourselves, pray for the nation, Trinidad and Tobago, that we can we can get through this. That is Tambu. Good evening. Kenny. Well, so I heard Kenny singing a gospel from Jim Reeves. When? Sometime I hear Tony Phillips singing that. Jim Reeves, you say no. Call him. Call him. Yes, no. Call him. Call him. Call him. Call him. Call him. Call him. Jim Reeves. All I wanted to, I wanted to do like that. So I'm about to say it's alleged, please. Yes, no. Yes, no. Yes, no. Yes, no. When? When? Listen. Ask him. I can't be. I can't He didn't know anybody was around. All right. Hey, that mean it. Hey, hey, that, that Which day. one was that? Never go home? <laughs> never go home in the land where you never. <laughs> uh, or what? Or I thank thee for Desmond not coming to work today. Kenny. Is I thank thee? These work people are the greatest. Kenny, we need to clear up something. <laughs> Cosell say. Say, Cosell say. She, the she, person who, who sing on your big song. She just she she heard. Heard you play. Sing at Jimmy's. I, I thought it was pl- play. I think she was mean play. No, we don't play Jimmy's. Right. Be sing. So, Kenny, we're not moving until we hear from you. Which one was it? Who, we we thank thee. Who said that? <laughs> we thank thee. You were moving. Not um, me. Never go home. You know, learn. I'd rather have me. <laughs> Call me, Kenny. <laughs> Across the bridge. There'll be no, <laughs> no more sorrow. <laughs> Something happened. Kenny. Good, good evening. This is this song I sang the Kenny Phillips oh, yeah, song yeah, yeah, yeah. that song. Uh, across uh, the bridge. Uh, Where are you saying that? Across the bridge? Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> There'll be no more oh, songs. Sorry, <laughs> <laughs> then you have no choice but to choose God's plan. What from then you won't break you. And he'll never forsake you. So you look up to the hill. Because you know that is where your help comes from. Get down on your knees, this thing. You know that's just what you. I had, had some conversations with this brother. We were on a cruise and um, a jam. A jam. Mm-hmm. And, and and he, he, he you know, there 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 are people when they are encounter certain things in their life. Yeah. And they realize that hey, that's yeah. the man who who saved, you know. They, he, yeah, they see real. God. They see God. Yeah, and they know well, God. Right. They, they well, know God. They know that God. That is one of the the the, 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 the things that, that that we we spoke about. Mm-hmm. And wow. And 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 do you think that, you know, because sometimes when this happens, 
you know, some people would brush it off as here. Yeah. But, you know, do you really believe that someone can have an encounter now, boy? Well, you and will... see it now, boy. And see see the demon and it, it, see, it, well, it, God save you too now, boy. But that people will give stories like that, yeah. Of course. Diana Charles saying Billy Ocean. Well, Billy Ocean is from Trinidad. I don't know if he has a, a gospel? An, an, any gospel music. Yeah, he has the cap- capacity he the, and he voice capacity to, to, to do to that. Do that, that yeah. Um, we did say Reverend Baines for the yeah. person who texted me. Yeah. Yeah. But, um, I mean, yeah, you really have to. That's why I love, I always say, you know, I, I, I like human, humanity. I like learning from people. Because sometimes, not sometimes, many times I see somebody may feel a certain type of way about you and, okay, you is this now. But they wouldn't even realize that their gift and their talent, what they have, you are amazed with that now, boy. You know what I mean? You see that all the time, like, let me say, if it's somebody who cook or somebody who's a barber, somebody who's a tailor, somebody who's a mechanic, somebody who's, who, who's just doing even a service in a store. You know what I mean? Somebody who pick up the rubbish. Like when I see the guys who picking up the rubbish and thing. Then for that energy and thing, boy. You know, it's not no look down now, boy. It's, it's like, yeah, boy, you doing something that I cannot do. And if you weren't there to do it, we would have been in trouble. Push. But you should have been a police. I know your parents, you disappoint your parents with that. Let me tell you something now. You disappoint them. I tell them. You disappoint them with that. But do not? Your father wanted to be a police horse. Nah. Hello, good, good evening. Good evening, there's one tune. Yes, sir. Michelle Sylvester, anybody call yeah, yeah, Yes, we yeah, did. We, we, yes, we, we did. We yeah. talk about Michelle. Yeah. 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 Even uh, JD and all, and yeah, many of the, and this guy who, who passed away, Jamie, who, Jamie. well, he was a popular, he was a break dancer, and he passed away about three years, two to three years ago. He was on, he was, used to be on, on, um, Frederick Morton program. Okay. A red guy from Trinidad. He was, he was pushing heavy on that gospel energy all throughout the Caribbean. Hello, hello good evening. Jamie, something. Good evening, sir. Ross Shorty Eye. Yeah, yeah, well, Shorty Eye. Yeah. With Jamu music and, yeah. and, and, and oh, that energy. Well, remember Shorty Change? Too. Yeah. Yeah, man, bless. And, and all right, that, that's another t- topic. Jamu. Who, who are the, the, the artists that, that cross, well, change from, you know, the and soccer done. thing? And done? No, and, and went into gospel. And done? No, fully, yeah, and done. And done. With it. Well, Tambu, Tambu at the top of the list Tambu, for me. Dennis the plumber. Also, Shorty, Rash Shorty, I. All right. Um. You know? Again. Hello. Good evening. Gilamo. Gilamo. He talking about Jamie Thomas. Jamie Thomas. Jamie yes, Thomas. sir. Yes, yes, yeah. yes, 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 my brother. Yeah, brother. Blessings. Yeah. And then, I don't know if anybody called Baron. Baron has some gospel too. No. Where you get that from? And Desmond is yeah. Baron. Yeah, Baron has some gospel. Name, name one. Hmm. This Desmond, eh? Beside him, beside him Christmas one. Name one. You talking about Christmas song? I right? talking about no, gospel no. music. This is Desmond, Desmond, <laughs> CD, flash drive, Peters, eh? No, no. They, 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 they were in the process of doing one. You hear what? I don't listen know, to him. I, I don't know if I, it, Listen it to him, Paula. Listen to him, eh? They, they, hopefully, you might get a, a shock that he, Say it slow. he bring one. Say it slow for them, Desmond. <laughs> All right, brother. Bless. That is I, the executive the... producer just talked to you today. Hello, good, good evening. Huh? Michelle Sylvester. Yeah, yeah, we did. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. We, we a lot, a lot of people mentioned Michelle, yeah. All right, but um, who again? Are we, we, we talking about who, who left and said the same um, five star right. kill? Right, five star kill. We, we, we had right. Tambu, we had. Yeah. Well, they say Rashot, he did leave and he never came after. He because, never went back to this. Because after watch out my the, children the, the, and the that jam, jamu, right. jamu thing, More spiritual construction yeah. of it. I think we that is, that is the um sister Bev. Well, sister was yeah, she she used to be banned in banned Right, thing, right, know? right. So full hundred. Um I seen somebody again, you know. Um just now boy. Um, and Kenny Phillips, we await your call. Kenny you call in here, boy. Because there, there has been a question to answer about the Jim Reeves. <laughs> you know? Good evening. Hello? Good evening, um, Desmond and Tony. Yeah. Yes, sir. Um, 
Tony the guy talking about was um was Gonzalez um Tony Gonzalez. No, no, we we, we got Jamie, Jamie, Tom Jamie, Jamie Thomas. Thomas. The oh, name oh, right. Jamie Thomas. All right. All right. All right, Viso call me back. And I'll see you there. Viso call back. And Kenny, the audience want to know why Jim Reeves hold are on, not. Hold on. Hello, good evening. Sure. Oi. Oh, um, oh God, what you name boy? Come on, the hill, boy. He didn't mind gospel too, boy. Who's that? Uh, who sing about that? Luta? Delamo? No. Um, Bill Chotman? Mami, uh, go back to school. Uh, no. Mami, Mami. The, 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 the Bill Chotman? Bama? Yes. Bama or Terra? Bama. Bama, Bama, Bama. Yeah, Bama, yeah. Okay. For sure. All right. Yeah, Bama did a, a little thing down in the, in the last time. Okay. Hey, Viso. Okay. Yes, we said as man. Oi. Good evening. This is Tony. Good evening. This is Vizo. Rootsman. Rootsman when I've yeah. got spell too? Yes, I think Rootsman. No, no. This well, is Vizo, Vizo. Yeah, that Vizo, Vizo. Vizo on their yes. voice. Yeah, remember she did that oh. thing with her voice. I see you, I see you, I see you when? Fry Saturday morning when I change the tire by the tire, man. I see you stop on the corner there. I was going to in, you know, but... Vizo. <laughs> Behave yourself, and that's all I understand. It's Friday. Friday, Vizo. <laughs> Friday morning. Okay. Right, yeah. darling. It's you, Friday yeah, yeah, morning. Because yeah, yeah. she's down in the street later. I know where she is. All right, darling. Yeah, it was Vizo. Um, I, I, I don't think, um, whatever you call them, have, 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 have Baron? No, Baron don't, don't have. Right, and you would know. You know what I mean? And another man who... Who would have been Leroy? Leroy don't Cali, have, don't, right, okay. don't, don't Valentino don't have. have gospel. Valentino music? have, yeah. Oh. Birds that fly high. Um, um, um. It have another one. I'll play fast to leave, though. Okay. Yeah. Um. Um. Uh, hey, Kenny Phillips, we go. We will await. We know you might be busy and whatnot, but. We yeah. want to know yeah, why. To we know want to know that. why Jim Reeves now with Hello, girl. all the people in Good evening. Hello. Good evening. Can he? Yeah, you have to answer that. Kenny, Kenny. Kenny. Castle no bother Jim Reeves. Kenny. Only you can't call and stay quiet on your station. Why did you choose to sing Jim Reeves? Right. What happened to Mahalia Jackson? <laughs> yeah, we want to know. We want to know. Good evening. Yeah, there's all. Yeah, I'm Joe. Hey, what's up? I don't know if I'm just dead. All the call Jerry name. Yeah, yeah, man. yeah. Hey, yeah, yo. Yeah, yeah. Dining too. And um, I try to remember Esther, that your brother who died. Oh yeah, boy. Um, what they call him? Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He, he, he a big guy. Yeah. Um, I did a lot of work for him, but um, oh, something died. Yeah. I forget his name, man. Show. No. All right, I yeah, remember yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, but Esther yeah. brother was Sean was Daniel was a sing. Well, right, Sean, Sean Daniel Cross. Well, no, he, he, he was always, always he was that. always he that. was always that. Yeah, yeah. All right, brother. Yeah, brother. Mm. Kenny, we have a minute on the line for you. Why Jim Reeves? After we went through so much with slavery and everything, why Jim Reeves, not Mahalia Jackson? <laughs> Hello. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. What about preacher? Yeah, yeah, preach have a, you yeah, will preach, pre you will preach, you know? We'll preach have a, have a album too, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, and and the uh, partner will sing Jaji by he, he and Wendy too? No. Nah. Not that Bring I know about. Bring him as Brother Marvin. Brother Marvin, not, not that I know about. Like Kenny. Who's that? You sure? Hello? Come in, Kenny. Anybody call us? Rolf? Yeah, yeah, Rose. Long yeah, time. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Dead Valley. Can you leave the land? Anybody call Jimmy Cliff? <laughs> Good evening. Good evening. Um, I know it's only a little one, Tony squeezing, but in Chuck, that's the dual. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah we, we get Chuck, that's for full. Chuck, yeah, 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 that whole yeah, Sam Key, yeah, whole yeah, album yeah, with yeah, all yeah. them nice yeah, things. Yeah, cool. All right, so, um, Whitney, 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 Phipps. Phipps as well. He's a, 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 a singer. Yeah, Whitney the, Phipps. The, yeah, yeah. I think he was some somewhere in Labo or something. Can he do not be ashamed? Can he call me now, boy? Good evening. Can he? Hey, yeah, 
Well, 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 <laughs> All you're good, yeah. anyway. <laughs> All right, go and play at Saint Finn by Sunday. You go see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> ah, go down and play that dog day Sunday and see what happens. <laughs> see if Gary himself can come for you. <laughs> There are, there are plenty of songs that we 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 we, we miss we, out we miss out but but in holy week we go try to bring that energy bring and, it, yeah, and, yeah. and hopefully if the audience mention it we can still touch it yeah okay um i'm i'm not a mackerel guy i know what trucker get a mackerel talk from right but i know pink salmon so anybody have a they, they go by the fishery and you get a little piece of pink salmon the fridge here working you can just drop it off just drop it off that is all I go prepare it and get Desmond. I'm, I'm doing that pink salmon for you. In, 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 in with um this oil now. Olive oil. Oh my goodness, Desmond. I don't boy. want none. Desmond. I don't want. Like none. you read my mind, boy. Yeah, I know. I, like, that, oh my. That, that's why you want olive, none. You, <laughs> pink salmon, you know. That's in, why in you want olive oil. Desmond, I be full of kings, you know. But you go ahead and eat now. <laughs> <laughs> You go ahead and eat that. Hey, daddy, food of kings. That all your kings undernutrition and under mal. No, 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 Folks, we're coming down to the end of I our... I can't share that, boy. I can't share that. No, I ain't telling nobody you're cooking that, boy. Oh, huh? God, boy. In tomato sauce, boy. Ooh. Walk by faith, tell you. Ever, ever by sight. <laughs> Let me take a last call here. Hello. Good afternoon. Tony. Oh. Yes, sir. Pink salmon is really expensive, you know. Well, that is why I tell a poor boy if he... It's really expensive, you know. I don't oh, tell a boy if he get a piece now. He go drop it off by walk now, boy. <laughs> yeah, but in a sense, you have to bake it. Ye bacon. Yes, sir. Yeah, bacon. We can put it in your um, air fryer All right. and fix it up all Hey, time. well, when you buy the two pong now, boy, you know what I mean? A, a half pong for you and a half pong for me now, boy. We go air fry it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you only that is it. That is it. I buy my salmon already. I bought my salmon. Boy, you're going to be calling for. Huh? And you buy your salmon already. Only wicked, yes? <laughs> <laughs> hey, that, yes, man. Walk by faith, never by sight. That's our time. Maybe safe train on the big extension of the whole world with yeah. Dr. John is up and a matter of fact, we are out of time. We're gone. We're gone. This product has not been evaluated by the Food and Drug Administration. This product is not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease. Experience the power of five. Experience five of the world's top antioxidants in one powerful nutritional product. Introducing to you Lviv from Ardis, the power of a drink in a bottle. Experience the power of mangosteen, noni, acai, berry, goji, and pomegranate. Experience the power of five. Experience Lviv. With the regular use of Lviv, you would experience a decrease in the level of harmful free radicals, which cause aging. It helps maintain a normal cholesterol level, helps maintain a healthy blood pressure, helps fight virus and bacteria. It also keeps your skin and hair healthy, improves your vision, enhance your sex drive, improves digestion, increase your level of energy, controls your blood sugar level, improves your memory, protects your children's health, and allows you to have a better night's sleep. Experience the power of five. Experience Lviv. Call and get invited to the Zoom. Here we go. Zoom present, weekly Zoom presentation every single week with Alkaline Pastor John. Alkaline Dr. John. about herbs, fruits, antioxidants, alkaline water, and other products is for general health information only.
This presentation is not to be used as a substitute for medical advice, diagnosis, or treatment of any health condition or problem. You should not rely on information provided in this statement for your own health problems. Any questions? about herbs, fruits, antioxidants, alkaline water, and other products is for general health information only. This presentation is not to be used as a substitute for medical advice, diagnosis, or treatment of any health condition or problem. You should not rely on information provided in this statement for your own health problems. Any questions regarding your own health should be addressed to your own physician or other health care provider. Pastor Dr. John makes neither warranty nor express or implied representations whatsoever regarding the accuracy, completeness, timeliness, comparative or controversial nature or usefulness of any information contained or referenced by these statements. Pastor Dr. John does not assume any risk whatsoever for the person listening to this information contained herein. Health-related information changes frequently, and therefore information contained in these statements may be outdated, incomplete, or incorrect. Statements made about products have not been evaluated by the Food and Drug Administration. This product is not intended to diagnose treat, mitigate, cure, or prevent any disease. Use of these statements does not create an expressed or implied physician-patient relationship. You are hereby advised to consult with a physician or other professional health care provider prior to making any decisions or undertaking any actions or not undertaking any actions related to any health care problem or issue you might have at any time now or in the future. You agree that neither Pastor Dr. John or any other party is or will be liable or otherwise responsible for any decision made or any action taken or any action not taken due to your use of any information presented.
and I joined this program in September 26 of 23, and I started taking the daily three and the sugar blocker. And thank God I went back to him, and he said he don't need to give me any more injections so far. I said you will not be giving me any more because I'm on a program that is working right now for me. And um, thank God my eye been clear. And I've been testing every morning, and it's thank God, thank you, Jesus. Do you do you have diabetes? Yes or no? Yes, I do. Oh, you're a diabetic patient also, and you're taking yeah. the injection in the eyes now. Yeah. Now there's some. What what what's your name? Spence, the union lady, as you know okay, me. Okay, the union lady, Spence. Yes, yes, not think I know you are now. Yes. So the question is, when a lot of people here listen to listen to speak about dietary supplement, the first thing come to mind is it's too expensive. Knowing your experience, that you no longer have to take injection. If somebody were to say to you that this is too expensive, how would you answer that question? I would answer it, do you like yourself or your health? Would you like to continue seeing or lose your eyesight? And which is more important, your, your health or going blind? Uh, that's that's a very interesting answer. And the final question, the people, a lot of people ask, well, that stuff is fake. We don't really believe it. It's fake. You're only trying to sell me something. Knowing your experience with the product, how will you answer that question if somebody asks you? Somebody asked me that question. I have proof because I have a note from my doctor who said don't need the injection right now. And most of the time I say to them is that because I would like to live longer to see my kids and also my grandchildren when they come, I will prefer to spend that money on myself to make sure I continue with good health and get rid of diabetes if, so long as this program is working and it is working for me. Right. And I look that up and I cry many mornings when I can't see out of my eye. So, which one do you prefer? Make a choice. The money or your health? Well, I, I thank God for your testimony concerning the sugar blocker. And um, may God continue blessing you in Jesus' name. Thank, thank you. Thank you, Bye -bye. Pastor John. Thank you very much. Bye. Wow. What a testimony. Um, 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 this is directed to, I'm sorry, I'm gonna, you know, I'm, I, I just really want to get... the sugar blocker. How long have you been having fibroids? I've been having fibroids over five years. Wow. And yes, and it shrink a little bit and come back up. And it never go away. And now that you're taking the sugar blocker, do you, you feel that you're getting better results? Yes, I feel, this, I feel the changes in my stomach. You feel it, the, the changes in the stomach? Yes, and now my pants, I, I usually be a size 16 in pants, waist. Yes. And then, then I went to 18, up to 20. And now I'm back down to a, 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 a 18. Since I started taking your medication, I dropped the pounds down to size 18. That, that's amazing. That's really amazing. That's a very pleasing and... Pl now... Yes, yes, the challenge we have in selling these dietary supplements. Because I'm the next person and they will tell me it's too expensive. What you say to a person when they say it's too expensive, how you really answer that with your experience? I would say you are not expensive because, for one, BioLife. One, they said, when I first ordered from BioLife, they sent me a detoxer. 
as a one-time thing. You have to, we have to be careful calling other people's name, but go ahead. No, yes, and I used to pay $1,000 every three weeks, and that was breaking me. Right. When, I, when I stopped with them, um, they, they didn't send me the detox, detox after the first go, and I realized, and I asked, the, and I asked somebody who worked there, I said, what what my diet should be? They say you can eat anything, and I was like, this is not true. So I quit the company, went to New Species. They was a little bit better. Their price was like a hundred and fifty dollars more than what I paid with you. And I started with them. Their their stuff began to work, and they said, Odessa, do not eat meat. Leave the meat, leave the starch, and the medication will work. I said, fine. I bit off a meat and starch for at least one year and six months. And the five, and I taking the medication, the fiber wouldn't go away. Huh? So I said, this doesn't make any sense because I'm paying 600. And one of the medication was the Queen Nanny that they sell into a small bottle. And the Queen Nanny, it, it, it's like they give you a supply of 10 for $658 um, every, it, it, it used to be like um, every month the medication would last for but the only but, but the only medication that works with the, with the entire set was the Queen Nanny and they only give you uh, 10 Queen Nanny for that price but um, they, they give you 10 Queen Nanny, and that only lasted for two weeks. So every two weeks, I have to order 10 Queen Nanny, and I pay $300 as half the price, that as half of the price of the entire medication. Wow. And I have to take it twice a day. So when I come to you, when this person recommend me to you, because um, I didn't hear about you, and I went to Brooklyn last month, and, it, and I haven't seen this person in years. The person saw me and they said, oh, you're pregnant. And I said, no. I said, I have fibroids and the fibroids swell. My stomach was like, it looks like I'm eight months. Wow. So they said, no, 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 no. They said, I know of this person who lives in Brooklyn. And they said, Pastor John. And I said, I have his information. The lady said to me, I used to take his medication. And, uh, and the lady said, the reason why I don't take his medication anymore is because I am, uh, she's a senior, she doesn't work anymore. So she said to me, if I had the money, I would continue to take Pastor John medication. She said to me, I also try BioLife and New Species medication. And she said, it helps somewhat. But she said, when I got to Pastor John medication, uh, she said, I did numerous surgery for cancer and it the cancer just kept spreading and she said once i start passage on medication the cancer is in remission she said the reason why my cancer is in remission it does not spread she said because if i continue to take the medication the cancer would have gone away but she said because i cannot afford it that's the reason why i stopped taking it so the cancer just like oh, I stopped taking Pastor John medication, the cancer stopped right in the block right there. And she said, as much as I go to the doctor, the doctor said the cancer is not spreading anymore. Wow. And she said, I believe in Pastor John medication, and I'm going to give you his information. And that's how she gave me the information, and she said, try it. She said, I guarantee that it will work with you. And that's how come I called you and I tried your medication. So I gave so I called her back after three days taking your medication. I told her the results I'm getting. And she said, Wow. That's that's really, really an enough. I love to praise God. And I want you to continue praising God to know that so are you you happy with a sugar blocker? Is that correct? Yes. Yes, because no, I, pack, I give you yes. and yes. Will you, if somebody were to walk up to you now, without hesitation, will you hesitate to recommend them to the same thing? No, I'll tell them, 
I'll give them your information in terms you of calling. You have a lot of women, eight out of ten women, suffering from fibroids. Mm -hmm. They need help and they don't know what to do. They're always doubting. I wonder if this is good because they try so many things and it didn't work. So sometimes exactly I have what a lot of problems me. convincing them. What will you tell a person today who is on the edge? To, to try your medication because before I tried your medication, even though my friend gave me the information, I had the doubt that it wouldn't work. And I said to myself, Take the doubt off out of me because I do be, believe in God. I said, take the doubt away and try this and see if it works. Yes. I tried everything under the sun, wow. including the two other company, and it doesn't work. Yeah, we so can, we're not supposed to name companies and 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 because it's just legally you're not supposed to call a name. But yes, but, but I had to. I had to because you know I'm saying what benefit what what benefit I get from your medication. So at the end of the day, back I'm from Jamaica and I know you're from Jamaica. No, I'm from Trinidad. Oh, you're from Trinidad. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you speak like a Jamaican. Yeah, man, because I've been in Jamaica so much time. Oh God. All my church friends, everything grew up in Jamaica church in New York. Okay. I realized that also taking your medication, there's two things I could not do for the past six months was burp uh -huh. and, uh, and pass gas. Wow. And I realized that from I start taking your medication, all of the above start happening. I live in the Bahamas and went to school there for, uh, for 25, 30 years. Yes. And I country and all of my friends in the bahamas that i know and also in church they did like two three surgeries for fibroids wow. they the fibroids grow back so uh, let me tell you now pastor john once my fiber go down and i it comes out erase finish with it i will recommend the entire bahamas wow the order from you Thank because you. i'm going over with a testimony and i'm going to tell them no surgery yes. but only one person medication yes thank you thank you i want to thank and you, you and you have an international crew that will order from you Thank you. This is Woody Wait. I know you called me a few days ago. I was to call you back. I was traveling. I was so busy. But it was Woody Wait just listening. You just give me a reason why I should continue doing what I'm doing. Please do. So I want to thank you. And thank you very much for calling me and explaining to me in details your whole uh -huh. Condition how it was transformed when they start using the sugar blocker, and uh -huh. and you are very happy with it. Thank you very much. May God continue blessing you richly in Jesus' name. Amen. Oh, praise the Lord! Praise the Lord! Praise the Lord! As we continue to broadcast on this testimony, I totally against anyone from using any company name on the radio. But she make it part of her testimony. Statements made about products have not been evaluated by the Food and Drug Administration. This product is not intended to diagnose, treat, mitigate, care, or prevent any disease. Don't care what I tell her, don't call no other name of products. She's still calling other people name. We really don't intend to give anybody name, but I have to make a disclaimer. I don't agree with it. But God bless you, and God bless you with the testimony. In Jesus' name. This year is over. Oh, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. So you heard the testimony, and this is what really gave me <laughs> encouragement to continue to pay for these live broadcasts that I normally do and come on the air over and over to serve people is the testimonies that come in, came in. And in, the, in taping testimony, someone would say, why you don't invite person to a studio and do studio recordings and do whatever? No, nothing is framed. Everything is done live, however it says. And, you know, she insists to name the names of the product that didn't work for her. So we cannot agree with it because you're really not trying to 
talk about somebody else's product. It is not my ammo. I don't need to talk about something I don't know about. These products, I don't know them, and I have no comments whatsoever. People choose them, and may God bless you if you choose another product. Maybe God bless you with it, and may God bless everyone. But what I can tell you today is the sugar blocker. Every single person needs it. My number is 516-286-7079. I am saying to you, every human being, that you speak to needs the sugar blocker. I wish I had the sugar blocker when I was diagnosed with cancer. Because if I had the sugar blocker, a matter of fact, cancer feed on sugar. All disease that you have is too much sugar. The average amount of sugar every human being needs added sugar i'm not talking sugar from mangoes and oranges and come from the from the from the tree sugar from pure organic corn and everything i'm talking about my added sugar you know i'm i am i am here talking about and appealing to people telling you that sugar is evil i am hoping that you come to your senses I came to my senses one day. You know the prodigal son story is in Luke chapter 15. And many, many preachers, we preach and the whole thing, we preach about storm, 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 yes, about what he did and what he didn't do. But one of the great things in that story that you cannot miss, he came to his senses in, chapter, in verse 17. He came to his senses. And when I came to my senses, I began to put the right stuff in my body so my body can alkaline itself so that my body can heal itself i am cancer free i am and i wish i wish the sugar blocker was existing back in 2010 i wish it was existing before i wish it was existing when i was small you ever hear this song i know rebecca from small hi <laughs> rebecca no I wish I knew it. I wish they were had it. Because God made this world and gave us 70,000 different types of trees and, and herbs to feed us. It's all micronutrients to, 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 to fix and regulate your gut microbiome. To make sure the microbiome, you see, you want to know what's a microbiome. You want to know where the brain is? It's on your head. Where, where your heart is, it's on your chest. So where is the microbiome? It's all over the system, included the gut, because all disease starts in the gut. And as a cancer survivor, boy, do I wish we knew. But scientists have made breakthroughs today, knowing for a fact that it's 100% natural. It's sugar-free organic free oh, sorry it's organic soy free dairy free no added sugar no artificial flavors we talking about the sugar blocker power pack it is so powerful it's the dietary supplement of the century you say well what about the leave eve i still have it maybe i'll i'll play a commercial for you in a minute with it and let you see that we still have it what about the water we still have it how much things you want me to talk about? I only have one hour when I come to speak. You want me? To, oh, you want me to pay for five hours? And, you know, let, let me leave that there at the doorstep and leave it alone. I'm trying to behave myself today. I'm trying to behave decent, you know. We just go out and misbehave. And they, Somebody said, letting down Trinidadians. It, uh, I'm, I, 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 the shame to be a Trinidadian because Trinidadians don't behave like me yell and scream and all kind of stuff so i'm trying to be all right my number is 516-286-7079 so you heard the lady talk about fibroids and the fibroids eight out of ten women in childbearing age is diagnosed with fibroids it is so large that it, no a matter of fact, it is so troublesome, some of them start like a little P, P-E-A or P's, and big as a melon. 
This fibroids you're talking about. It's like you're going to the beauty parlor every minute. You go and cut it, and when you finish cut, it grow back. And you can't get out of it. And listen to me good. I am telling you now, heavy, irregular, and prolonged menstrual bleeding. You become anemic, pelvic pain, constipation, frequent need to pee, infertility, recurrent abortion. I am telling you right. That's why I'm telling you. All the ladies that wait a second in childbearing age, you could be my daughter, you could be my granddaughter. Call Papa John. Call me at 516-286-7079. I can help you. I can help you with all that menstrual pain. If you have a family with fibroids, your mother has fibroids and your grandmother had fibroids, you likely to you 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 likely to get it more than anybody else. The sugar blocker power pack has the ability to induce apoptosis in the cells of uterine fibroids. You just heard the testimony. Fibroids gone. Some of you singing, where the money gone? Where the money gone? No, it's not where the money gone. It's where the fibroids gone. I am telling you right now, if you have hemorrhoids and everything, whatever it is that you're doing, because this act is antifungal, antibacterial, call me anti-inflammatory, antihistamine, antiviral protection shield for the body. So could we talk about diabetes a little bit today? It's called die or be this. I am telling you right now. An appointment with Dr. John will change your life. If I'm a Kaisonian, you're going to name me mighty sugar blocker. Sugar blocker. Make you feel better. Feel better with sugar blocker. Sugar blocker. Is the oh yes, it's the favor to feel better. Sugar blocker. Yes. I'm the Kaisonian. I tried to make a oh you want from me. I trying to make a Kaiso. And it's supposed to rhyme. Oh, it's nothing good timing. Well, I am Rex North. You hear about Rex West and Rex East. I am Rex North. No, 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 no. I am Rex South. That song better. Rex South. So the music gone South. Feeling better. With Shega Blocker. It's a favor. Shega Blocker. Make you feel better. Yes, man. Yes. Da long dang di ding di ding dong dong dong. Long da dong di ding dong dong dong. Long do dong di ding ding ding. It think something, but it's serious. Because here's why I want I want to draw your attention. I want somebody call Mommy, Mommy, come and hear this man. This man singing chopping is on the radio. You need to listen to him. And when she comes, she hear with a sucker. This is what you're gonna hear. Diabetes is a chronic metabolic condition wherein the blood sugar levels in the body remain high as the body fails to regulate it. Sugar blocker make you feel better. Insulin is a hormone that plays a vital role in the disease. Listen to me good. I want everyone, let me take a deep breath. One, two, and three. If you ever have these symptoms, it may not be diabetes, but if you have one or two, watch out. Monkey say cool breeze. Symptoms of diabetes and you don't know it's coming on. Abnormal loss in weight, which is commonly seen in people suffering from type 1 diabetes. Increased weariness. You ever see somebody, you ain't do them nothing, but they're weary, they're all the twitching and all kind of stuff. You see the woman walking in the street and you say, oh God, look how she's walking and whining. I think it's weariness sometimes. Sexual dysfunction in men. That's why if you buy the sugar blocker, we give you the sexual dysfunction for free. So many men walk. 52% of men cannot have erection. 
52% coming home every evening and hear the children talk and, and hear somebody, the, the little child singing Kaiso for them. Daddy, a man in your pajama suit. Daddy, ashamed to tell you, come, let me tell you the truth. Daddy, daddy, I'm speaking the truth. Look, a man in your pajama suit. You ain't gonna have that again. Erectile dysfunction. Diabetes cause skin itching. Vis blood vision. Sometimes you're getting blind. You can't see. Diabetes people are prone to various infections. Something all is wrong with them. When they say, oh, we're going, boy. We're going, girl. Whatever. And they just don't know what's wrong. Cuts and wounds take long to heal. I am telling you right now, pain and dingling in the feet and hands which commonly seen in people suffering from type 2 diabetes. So the gut microbiome sugar blocker power pack may help diabetes it has because it's anti-inflammatory properties that help in suppressing chronic inflammation that cause due to diabetes i'm telling you call me at 516-286-7079 it is yes call me right now i am telling you right now call me 516 Two eight six seven zero seven nine for the sugar blocker. If you know evil sugar sugar is, you go stay away from sugar. I'm telling you, if nothing wrong with you, you need the sugar blocker. Every single person, I'll play testimony. The testimony is coming in every single day. I have an ex lady call yesterday, but she said she was she was walking when she come. Sometime tonight, she will call and give me another testimony again. So the testimony getting bigger and bigger and bigger. More and more testimonies concerning the sugar blocker. This sugar blocker power pack serves as an antioxidant that helps to reduce oxidative stress in diabetes. The sugar blocker power pack lower blood sugar. The sugar blocker power pack can repair the pancreatic cells and the benefit in type 1 diabetes, which is an autoimmune disease. It can reverse pre-diabetic. It, it lowers the cholesterol levels. Sugar loves to feed and cancer loves sugar. It reduces heart attacks, heart failure. So therefore, you need a sugar blocker. Power. In fact, every single person that lives in Trinidad and Tobago, man, woman, and child, two bad guys, need... The sugar blocker power pack. That's why my number is 516-286-7079. What is it saying? It texting me. It take a put I don't put water in my mouth to speak, boy. You see, it's only a yes. A woman will never call and ask me that question. You see? It takes a man to ask something like that. I will I don't put water in my mouth, boy, to talk. I'm telling you like it is. I am the mighty sugar blocker. I have I have a war on sugar. If the man bring it, listen to me. It's such an evil thing that, okay. If your boyfriend or your husband call you and say, Jezebel, you're going to leave him. If he call it Delilah, you're going to leave him. You call it sugar, you start to laugh. What, what foolishness is this? Who the hell is Kim? What nonsense you talking? Who the hell is sugar? What? What are you talking about? Don't let the man call it sugar. By definition, it's no good. Hey, water. Can I have a drink? Hey, berry. Hey, sweetie. Hey, honey. No, not. Yes. Even that might be able to pass because it could mean it's sweet for something else. But not sugar. No, no, no. Look at me with my big belly. It's to see me now. When you have cuts and can't get healed, we give you the sugar blocker and the microbiome cream to put on the gangrene and the toe and everything that is rotting off. 
you have a rotten toe. You have, your foot rotten in the water, cut off your foot. Call me, 516-286-7079. I, would, I, could, I could help you. I don't want to, I can't give no guarantee. I don't know what you're doing or what you're not doing. Some of you might call me on the last minute whereby next week. Tomorrow they're cutting off your toe and you're calling me now and I can't get it to you right away. But give me a chance. Give it a chance to fix it. Because the microbiome fail in the skin, on the toe. The toe didn't get enough blood so we can help you fix the womb. It may help with kidney disease, anybody and dialysis. It said die in all this. I can help you. I am your best friend. Do you understand who you're talking to? I have this sugar blocker power pack. If you're losing your memory, you can't remember things. We have this sugar blocker pack. We can include the, sh the memory charger. You're looking to lose weight. You buy the sugar block blocker. We can give you the fat burner. You have the viruses. You got so much scars on the lungs that is treating you so bad. Call me. I can. We can eradicate all the scars that leave from coronavirus and the lungs. And you're coughing, and you don't know why you're coughing. And you cough, cough, cough. You have one cough. You got two cough. You get three cough. You get five cough. Don't tell me to go there. I skip the number. I'm not going there. So you have yes, leave from three, and we skipping. We don't like that number. We taking that number, and throwing it away. So we not go repeat that number on the radio. So you have one cough. You got two cough. You got three cough. You got five cough. Six cough. Seven cough. Eight cough. Ten cough. Thirty nine cough. But 51 cough. We we not going with that number. It has no nothing in our vocabulary. Nobody can ever say I call a number. So therefore, the sugar blocker power pack could help you with cough. Could help you with a five cough. And your 32 cough. And your two cough. And your one cough. And two cough. And two cough. And two cough. Two, 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 two. But not that number. If you have that, don't call me. That particular number, don't call. We have to skip it. It's not in. We don't solve that number. We have all kind of cough I can solve. One cough, two cough, three cough, five cough, six cough, eight cough. Call me. If you have that number, uh -uh, don't call me, please. The sugar blocker power pack benefits in diabetes complication. It may enhance the functioning of these cells and stimulate insulin surrection. My number is 516-286-7079. Somebody, I get a call from somebody in Trinidad, I think it was Friday. Say, nobody go buy from you, you too jokey. Everybody, people don't believe you're serious with your stuff or whatever. That's fine. I thank God I'm a cancer survivor. It's not me that's sick. I could help you call me at 516-286-7079. And I'm serious. The natural anti-inflammatory agents that help chronic inflammation in diabetes. They call it diabetes. That's why I say call me now. 516-286-7079. Call me now. 516-286-7079. I'm telling you right now, this is off the chain. I think by next week, we want to talk about weight loss and virus again. and Because too many people have the virus and the coughing and all kind of stuff. So we go, we, we, we come into every single thing. So many people drinking bad water. The sugar blocker power pack, the gut microbiome sugar blocker power pack work as an antioxidant and reduce oxidative stress in heart disease. So if you're suffering from heart disease, listen to me. If you have erectile dysfunction, if you can't stand up for, what should I say? 
Stand up for the national anthem. Call me at 516-286-7079. This sugar blocker power pack has been proven to reverse. It may be proven to reverse diabetes. If you have poor blood circulation, it can't get in. It can't go. You're falling and it can't get up. Your wife laughing at you. Chinese P children calling me daddy. Call me at 516-286-7079. If you're singing something like somebody on the horn, man. What goes around? You're praying for, okay, you see you? I know like what you're doing to me. I know you go come back and, and haunt you. I am telling you, call me. I can help you. You have kidney disease. I can help you. 516-286-7079. This sugar blocker power pack may help with the endothelium, the lining of your red blood vessel. It may protect and even repair the lower portion. Oh, you know, I forget to talk about that. Acid reflux. So many people sing it fire, fire, in she wire, wire, ay, 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 oh, yo, yo, oh, yo, yo, oh, yo, yo, because you have acid reflux. You're taking all kind of medication. They're looking with cameras in your stomach. The sugar blocker power pack. You have diabetes. The sugar blocker power pack. You have fibroids. The sugar blocker power pack. It will help you. It could block the sugar from damaging the endothelium, the lining of your red blood vessel. It will block the sugar from damaging the pancreas, the insulin producing cells that produces insulin for the body. So the body now could regulate itself and start accepting insulin as normal again. If you have a stroke, I can help you with the sugar blocker power pack and the one for the brain. It may help a stomach upset, menopausal heart flashes, menstrual problems, hemorrhoids, conjunctivitis, uvitis, glaucoma, cataract. The sugar blocker power pack may help lower the high blood pressure and it may help stimulate the immune system. The sugar blocker power pack may help to ward off the flu, reduces chronic inflammation, reduces the risk of heart disease and lower the cholesterol. The sugar blocker power pack may help treat the onset of diabetes, diabetes, tuberculosis, dizziness, blood vision, chronic cough. Remember I talk about cough? Only one type of cough you're not calling me for. Call me at 516-286-7079. If your cough is a one cough, if your cough is a two cough, if your cough is a three cough, if your cough is a five cough, and a six cough, and an eight cough, the, that number is here, Skip. Please don't call me. I don't want no order. I don't want your money. Keep it. Muscular pain. Macular degeneration, dizziness, low energy, non-communicable disease, joint pains. Oh, like I get a text. Oh, you call yourself a pastor and is that how you're behaving? You're cussing and you... When did I curse? I said one cough, two cough, three cough, five cough. Man, sister, I don't even know what you're talking about. Oh, you go, yeah, she go pray for me now. All right. Thank you. Continue praying for me. So they say a box... <laughs> <laughs> no, honey, I didn't backslide. I still serve the Lord. She think I backslide. I didn't say it. It's you backslide. Because you using the number. I tell you, don't use that number. Low energy, non-communicable disease. Joint pains, allergies, cramping, stroke. Church people coming down on me, boy. <laughs> they want to beat me. I can't even come to Trinidad. Church people want to beat me. Chinese people calling me daddy. And church people want to beat me. Chinese children calling you daddy while church people want to beat me. Church people want to beat me up. Panic attacks, blood thin, heart burns, diarrhea, constipation, rapid heartbeats, heart attacks, anxiety, H. pylori, cold sores, depression, loss of memory, the gut microbiome.